This will be every run I have ever done, uh, as far as I can remember. Uh, the way we're doing this is I am pulling it from Spinner.com, and I am also pulling the chronological order from my Twitch VODs. I've been amassing Twitch VODs for about the past six years or so. I don't scandy. And I'll be trying to run an order of that. It's not going to be a hard order, because obviously some things need to vary. Um, but this is going to take a while. Uh, this marathon, I don't know how long it's going to take. If I had to estimate, if every game is about an hour, that's about 160 hours. Um, which, some games are really short, some games are really long. I don't actually know how long this is going to take. But, for a while, I wanted to do something larger. I think speedrunners as a whole have gotten lazy. I think there's a lot of things that are just grinding one game. I think that there's not a lot of ambition when it comes to the hobby. And I want to push forward. I want to do more than that. So, I don't know how long this is going to take, but we're going to be doing every single game I have ever done in a row. Um, in terms of stream duration, ideally we're probably going about maybe 10 hours per day, maybe more or less, depending on how we're feeling per day. Um, really, it's not going to be a hard 10 hours. It's more going to be around that time. I'm going to look at what games we need next and if we need to go like for the next game or not. Uh, I will be omitting a few games, uh, at least at the moment. Uh, like, I... For the Wheel of Games, I normally do not include the games Walsing Gromit, I do not include Luigi's Mansion, I do not include, um, Undertale, there's a Scooby-Doo game, I don't plan on doing it all. Um, I do not do Amnesia the Dark Descent, and Claire. Outside of those six games, everything is fair game. Anyway, chat, the rule is... Every game must be completed. It doesn't have to be a good run, it just has to be a run. Monday, thank you for five gifted subs. Went to No Chance, Jane in the Box, Kakaduma, K Corona, and Special. Enjoy the emotes and the decision, thank you. I need to know how roughly how long it'll take. Assuming every run is about one hour, uh, about 160 hours. However, some runs are much longer than one hour, and some runs are much shorter than one hour. So about one, uh, about 160 hours uh, estimation. I don't actually know if it'll take that long. I have no idea. And we're gonna keep going till it's done, and we'll be going in the order uh, which I learned games for the most part. However, it's not gonna be entirely dedicated that way. So, with that being said, after we beat every game, I'll be ranking it how I see fit as a horror speed run. I'm gonna give it a standard one to five. One being a uh, bad, absolute uh, zero to five. Uh, zero being the absolute worst, uh, absolute trash, while five being magnifique. I do want to mention this is in the context of horror games. If you're gonna be a loser and you're gonna comment on like YouTube or something, because I'm gonna upload these to YouTube too. Uh, if you're gonna go like, oh my god, this isn't Mario. Mario's better. I don't give a fuck, dude. I don't run Mario. I run I run horror games. Obviously, it's gonna scale with horror games. So in my opinion with all the horror games, we're going to rank them. I might do a comprehensive list at the end of this. We shall see. Anyway, back to where it all began. And chat, back in 2017, I went to TwitchCon, and I was so excited. I wore my favorite clock tower shirt. I got this back in 2017. Everything I've done today has kind of been a, uh, yeah. Anyway, no resets either. Let's go. I don't need that. Wait, what am I doing? By the way, you can hear the audio, right? I think you can. I just don't need that. Horror games and crappy games. Weird games makes more sense. Anyway, chat, as a streamer, I never really knew what I wanted to do. I feel like a lot of streamers need to kind of find their way as they go. And back when I started speedrunning, I famously say I wanted to learn five games. Uh, these five games in total. Uh, by the way, we got good RNG, so that's at least a good sign. These five games in total were Super Mario Sunshine, um, Bioshock, Psychonauts, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories, and Clock Tower. From all those games, uh, Clock Tower was the one that kind of stuck with me. Um, I picked this game because I had good times with my friends. We're doing Ending S. Uh, by the way, for Category I saw, though, this is a good question. I'll be running what I consider is my favorite category or the main category. I'm not going to just pick a shorter category like, oh, we're done with it. No, I'm going to pick a category I think is the category I really like running. The and for this game, I got to say it's Ending S. This is definitely the main one. Uh, Clock Tower, oh my god, I can spend ages on this game. Really, it's just... Yeah. 
Yeah, this right here, the Bobby Skip, is the first speedrun skip I ever learned. The whole idea behind it is that you click on the staircase, and then you're able to actually avoid dying to Bobby. You run through him, and it's awesome. And, um... That was the first ever speedrun skip I ever learned. I was actually really excited doing it. Death by Pi, I think it's been over 12 months. Really the golden season the emos. Thank you, well, a fun time. No, I, I might do a jokingly battle of man, but the intended category that we have the few is going to be we all fall down. But I will do it jokingly. Like, I, I might add in a joke or two for flair. Like for Clock Tower chat, if you really want the car ending, we can do the car ending. I am excited for the Clock Tower remaster. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun for Lexon. I made a video about that actually on YouTube. Um, so. No, we have EQ as a meme category that's like five seconds. If that's the case. Yeah, I'm drinking Boston. We're just starting. No, I'm not drinking a Grimace shake. I don't think I have any more of them. Inscription will be moon percent. It'll be the category where you kill the moon. That's the category I really like running a lot more, and it's the one I really actually ran. I did the other category once. Anything else in the inscription than that? By next Friday, it'll be two minutes, yes. Now, with each game, I'll talk about it as it comes. So that might be a better way there. As I'm you. Pink bathroom. Oops. It'll be a good break to do the really quick runs at the full fledged ones. Depends on how it's gonna go. Really depends. Had to be the pink bathroom? It had to be. I can't say I'm surprised. But yeah, uh, there's not a lot of uh, speedrunners who do ideas like this. Um, it looks not a lot of people run a lot of games. But with Clock Tower, hell, Chad, as you know, I probably defined uh, arguably my whole channel and a good chunk of my life dedicated to this game. It's really weird. Um, there's a new game coming out. I don't know if I'll be involved with it at all. I don't think I will, but uh, I'm so excited. Thank you, Gert. So. Any big door rando in this? Oh, a door randomizer already exists. People don't really do it. And that's that, thank you. I don't think- Oh shit, there's a bubble. Hey look, there's a glitch. You just, uh, click on the door and Of course. This is terrible RNG. By the way, the hardest game I honestly think might be... For resets? Corpse Party. In general, Alice. Mouse Returns, I think is the hardest game I ever learned. And I don't even know if I'll be doing all the tech in that game. Longest game will be Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories, most likely. Oh my god, this is the worst RNG. Don't you love it here? It is, yeah. And especially I'm not looking forward to, of course, Party. Not Ghosts and Goblins, but I played on Squire. So, um, realistically, yeah. And also, it'll kind of be a, uh, as it goes sort of deal. Um, like, Nightmare on Elm Street's gonna suck, but there's actually a trick you can do to make it easier. Uh, Spookies is gonna be fun. Uh, Fourth Party's right here, too, so we're doing it this week. It's gonna be rough. Well, I got best RNG. Thank of the fall, by the way. I actually did get the best RNG for the, at least the statue, which is good. I did run Illbleed. Again, not all the games are on speedrun.com, but a lot of them are on my YouTube and my Twitch VODs, which is a better way of categorizing it. Uh, oh, it'll happen as it goes. Chat, I'll mention what games I'm pro- oh, hold on. What games I probably plan on doing as we go as well, so you don't have to worry about that. That was when it's actually doing good. There's a new clock tower coming. It's a remake of this game, or a remaster. Shadows of the Dam, that game's easy. It's just like three hours. Also, my hair is like weird. Nice. That's better. That's game. Well, the main thing is I don't want to dwell on future games. I want to focus on the game at hand. All this will be uploaded to YouTube. Yeah, chat. Clock Tower really was my life for a long time. I don't want you to forget about the current game, chat. Because there's going to be a lot of games throughout this. Future games will come when they come. I'll try to mention when they come on the list. But we're going to be focusing on the game at hand. And yeah, Clock Tower was the first game I ever done. And... I'm really happy and excited for it. Well, my hair doesn't look the best. Maybe I should wear my hat. I like my hat. Like my YouTube? Exclamation mark YouTube. It is findable through that. 
have a lot of hair. So you just, ooh. And they arrive on the list. I like that one. Alright, that's maybe better. Hard to say. Chad, maybe I just get back my hat. There's a reason why I wear the hat. It's cram all my hair in there. I don't have to worry. Although I did tie my hair up a lot. I could do that too. I was wondering if Jack would be doing good today. Have you made though? Maybe I'll chop it off. Yeah. Honestly though, as a speedrun, Clock Tower is actually not bad. I really like this game. There's a reason why it stuck around as much as it did for its first iteration. Uh, I kind of mentioned it, chat, but obviously, like, for anyone wondering, what game are we starting with? You know it had to be this one. There literally is no other option. There can't be another option. This game quite literally changed my life. Which is kind of funny, because, like, I know, like, on a lot of ends, uh, especially on, like, YouTube, uh, they don't, like, Clock Tower doesn't always work. But this game, I enjoyed quite a lot. Uh, I will upload this on YouTube, yeah. And I'll try to make them more edited. Like, at least I'll pop just all the runs, but we'll see. Octar 3. Well, there you go. And why is it all floating? Magic. All I do with the Clock Tower remake is ass. Most Clock Tower games are ass. It wouldn't matter. I don't really care about the negative, Johns. Why would I? Do I care about right now? You possibly rocking a hat. A lot of people keep wondering, what if something's terrible? I mean, you didn't have it in the first place. What am I going for? Ending S. Ending S is the category I always ran. It was my first ever speedrun category. So it makes sense for going for ending S. There really wasn't any other option to pick. And for the remake, yes. Fire Prince, I'm going two months. Enjoy. You most of the season. Thank you, I'll be doing good. Approximately how long is Marathon going to take? Um, I don't know. Follow oh, me, you're the tier 1 for 16 months. And cost by her? I don't want to. Thank you for the tier 1 for 16 months. Enjoy the emotes in the series. Thank you. Hope you're you doing good. Definitely cosplay Chad, her. you know what's fun about Clock Tower 2? Um, I've read a lot of games. I've had different amounts of impact as we go. And one of the impacts I had was I really helped get the route down. I've been in the Prime game for 26 months. Enjoy the emotes and the scissors, and thank you. Hope you're doing good today. Also, cheers. But back when I ran this game, I, um... I kept wondering, why don't people do the tech skips in more areas? Why not try getting that there? And with that, I actually managed to have tech skipping get done in more areas, and it ended up saving a lot of time. Uh, and then, funny enough, afterward, we realized that there was a task already doing everything that I found. I didn't know there was a task. I didn't know what tasks were. I got looked into by other members of the community, and we found out that, wow, we have literal minutes to save. Because uh, we never had to talk to the dad. Uh, before I got into the clock tower, we actually talked to the dad because we thought we had to. Apparently, I just had to talk to the bag. Probably me. My hair is pretty long. I've been growing it out since late 2018. Or, no, late... Wait, 2018? Yeah, 2018, I think. Yeah, 2018. I was in Blood Rush. I'm doing good. Chat, again, you'll be getting every game I've probably done. If you're, if you're wondering, will I do blank game? It's on my Spear.com profile. Probably, yes. For the most part, I don't want to answer yes, I'll be doing blank game every time, because then we'll just not focus on the game at hand. We're going to focus primarily on the game at hand, and then, you know, I'll tend to let you know what games are coming along what day. If you are curious, uh, go from my oldest runs to my most recent runs. Uh, that will pull up the grand list. My first spring bathroom reset? Uh, yeah, it's just all the time. I did not speed on Deadly Premonition now. Chat, I'm gonna save you, I'm gonna do a solid here. This command, exclamation mark speedrun, has every game I have ever ran for the most part, barring a few. You can find them all there. I've not played Splatter House now. Also, this has been the hardest skip uh, in Clock Tower. The dog skip. Learning that skip took a long while, Chad. Like, it was not easy. I kept dying when I learned it. 
It's one of those things that you don't think something's gonna be nearly as hard as you think it is, and then it ends up being much, much harder. So. It's kind of neat with that. But that killed me a lot. Hell, back in the day, when I, I tried running Clock Tower at various marathons and stuff, and um, that was always the thing that I would worry about, the dog skip. Nowadays, it's literally free. I don't miss it anymore. But I guess it's because I've been running this game for so long that it just ingrained in me now. It'll be not so spectacular. And I'll, I'll be make sure you... I want to like have a nice little... I'll probably just going to do like the grand long VODs and put those all on YouTube throughout the course of this thing. And that should be a good way of doing it, I think. One can help. Ow. But the whole reason I wanted to do this, this really just goes back to the class of streamer, man. I want to do more of streaming. Funny enough, right here, too, a lot of runners would actually die to this part. I don't know how much you have to match the QT. That's a healing mine. I never died to this one, but it was fun. Oh, Clock Tower as well as my OG splits. Back in the day, I wanted to do all the inside jokes. I have a lot of funny splits. So whenever you start, you really want to emulate just things that you like, which makes sense. I have much of that, too. Thank you for seven months. Enjoy the most of the city. Thank you. That's Clock Tower Mobile. It's okay. Then he's dead. Chad, for you as well, I'll give you one run of the car ending. Why? I think it will be fun. I might get my hat back. Oh wait, actually, yeah, that's not bad. I like that one, okay. I like that one right there, that's good. Yeah, we're almost done with our first run realistically. And then change about the franchise or game itself. I <laughs> would make less terrible games. I love Clock Tower, but there are like one. There's one good one, and then there are like there's one mediocre one, and then two bad ones. Most of the Clock Tower series is bad, admittedly. I love this franchise, but I'm not going to deny that it's mostly bad. But in terms of death in the elevator, you didn't find out the truth about Mary or Bobby. A lot of people assume it's RNG for some reason. It's not. I don't know who's pushing that lie. Probably plebs, but yeah, it's not RNG. You just know the truth about Mary or Bobby, and Bobby. I should say and. If you know the truth about um. If you know the truth about Mary, you can get to the top. If you don't know the truth about Bobby, you can't even get in the elevator. Clock Tower Mobile is included. But Chad, by the way, yes, I don't really know how long it's going to take. A lot of the games are like two minutes. However, there's also a good chunk of games that are also eight hours. It's one of those things that I can't really estimate it properly. It's really awkward. Clock Tower 3 is bad. It's not good. Like, it's fun. It's campy, but it's not good. There's a lot of problems with that game. It's memorable, but it's still not a good game. It's a rough game. Anyway, Chad. In case you were wondering about Clock Tower, I can break this game down for you right now. Clock Tower... ...is a 4 out of 5. As we hit the final split, I can confidently say I think Clock Tower is a 4 out of 5 speedrun. If you wanted to put it into a tier list, this game is easily A tier. That was a caveat, you're doing good. This game is very easily an A tier game. I, won't, I don't quite call it S tier because I think there's just a few elements that are kind of annoying. But it's short, it's sweet, a lot of fun elements to it. Uh, there's skill expression. You actually have speed tech in it. Uh, the main issue becomes with uh, brutal RNG. Uh, RNG is fun, but, you know, having your whole run get decided by that can be kind of rough. As a cabbie. As well, I'm... Uh, when I say uh, a 4 out of 5, this is only applicable to the SNES version of the game. Any other version of this game is not a 4 out of 5. It's like a fucking 1 or 2. Why when and click speedruns are kind of a rough area. They're not all amazing. Some are. Most aren't. The SNES version has enough unique tech with tech skipping, uh, bobby skip, uh, all the like dog skip. Uh, you can actually break the game to a fundamental difference and kind of, you know, it has a charm to it. There's uniqueness, which is something that's nice. Anyway. One game down. About 160 left to go. 
though. The army streaming Undertale? That's because I don't do it anymore. I don't plan on doing it anymore. I haven't ran in a while for a reason. One down, many to go. However, before we go to the next one, shot. Before we go to Franbo. Clock tower is an ending where you go to the car. I'll show it that to you because it's two minutes. You go left. The follower alert ending. Well, funny enough, you have to wait out the whole credits to actually get it. So if you want to see the ending entirely, follow the channel. You thought two friends had to live? No. You have one friend living. One of your friends will always die. I'm not doing a blindfolded, no. We're gonna focus on the game at hand, by the way. When you get to the other games, we'll focus on them when we get to those games. I'd much prefer if we actually, uh, do that one. By the way, if you try to unfollow and refollow, it doesn't play alerts. It's only new follows that does it. Just as a heads up. Anyway, you do Bobby Skip again. Try that. Oh, I like how I messed up. That's fun. But yes, only one friend has to live for ascending, and you have to save that friend. The follow age? A little bit. They did it for the meme. I thought I think the sub age takes priority over that. But yes, chat. For the most part, though, I would like to focus on the game at hand. As fun as it is to look forward to future games, like when they're not even on the radar yet, like. I mean, we'll get there and we get there. But otherwise, you'll keep looking into the future. A lot of you have to appreciate the now. Anyway, if you're wondering what h ending is, yeah, just wait for the car. That's it. No, because I don't like my layout look bad. Let's see. I don't know this clock tower SNES. Love this game. It's quite one of my favorite games I've ever played in my life. This game has quite literally changed my life, and I like that quite a lot. The games on the list for today in order of when when you're and they. Pretty much I'm going from mostly older than newer, there's gonna be some exceptions. I'll be taking it day by day. Uh, my friendly neighborhood's the last game on the list, so I have the last game there. Happy birthday, Gert. So, today's games are probably gonna go to about maybe Fatal Frame or Resident Evil 1 Remake, I think. Probably Fatal Frame, but we'll see. Just because I don't really know how long, like, some of these games are gonna be. Like, Clock Tower's about, looks like 20 minutes. Rambo's probably gonna be about an hour, uh, about two hours. Homecoming's gonna be about an hour. Arcade's about an hour. Mount about 30 minutes. Slimeyer's about 40. Mighty Master's about 40. Dead Rising's about 40. Sonic 2's about an hour. Outlast's about 10 minutes. And then, yeah. No, I think the channel 26 months. Enjoy the emotes and the scissors, and thank you. By the way, the category is literally just get the key and leave. That's it. Anyway, chat, I probably should have done some homework on this, but you know why I didn't? I'm stupid. Also, by the way, sleeping. No problem. I probably should make a command. However, people don't read commands either. But that's okay. Also, in case anyone's wondering, is this a sub goal or anything? No. I felt like doing it. Anyway, there's your H ending. You talk to the car three times and you dip. That's why it's so fast. In fact, I should probably do this. There. This is the power scare of the scissor man. Yeah, but uh, again, you have to wait for the whole credits, so I'm not going to do that. Reason buffs to Sadako? I haven't played Dead by Daylight in a while. I don't really have a whole lot of thought on that. I'm not going to lie to you. I've been doing good. Just started. About to see. Anyway, chat, there's number one. You don't remember this run? Chat, according to my uh, notes here, I have not ran this game. You haven't seen me run Frambo in years? I don't know if you've even seen me, chat. I haven't opened Franbo since 2018. Not many of you have watched me do Franbo. Why? I haven't ran this game since 2018. So unless you were here in 2018, you have not watched this game. A stop I may have, but only 2018 viewers would have watched this game. There's no speedruns? Oh no, there are. Uh, I even have an old VOD. I just haven't done it in a while. So, uh... 
Yeah, it's been a while. Anyway, do I have uh, chapters? No chapters unlocked either. Awesome. Oh, chat, I don't remember a thing about this game, but you know what? We're gonna get a rundown of it. So. As the case. I can also pause the timer if needed, but I feel like having a total time would make more sense. Anyway, chat, before we begin, let's actually talk a little bit about Ferrambo. Brando was apparently the second game I ever learned. I played this game because it looked cool. I liked uh, the ad on Steam, and I really liked it. I thought it was charming. It reminded me a lot of like Alice Mass Returns vibe, which was fun. So, um, yeah. Uh, I ended up stopped running this game though, just because I wasn't a huge fan of the run. Uh, it's a point and click game. Kind of funny how I saw point and clicks. Uh, this game famously had eight minutes of talking to a tree, which, um, yeah. Eight minutes of talking to a tree. Same devs friend. Same devs friends. Also, going back to the Sadako stuff. I mean, I'm glad they're buffing her, but like, admittedly, I don't know a whole lot about Sadako and DVD. Um, I used to play Sadako, but like, I just haven't played DVD in a while. I've mostly been playing Vanilla WoW, and even then, I just kind of went to bed and me after the stream yesterday. I was tired. It should be fun crafting. Anyway, I think we're all back from the ad. Uh, I'm making an ad during the game. Hopefully we won't. Anyway. Let's go. Franbo. There is a lot of dialogue mashing. I really hope I remember what dialogue choices to make, because I don't. I don't at all. That's why it's on League. I haven't played League in a while. There we go. We get a purse chat. There's a purse item down here. Alright, uh, examine. Oh, Franbo. She didn't draw first blood. Exactly. Now she finishes the game. I beat this game. You take drugs, and it's a point and click. So luckily, I don't have to ever use my actual hands. And then pills here, and then she just passes out. Oh no, it's spooky. Yeah, but it's kind of wild. I haven't ran this game since 2018. Uh, my run was two hours, and I think everyone on the leaderboard beat my time, but I'm still the moderator of Frambo. Why? Well, someone's got to moderate games, right? Anyway, chat, I'm mostly going to be freeballing it. So, um, oh god, let's go. All right, uh, not there. Do I remember the answer? No, I, I know what to do, I remember what to do. Uh, break you, grab the hook. We're gonna tell her it broke, I'll steal her stuff. Did I burn out slain? Yeah, I did. Yes. I like it, you're awake, good. Yes. <laughs> uh, there we go. We're gonna tell her I broke the window. I'm just saying, it's kind of base, Chad. Wait, where's the medicine? Friend, grab, grab the medicine. Oh, go talk to her. It's been a while. Uh, there we go. Have a good night, Wonder Greek. Have a good time grocery shopping. All right, now I can steal her stuff, Chad. Oh God, you know what the funny part is, Chad? There's a box in here. You know what the answer is? Uh, I know the answer. Uh, the answer is, uh, five, four, I think it's eight, nine, eight, nine, five, four. There we go. And we're all in the prime Not gaming for 12 months. Enjoy the emotes and the scissors. And thank you. Pride. Hope you're doing great today. I don't remember these stairs, I'm not gonna lie to you. Wait, I don't remember these stairs. Wait, this is new. Wait, I don't remember these stairs. These are new stairs. What are they adding? Oh, wait, this is the Unity version. I forgot, they added a new Unity version in this game. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, wasn't you. Wait, was it this thing? Oh, right. I just, like, there, right, hold on, got the needle. Ms. Scarlet Tanager, the raid. Hope you're having a good day today. Alright, I got the needle. How oh, was the stream? Hope you had a fun time. Alright. Ignore that guy. 
I just dip. Uh. Hold on. Wait, what else do I do here? Oh god, do I not? Why do I not remember? Oh wait, the key. That's right. That'll be a good stream, Miss Scarlet. Open, Fran. Open the thing. Open the thing, Fran. Thank you. Uh, there we go. Yeah. By the way, if you're wondering how much do I, uh, what am I doing here? I mostly remember how to play the game. Keyword mostly. There we go. In an hour late, it happens to the best of us. Hey, look, it's some guy. In an hour late, all good sound. These things happen. All right, do I remember what to do with this child? I want to steal her crowns. Give me your crowns. Need the crowns. Uh, here we go. Until the same fire dozen time, the guy's you dead. That's pretty awesome. Hope you had a good stream. Yeah, if you know I'm a Scarlet, she's a lot of horror games. It's fun stuff. Uh, okay. Oh, we had fun. Yeah, I'm doing every... By the way, Raiders, welcome on in. I'm doing every single game I've ever ran in a row. And I've not ran Frambo since 2018. This is a vintage of Dices game. That was my job, Blade. Uh, I want to find my cat. Uh... Hold on. Give me the crown. Give me the crown. I need one of your crowns. Come on. Theft is needed. It's mine. Oh, can I have it? There you go. Oh, I have the Connor to give me the crown. Why don't you just give me the crown? Uh, hold on. Hold on. In a Fran row? Uh, yes. Uh, hold on. I had to break her out of jail chat. Uh, oh, right. I have to... Oh, wait, hold on. I, I know what to do. Uh... Yay! Bandages. Now, chat, I get to commit theft. Tell me it's not theft. That's called, uh... What's the word? Wait, anything in here? It's got a little check. Nothing, right? No? Alright, we're good. Yeah, you call it theft, I call it based. Not there. Oh, God. Marathon? Long marathon. Sometimes you're gonna the heebie jeebies. It happens. Borrowing? Yeah, we're borrowing it. Called being a Chad? I agree. Alright, we're gonna tell this man I want food. Uh, there we go. Oh, did I twist walking? It's pretty powerful. I was in Ross, so we did good. Ross, remember this game? I've, it's been quite a while, hasn't it? Deny the crown. That being said, Sean, in case you're wondering, where do I rank Franbo for speedruns? I don't. <laughs> this game is like two out of five at most. <laughs> okay, let's see. Uh. This child, like, wants to watch television. Ah, this still is paper. Never Ending Nightmares is better than this game. Because Never Ending Nightmares isn't an hour long. It's like half the length. Chat, now we're gonna steal this man's paper. You see, me and this fat kid have a lot in common. We're both hefty lads who acquire paper. <laughs> uh. Anything else in there? Oh, his head exploded, chat. Uh. Later. Uh, hold on, I want to steal this man's stuff here.
I want to take all the games in order. Oh, it's a work in progress. Uh, it didn't take super long because I'm doing it day by day. Because I can't do it all at once because uh, I have a lot of games that are going to be community voted. Because I want community voting to still be a thing. I think it's fun. Uh, Final Fantasy XII, what a trip. It's a cool game, Damasco. Alright, let's see. We're going to steal this man's sword by this way, chat. 96 plus hour? It's going to be a lot more than 96 hour, by the way. Just a heads up. You see, the child has been fooled. I'm going to take his sword. New. No. Alright. On, oh, is this one of the drugs? Give me your drugs. Annie, I know you have drugs. Annie, are you okay? I know you have drugs. Let me acquire them. By the way, she says she has a magic trick that makes you all sleepy. The trick is drugging you. I'm not kidding, watch. I will give magical stuff to make anyone fall asleep. Uh, I imagine maybe not, but... Uh... Alright, and then also the little guy just vibing there. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Alright, uh, give the man drugs. Hold on. Wait, why can't I give him the drugs? Dude, take the take the drugs. Why can't I give him the drugs? I don't remember why. On the table? No, I was supposed to give it to him. You know, chat, I may have messed up a little bit. Oh wait, I was supposed to be a dick to him. It's fine. I'll make it work. I'll make it work. Okay. Okay, we're gonna have to look around. I've kind of uh, got to myself into a pickle early. Let's see. Have a good one, Strawberry Princess. Sounds good. Enjoy the lurch, Asana. I think I can do this. Hold on. Wait, I'm missing a tool, I think. What am I missing so far? Yeah, what the hell am I missing? It's not the bear, right? It is Nelly Q. Hope you're having a good day. Oh god, what am I missing? Is this the person from the marathon? No, Clock Tower was. Is it the bear? No, it's not the bear. Not the child. Now, hold on, I'm missing something. No taller Jason? He may have been just he may have been. He just needs some green here. I think we need green. Where it is. Let's see here. What's not the lemonade? It's not this child. Oh, wait. I think it's a child. I need like, one more item that ties it together, I think. Also, you can have green. Why not? Ah, oh, it's a Rambo Rachel. I'll be doing good. I have not ran this game in a while. It's been a minute. Cause I have ran this game. My actual memory of this game is going to be kind of uh, lacking, I suppose. The bear? No, it's not the bear. Hold on. Range really bright? There's a reason why I don't really like... Oh, it's the sash. That's right. Okay. 
There we go. Yeah, I don't really, green's not really a good color on Silva. If you want me to remove green, I can remove green. Like, green doesn't look good. That's why I don't, that's why I don't allow, allow it normally. I think now I can get this guy the drugs. Yeah, there we go. Wait, no? All right, uh... Like a cake eat it, uh... Uh, hold on. God damn it, I feel like I'm drugging this man, chat. I chose the wrong drug options. I messed up. Well, like I said, we're gonna have... You, do you know how to give, them, give the man drugs? Let's see. As a rip run? No. There's no way to. You're not gonna soft lock the game. You're not gonna prevent a game from totally soft locking. I just, yeah, you know, we're now in slower option. Wait, Annie, do you have any more drugs? Hold on, Annie, I need additional drugs. Nah, I have no more drugs from her. No, no, the game's really good at not letting you soft lock. I think I just throw coffee on the guy, alternatively. Oh, God, yeah, Lone in the Dark's gonna be a rough one. See, chat, you just throw coffee on him. You know, the McDonald's hot coffee case really fucked with people, man. That shit was hot as hell. How much Alone in the Dark do I remember? I actually remember a good amount of it. The problem isn't remembering Alone in the Dark. The problem is that game's fucking difficult as hell. Like, I remember it. It is not easy. Yeah, want some? Nice. I got monster energy. Is it outside? Oh, I don't remember. I'm with 3D glasses reward? We haven't had that in years, Palowi. Hey, so is the name of the no! gift sub debut. Going to hold on. Uh Pinchi Lolo. Enjoy the emotes in the series. Thank you very much. Hope you're doing good today. Oh, do you, the remake? Well, the remake's not out yet. So, uh, probably the original one. Wait, where the hell is this key go again? Wait, well, I don't remember where this key goes. Oh, God, Chad. It's been, my age is showing with Frambo. Like I said, we're going to be hitting some rough spots, Chad. I haven't spent on the remake yet? It's not out yet. Wasn't there a remake? No. That's not a remake. That's just a... What's the word? It's not, I know it's not a remake. It's an entirely new project. Wait, I have the stolen key. Wait, where the hell did I go? You gonna watch me suffer? That's fair. Ah, the vents. That's right. Fran, I know you need the vents. Hold on. Aggie with the raid. Welcome, Aggie Raiders. I'm uh, doing quite a lot of games today, and I'm trying to remember how the fuck to play this game. I haven't played this game in actual years. You ever played Frambo so you can't help? I don't remember jack shit about this game. I swore it was here. This is a game where you're on drugs, and I haven't ran it in years. Welcome, everyone. I have a goal, everyone. Welcome on in, Raiders. My goal is I want to run every single game I have ever done. Uh, however, I don't remember a lot of the games. So I'm going to be struggling through a lot of my old games, because I want to prove myself I can still do them. And right now, my god. Oh, God. Miss Clock Tower, first game of the day. That's how I did it back in the day. Hope you had a good stream, Aggie. What are you doing today? You're doing uh, Elden Ring. Right, hold on. Where the fuck do I use this key again? 
I don't actually remember. Hold on. It's like a stolen key. Examine. Friend, why don't you look at the key? Oh my god. Oh, the ring bullied you again? I know that feeling. The ruins are great. I have not reacted. It's been so long. I could have sworn it was out here. Like, this is the only door, but... God damn you, friend. Open the door. Thank for the follows, by the way. But yeah, I have 160 games on the docket. I don't know how long it's going to take, but it's going to take the course of many, many streams. And, uh... God, how do I not remember? Is it, is it this one? It might be this one. Friend, you suck. Oh, God. It's not this one, is it? There we go. I hope you had a good time. This makes you feel old. Me too. Uh, there we go. Hold on. Blame Fran? I do. I, I could have swore. Oh, god damn it. It's like an activation thing. And then at some point, the vent opens. Hold on. Uh, okay. There we go. There we go. Yeah, it's like Among Us. That's right. I knew I was right. Okay. And there's the most scuffed course party. Or Alice Master Returns. There we go. You think a parrot and the hero probably spells. But yeah, it's a neat idea. And Aggie, I mean, like, I feel like I don't really grind a lot of games anymore. And there's so many games I haven't revisited. I want to revisit them. So, by the way, apparently uh, the fourth ever game I decided to learn as a speedrunner was Sant Holy Arcade. Because my ass went to a round one and um, I, I sped ran it while I was at round one. I paid a lot of money. I think it was like, well, not a lot of money, but like round one money. Oh, wait, I already have the game done. Yay. Look, it's literally Satan. Right now, we're on two of, like, 160. Stan, the very same bait cake. But yeah, can we get another shot for Aggie, by the way? Aggie's a good friend of the channel, chat. Also, wait, Aggie, uh, you and Parky going to TwitchCon, or you got your stuff yet? I hope you do. Always fun stuff. By the way, Aggie, I have good news and or bad news, depending on how you feel about it. There is a white castle in Vegas. <laughs> why is Satan torturing Fambo? Well, I mean, yeah, why not? Only 160 left. Only 160 or so left, chat. So confused. There we go. Chat, I can't believe it. You're telling me Satan's not good? Also, 25. Uh, hold on. Uh, hold on, I'm dumb. Forty-two, thirty-four. Okay. That's right. Uh, wait, what? Am I enumerate? I am enumerate. Oh, I'm fucking stupid. It's 39, 34. What? What was the answer again? Alarm code. Uh, 39, 32. Oh my god. What? Am I, wait, hold on, am I enumerate? That's 39, 12, or 17, 39. 
I could have sworn that was the answer. On December 17th. Today? Oh, yeah. It is, it's today. What the? It, it is. Hold on. 12 17. I don't remember this. 0725? You might be right. Wait, there's no O. Plan 32? It might be. It was. Wait, am I enumerate? Yeah, why am I enumerate? Oops. No, you're good, man. You're good. I don't remember jack shit out this game. I might be enumerate, chat. It might be enumerate. It's highly possible. Oh, look, he died. Chat, it only took me half an hour to do the first 10 minutes of the game. We're on great pace right now. My god. World record pace. I can't believe it. No, you're all good. It was an honest attempt saying Biggest Loser. I mean, I don't remember this game. I've played it since 2018. There's a reason why I'm last place on the board, chat. But you know what? I'm giving it an honest effort, and that's what's important. I mean, you know what? Now Framo can happen again. Why? I don't know. We're running the game again after literally years. Wait, do I have to do the mini games? No, skip this shit. Speedrun mode. Yeah, take that game. How? <laughs> There's mini games, by the way, and you can skip them. They started trying to kick me off of the board. I am the moderator. I like the old. I like. like... Of course they're not going to kick me off the board. Hold on, I thought there was like something in uh Wait, hold on, no, I remember now, hold on, I remember now. I guess this is a casual speedrun? It's casual speedrun in the sense that I haven't ran this game since 2018. Alright, the hair, can I fuck with the hair? Or do I need... Oh, I need to comb these guys, that's right. Wait, do I need to comb them? I don't remember if I need to comb them. Pause the lunar night. Uh, uh, here we go. It's neat. I'm trying to spend time moderating games I'm a mod for. Honestly, I'm pretty lazy in moderating. Yeah, I need to comb for these guys. That's right. Hold on. There we go. By the way, chat, we need to steal it from a rat. Didn't put effort in the run? Chat, do I look like I put effort in this game? Probably. If I remember correctly, I need to get the axe. I need to murder this pig. Sorry, Mr. Pig. I, you know how to do it to you. Oh, wait, hold on. Try to look a giant ant. If so, Brown, make a deal with the devil. Well, she's making a deal with the giant ant right now. Does he count? Yeah, yeah, I know. That was a fun video, though. Ow. Okay. All right, chat. We're going to be cutting open Mr. Pig. Looks like a flea. Well, it's a beetle pig. Half beetle, half pig. You know, I actually really like games like this. I don't know, I really like puzzles and making uh, the ability to do this. Uh, I can do it. He's awfully happy to murder this man, chat. Anyway, death. Wait, kill him. Ran, murder him. Oh, right, I have to entice him with bowls of something. How did I make this pig knock out again? I don't remember. 
Kill him? I will kill him. Alright, no, 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 I gotta wake this man up. Wake, wake up, wake up! There we go. Sleeping? He is sleeping. Alright, hold on, we're gonna murder this man. Okay, you ready for the eight minutes of mashing, by the way? There's eight minutes of mashing at one point in this run. That's why I don't run it anymore. Alright, let's see. All right, chat, we're gonna use an American door opener on this man's house. I've ro I'm robbing his house. There's glue. I'm gonna take the free meat. Dude, I want to train barbecue again. Last time I went, I didn't have a gr I didn't like eat all the flaw food because I was really sleepy. I kind of could go for more KBBQ chat. Morning, Peralt. All right, chat. They murdered the exterminator. Now I've taken the exterminator's bag. One free ticket. And a mousetrap. And for the fall, by the way. Poor child, chat. I don't know what to do here. I thought I just bully the child. It's not bullying the child. I thought it was. I could have sworn I was using the glue. I think I just mashed, mashed this. Oh, no. You... Haha, <laughs> got his ass. Mine now, dumbasses. All right, stolen their stuff, chat. That's one thing you beat it, Smith. I'll be doing good today. We call that breaking and entering, chat. You know what I call it? We call it based. Anyway, time to feed this man so I can kill him. All right, ready? Death. Wait, no. K k friend, kill him. Thank you. Ice of the century, and then a murder to free a rat. This game is one giant fucking fever dream, by the way. I mean the poor pinecone child? It's funny. And kind of base, Brangu. This is a weird game? It is. If you're wondering, I, I actually like this game a lot. I just don't run it because there's literally eight minutes of clicking at one point. And a lot of puzzles I don't remember off the top of my head because I ran this game since 2018. Alright, hello, Mr. Red. Like, I have not played Little Misfortune, but I probably should at some point. Anyway, chat. Get ready to spam McDicey Rat. Ready? Here it comes. Look at him! Not just a rat, but he gets combed. Nope, never played Little Misfortune. I probably should. Alright, let's see. Uh... Oh, we did it. Yay! Chat, we're done with chapter 2. And now we're on chapter 2B. You love that? The rat? Me too. God, do I remember how to poison these ladies? I don't remember how to poison these ladies, chat. God, this is gonna be a lot of effort, isn't it? I think I got everything? I think that's it. I think it's just those two. Okay. I'm going to enjoy which on Lumis Fortune. It is pretty neat. Uh, give me the seed. Chat, it's the stun seed. Have okay, you tried saying stun seed backwards? You might be a bit of a jump scare if you don't know what's wrong. I gotta get stuff from outside the window. I think you have to get on the way back, though. I don't think it lets you do it immediately. So 
Sorry, Chubb, you know how to do it to you. You did it? You know how to do it to you. Look, Chad's a ghost. And a dead body. There we go. Getting a lot of resources right now, by the way, chat. There's candles. Uh, have I have a hook yet? No. Uh, tweezers. Anything else I need in here? I don't think I do. We're good for now. Yeah, she was sleeping. Chopped in half and sleeping, chat. That's right. Why are people mean to black cats? Is it because people say they're bad luck? Chat, I'm not gonna lie. I think if I didn't get an orange cat, I might want a black cat. Oh, I don't know what I'd name him. Probably Bengals too. Black cats are the best. Ooh, I actually had a black cat when I was a kid. I was really, like, when I was really young, my mom had one. Uh, I was like, baby. Oh, hold on, is there anything else? Umbrella? No. I don't think there's anything else that I need. I think I'm all good. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Did you really red? That's true. Bangles and bangles. That's actually pretty fun, isn't it? There are superstitious in them. I don't want a black cat. But the only alright, so the only reason I want a black cat is because I really want an orange cat. A lot of dialogue, chat. A lot of dialogue. <laughs> You're beginning to see why I don't run this game all the time. Wow, you're telling me that the game is mostly clicking? No way! I can't believe it. There we go. Okay. There we go, okay. Yeah, second Dr. Pepper, I hope you enjoy it, but I hope you'll be alright. Second biggest loser. There we go. Also, I was in King of Bands, you love cats? Me too. I enjoy cats. Uh, hold on, I think I go like here. All right, uh, hold on. Try to look, we're a platformer now. Holy shit. Bran, you moron. Oh my god damn it. Uh, there we go, I got the flower. Basically Mario? Exactly, basically. There's like a wooden board I need. I don't remember where it is. Oh, there he is. He's outside. See this fucker. Oh, of course. Oh, I can actually... Uh, Rural Ritualist. Oh, that doesn't sound very nice. I like Siren. Yeah, I like uh, I like Siren a lot. Froggy? It is a frog chest. You can get the uh, the cozy mode ready. Uh... I clicked out of the game on accident. Story of the game. I've not ran it in quite a while. By the way, the frog just like fucking dies. 
The man just ate the ate the bottle and died. Now, the moral of the story, I guess, is don't eat a bottle. Uh, let's see. Uh... All right, cool. There we go, chat. Look at all the materials. I like how they just got it. Also, I'm glad the frog just takes care of the evidence. And then says, you didn't see me. Forget about it. Forget about it. Red frog? Oh, no. oh there's two frogs. Alright, what was the tasty bottle? I don't recommend it. Alright, let's see now, chat. Uh, candles. Wait, don't I have chalk or ashes or some shit I need to do? I'll do it later, fuck it. Uh, hold on. Uh, okay, double check, hold on. Blood, oh, dude, I need blood. Hey, I did everything, by the way. Alright, blood. Ouch. By the way, alright, chat, I'm gonna ask you a question. How do you think Fran managed to, um, put blood in her pocket? Oh, hold on. Uh, blood, candles, ashes, flora, salt, and pepper. Uh, let's see. One moment. Uh,. Wait, do I need salt and pepper? I don't remember. Blood. Hair. Wait, hair? Uh. Yeah, okay. Anything else? To hold on. Uh, blood, ashes, bros, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I did it. I was going to doing good. I need rest. I did. Hope you're doing good today, Barcelona. All right, chat. We're gonna give him a potion. Which, by the way, I like how she made a potion. Which, chat. All right. I'm gonna give, go for you right now. Uh. For a potion, wh what do you think? Like she really made. Hold on, uh, uh. Yeah. Soup, tea, poison? Chat, I'm just gonna tell you right now, she was boiling water for a while and put blood, a rose, salt and pepper, uh, and she just pouring boiling water on that. <laughs> like... I don't think she could have said anything. I think it's the fact that she poured boiling water on them is going to kill them. Oh, God. How the fuck do I remember this part more than I remember the intro of the game, by the way? Like, chat, what if they're just really dry? What if they had really dry skin and then you pour boiling water on them and then they just died? Like, fear? Not really, actually, no. Oh god, chat, time for Bioshock. Alright, do I remember how to do this? Do 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 Hold on. Hold on.
Oh god, chat. Hold on. Has to be a better- Oh, hey, I did it! Mostly. Oh, hold on. Yay! All comes back to Saw? Exactly, chat. I'm trying the master of Sawcon. And these. Something house? What about house? I like house. Separated again? That they are. They're also taking drugs. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of Fear, though. Like, alright, oh, that was like, Fear's not a bad game. Like, I don't, like, disrespect the game. It's quite literally... How do I put this? Chat, you ever just try something enough times and you know you're not going to like it? Exactly, Close Galley. What's Sawcon? It's kind of like Bofa. In a house, and the very quick so it's not die if I watch your dad. That's called house, yeah. That's just, that's just house. Chat, we're gonna ride the frog, by the way. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We're gonna give him baking soda. Chad, if you give a frog baking soda, then uh, apparently he gets large. Yeah, look up house 2020. And then. He's gonna ride the frog. Uh, let's see. Yeah! Alright, we're skipping this. Uh, we don't play frog, we can ignore that. Alright, chat, who's ready for eight minutes of mashing? <laughs> I'm being quite literal, I assure you. I'm proud of you, Crafton. Yeah, caught in the hail there, so legit. You ready? Perfect, chat. And it does, it's only right, it absolutely does. But, chat, if you want to have both of this, it's Bank of America. No Turbo Mouse? No. I'm running a JRPG. Yep. <sighs> I'm glad Satan is really uh, determined to mess with an eight-year-old girl. Also, how the fuck did Mr. Midnight think his cat strength is going to carry, like, a nine-year-old girl? Cat, there's no cat in existence that's going to be able to lift a nine-year-old girl. She's not the baby from Neverending Nightmares. The cat's not huffing creatine. All right, chat. All right, the better question. Who do you think can lift more weight? A baby or a cat? 10, almost 11. Oh, yeah, the one year makes all the difference. If I, that's going to make it worse, cat. I don't know. I feel like if you are... Right, try All right, if you pumped both full of creatine, who do you think lifts more, the baby or the cat? I think the baby wins. I'm not going to lie to you. Katie from Dead Rising 2. Oh, of course. Cat still? Really? The Lions win. Oh, of course. Yeah. You know, there's not a lot of games that you play as a cat. Lions can lift a lot. Oh, hold on. Stop it, turnip man. By the way, chat, I don't remember if I remember chapter three. This is the part I'm dreading the most about this game. Fucking chapter three. Also, are those pants or stockings? Those are long as hell. Pound for pound, your cat's stronger and faster than a fully grown tiger from the internet. Oh, chat, here we go. All right, 113.55. Ready? Count it. 113.55 is when this started. Stockings? Gotcha. Brand's a tree? Yeah, she's a tree right now. 
These are the tree people. I'm not kidding when I say it. Eight actual minutes of mashing. Chat, I can't believe we gave this old man the stun seed. Oh, he did it backwards. Unless, uh, the, I want the Unity version, though. This is the newer version of the game, because honestly, I don't really give a shit about how I'm running it. Boo, oh, units in a boo. <laughs> I wasn't kidding. Like, a lot of people thought I was joking. No. Gaming, Fran Bow Gaming. Eight minutes. Is it matching all text? Yes. Oh, here I am. I'll let you know when the section's officially done, by the way. By the way, in case you're wondering, how do I review this game casually? Chapter one and two, fucking great. Amazing. Chapter three, awful. This chapter sucks. If you get to the end of the chapter, it's good again. But this chapter blows. It's like the goes from like an awesome horror game to the never ending story, which I don't want to do that. And then also, like I said, eight minutes of meshing. It is. It is grog. Absolutely nice soundtrack. Yeah, chapter chapter three blows. Like, chapter three absolutely blows. By the way, Chad, I know what you're thinking. We haven't left the section yet. Also, yeah, they changed the main mechanic. You don't use drugs anymore, and you have to use, like, a seasons change thing. Like, it really feels like a different game. Come on, man. Quit talking. I want to mash. Is it going to tend to eat? Well, uh, the problem is one hand needs to keep mashing, while the other hand, I, my left hand chat. Oh, I don't have my flashlight on. What the fuck? Well, I should probably charge my phone. I got some Twitter likes, chat. I can feel good about myself for one brief moment in time. And then there's been annoying symbolism. So the main symbolism is it's quite hard to say what exactly happened. A lot of the characters represent real life characters in the, you know, there's like dualities and shit. I said 113.55, right? This might be faster than it originally was, by the way. This feels faster. Because I do know they made changes to the Uni version where I think text is faster now, but you don't get the speed run skips, quote unquote. But uh, even with the Uni version, uh... all right, chat. It was about four minutes of mashing here, so it literally chopped in half. That makes sense. But yeah, about four minutes of mashing right there on the Uni version. The original version was eight. Can't you feel good all the time? Uh, wait, what do you mean? What part side clog? Feel good about which? In which sense? I feel good a lot of days. All right, loser, time to lose in a uh, tic-tac-toe. I feel good usually. Uh, it depends, unless you're trying to hair. It depends on my end though, Cyclog. Usually, uh, I don't really feel bad about the way I look hair-wise, I guess. Let's see. Oh god, chat, how do I cheat in tic-tac-toe again? I don't remember. Hey, I won! Dumbass. Alright. Wait, do I need five or three? I think it's five or three. Oh god, I don't remember. Dumbass, I could have won. 
There we go. All right, two. Guy sucks to Jacto anyway. Even still. You fucking fool! Wait, am I just dominating him, dude? This guy's a jobber. God, this is like that time I went to Evo and I went seven ten. Just like that time I went to Evo. I went four, right? I need five, I think. He's intentionally bad? I don't know, this man's whipping out the bricks right now. Beat his ass. Alright, we good. Dude, I think I've been five in a row, by the way. Holy shit, I dominate this man. Fucking beat his ass. He's one point. I have five one points, okay. Any of the game for children? You're damn right I did. Oh, hold on. What a god. Chat, there's one time I remember. I went to Santa Monica, right? You know what happened? I... What did I do? I was at the pier, and I ended up entering a game. Wait, do I not know how to do the season change? I don't remember. I went up plushy. It was one of those water games. I was playing with my, uh, my at-the-time girlfriend. You know what happened? I had to face an army of children. It was like me versus a bunch of children. You know what happened? <laughs> I won. I haven't seen Monica in years. It was good. Copium? Hey, they're on the copium. I fucking dominated. Those kids didn't know what hit them. Oh, here we go. I forget. All right, it's this. That's right. <laughs> of course, the tacular. Based? Oh, the children wanted to win, then, I mean, maybe they should have tried harder. Let's see. By the way, this guy's gonna make me pay him to fix the clock. He's a fucking prick. Alright. All them kids. Exactly. Watch out, I already said it. If I ever have kids, I'm not gonna let them win. I don't care about things like humility and being able to build confidence. No. No. Fuck them kids. You couldn't, theory. Uh, uh... I said I found you on FU video games, uh, because I didn't know if it was, uh, I thought it was lost. It happens. Exactly, a dub's a dub, Chad. I don't understand, if they finally win, they earn the dub. That's the important part. Alright, let's see now, and I can go the seasons. I thought it was winter. It wasn't winter, though. It happens when pimp. That's what how it goes. Exactly. Fall. That's when you fish. I mean, that's the case of the metal wall, though. When I was a kid, my dad never let me win. I got my ass fucking beat. And in, in game, not not really. My dad like never had like never had problems like that. I want to mention that right, really clear. My, dad, my dad's great. It just uh, you know when we played games, I never uh, got a I never got like. Never got handed to me. Oh, I need thread now. Friend, take the fabric. There we go. This merchant, by the way, has no concept of value, Chad. 
All right, now I can get the fish. I got I got beaten in game. Oh, I was good. Don't interrupt me. I was good. Wait, what the fuck did you do with the fish? I don't remember. Wait a minute. Yeah, ice cream, nice. I'll oh, check. You see this man's basket? I'm gonna fuck his basket. Yeah. Lazy bastard, get to work. Games, uh, we're doing quite a lot of them. There we go. Perfect chat. We're gonna get into the club. Uh... I thought there was like an opening over here I can do. Let's see. It's not that one. I thought it was. Is it only a basket case? Probably. Yeah, Code Alexis. We're going to be playing a lot of games. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how many, but there's a lot. Uh, I definitely know we'll probably be getting to a rough fatal frame, at least. Uh, but we'll see. Again, I don't know. Uh, we're going until we finish every game for a lot of streams. I don't really have a dedicated schedule for a while. It's kind of just, we do the games until they're done. There are about 160 or so games, and, uh, yeah. What happens, Power Cup. You know, chat, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm not gonna lie to you. And I, I'm jinxing it already. I'm having a lot more fun revisiting Trambo than I remember. I mean, I did really like this game. I just don't like running it all the time because of the, you know, I can do four minutes of mashing. What games do you miss? Clock Tower. And Frambo has been the whole rest of the time in the clinic. I'll be doing good. No, no, Crafton. So they released a new version of this game. I know that much, because I, I had a moderator. Hold on, should I? Uh, that's lemon. Uh, that's fish. Um... Um, two is lemon, three is fish. Huh. Yeah, uni version like literally like half the fucking length essentially. I'm losing entering. Yeah, it's gonna be fun the clinic. We a lot of fun. A man sleeping, chat. Alright, don't know what to do. Uh we go falling off a cliff. That is true. Oh, this guy was beat to shit. You know why I was beat to shit, Chad? Because he talked for eight minutes. I had enough of his shenanigans. Well, so you know what? Fair. Quite fair. Cliff, uh, tree person happens more often than you think, yeah.
All right, cool. Would he would flip? He might. Nah, you're good, Clinic. You're good. Uh, we have quite a lot of games. The thing is, I'm not gonna know exactly how many games we're gonna have because it's gonna be a little bit. Like, we have a lot we gotta attend to. As well, it's gonna be a lot of games I don't remember how to run entirely. Hold on. Like, a lot of this is just off my fucking head, you know? But it shouldn't be bad. Ah, right, you have a boating license now. But you're good, Clinic. You're good. God, we got to get the password. Oh, God, there's so much to do in this game. Hyper Arcade. My Friendly Neighborhood's not happening today. That's the last game on the list, by the way, Captain. Arcade will be happening today. Like, you'll see, like, there's a lot of games here. Yes, My Friendly Neighborhood will be the final game on the list. That's more Life Jagged? Probably Becker Rye. Outside the stack, that could be doing good. All right, Wizard, give me the password. God damn it, I hate this guy. Alright, hold on. Dude, I could have sworn I had to, like, activate the top of the mountain to wake this fucker up. You, wake the fuck up. Not here. Hold on. God damn it. Is the feather on that? It might be the feather. Oh, I think you're right. I think you're right. It was the feather. You're right. Keep on, I haven't ran this game since 2018. My brain's, uh... Brain's a little bit off right now. Wake up, jackass. Wait, no? I thought it was a feather. I think there's a flower that grows up here, though. Hold on. There's a flower I need, but I don't know where it is. I think it's at the base of the hill. It's this thing. Steel flower, friend. There we go. Not this one. I got the lemon already. Hold on. Yeah, we had to give it to his wife. Remember that one? It was fall, by the way. And who else has shit? Hold on. Not that guy. Can I no second game Halo? But I know I have to get, like, the password. I have to, like, wait. Where's the password at? I think the king knows the fucking password. Oh, god damn it. No, he doesn't. He's a jackass. God damn, what was the password again? I don't remember. You know, I think this happens every time, by the way. Well, at least I'm consistent. I'm dead, man. I'm confused. I'm really racking my brain to get this uh, game a rolling. I know I think in the club at one point. Uh, 
Hold on, examine. Uh, hold on. Uh, uh, a feather. Cool as I am, if you use me, I'll be burning hard. I don't know what the person is. Cool as I am, if you use me, I'll be burning hard. What was the person again? I don't remember. Oh, god damn. I remember. Duh, I'm. Duh. Duh. Alright, I remember now. Hold on, we're good. I remember, chats. I remember. Nah, nah, we're good, Armads. We're good. This is going right into it. Really enough, I remember a lot more than you think. There we go. Assuming I need a casual replay is an insult. I remember a lot more than you think. I just didn't remember the exact order. Because you have to use the match, and then this guy tells you, Oh yeah, you gotta get my fucking shit. This guy's a prick. Oh yeah, get my hat. And then the game actually spawns in. But our man, nothing needs a casual replay. Also, again, like I'm saying, I'm doing this all from memory. Uh, that's why I can't get all the dark on speedrunning. That's how speedrunning goes. There we go. Look at this man, Chad. He has a hat. Yeah, I know he have his wife. How long has it been? Uh, I, the clinic. I've not played this game since 2018. That makes sense. Oh, it's kind of nice just to have the uh, the cursed child interacting with people and they seeing the snippets of dialogue that are cursed. Like how she mentioned she wanted to drug a guy, and then like one thing she just said was yes. And how this mountain's going through a brutal divorce. You know, in all fairness, I agree with the mountain. He wants his, either his wife or a hat. Like, you know what? Relatable, man. Is Gregory a difficult run? Not really, actually. It's actually really fun. Shout out to me answering my lots. Oh, I'm, I'm so fucking lootly. That's one of the beauties of Twitch chat. Chat, as I've grown as a streamer, I have an advantage that a lot of people don't get to have. That advantage? I don't have to... Uh, what's the word? I have a lot of people who can actually help me. Messenger of Love. There we go. Alright, there we go. Cool, we did it. You know, I didn't know that mountain had legs. Should I be weirded out by that? Probably. The full story of this game is also really weird. Essentially, uh, your parents are murdered and you ended up in the psych ward. So you break out of the psych ward. And then things start happening, probably because you're, you know, doped up on drugs. And then there's a line of reality of crossing with drugs and not drugs. Which, quite ironically, I know a lot of people mention like, Oh, haha, <laughs> drugs. No, this chick's actually hopped up on medication. I don't know exactly what it is, but it's tiny red pills. Uh, I think someone has, a, like, elaborated, but, um... Sanitarium's quite accurate, yeah. Uh, no, of course. Or, wait... I don't know how to go out. I hope you'll be alright, Devman. Uh, sorry to... Sorry to hear you're trapped by a forest fire. I hope you'll be safe. Oh, shit. Sure. How much have to do again? I didn't pay attention. Oh, book. Okay, that's right. You're not even wearing the hat? Nah. See, the mountain had the idea of wearing the hat. Chad, who is this demon? Who could it be? It's Fran. Fran, I want to remind you, you did pour boiling water on two, like, teenage girls. That is a reminder, Chad. She may not be a murderer, but she did pour boiling water on them.
Uh, do I want to do in the library? That's a real question. Ah, shit. Oh god, do I remember the answer? Oh god, I wrote this down at one point. I don't fucking remember. Oh god. Uh uh shit. Where I find these games? Uh sometimes Steam. I like that. Oh, here we go. Uh, I don't fucking remember how to do math chat. Okay. I could have sworn it had something to do with, like, there's a code that it gave me. Oh, hold on. Uh, hold on. All right. Uh, it's two ones, and then uh, I don't know what that is. Two U's and an I. Hold on. Uh, that's eleven. Okay. I know that's twenty-one. Wait, chat. It's not. Yeah, hold on. Uh, one, one, two. I think I need four now. I know. Hold on. One, one, two, four, eight. Fuck, what was eight again? God, I don't remember. I think it's a U. Uh, one, two. That's you. Uh, nine. It's an E with two dots. Okay. And then, uh... Good lord. I don't remember this one. Do I? Maybe I do. I hate the wizard so much, chat. Okay. Why do I not remember this? Uh... Probably for a good reason. Dude, I don't remember anything. Oh my, I didn't think this would be a roadblock. I don't even remember this puzzle. Hold on. He was five. Okay. Uh... Fibonacci. Oh, uh, the fuck's the Fibonacci? One hundred thirty-four. Um, zero, one, one, two. Hold on. Two, three, five, thirteen. Fuck's thirteen. Hold on. So you with the thing at the top. Okay. And then numbers. All right. Uh. No. Which one is it after that? Dude, I don't remember jack shit out of this puzzle. I didn't fall, by the way.
13 is already up there. Why isn't this one pulling? What? I get the wait, that's not right, is it? It's the man with two dots. I think you're right. I think I remember that. Oh, it's right though. Oh, there we go. What the fuck? Oh, hold on. I don't remember what we actually know is right though. There it is. God damn it. I hate puzzles. Well, that puzzle. That was unnatural. Wait. Hold on. Doesn't seem very creepy. That's because we're in the tree section right now. Yeah, Chad, I've gotten the book. Uh, you know what's funny? That took me less time. I'm glad you had the answer. The brute force after a long enough time. You know, I don't remember how you're meant to know about the Fibonacci sequence. I don't remember that puzzle in the slightest. Yeah, or even unnatural. It's been a while. Let's get this man of shit. Someone tells you the answer. But I definitely didn't look at the. Actually, did I look at the answer? I don't remember. I think I did. Uh, oh shit, hold on. I'll have an accent. Okay. And now I can get the fucker's shoes. Rambo Rachel, good thing to there it is. Thank you very much. What are you most in the city? Thank you. I'll be doing good by the way, guys. Alright, chat, we're gonna steal a man's feet. Or his shoes. Okay, this late, I suppose. I uh, hope it'll be alright. Sorry to hear. Rambo Rachel, I'm getting such unnatural. Hold on. Alright, chat, this cat's gonna break in. This is what I was trying to do earlier. It's only been an hour and 20 in this run. Alrighty, let's see here. Alright, let's go. Hold on. There it goes, Chad. Now I have the ticket. And I can finally do this shit. I hope you're feeling better, yeah. Did you have a pupper earlier? Well, there you go, Black Kappa. Alright, Chad, time for my favorite part. We're gonna break uh, into the spot. Alright, wanna watch the murder of a man? Check this out. Alright, Chad, he's dead. And now we're gonna steal his shoes. I'm just saying, if you didn't want to have his shoes stolen, then maybe you shouldn't have uh, had such stealable feet. You pet the cat? Uh, definitely, yeah, she pets it throughout the game. Dance too hard? It's a life, man. I know we stole his shoes. Alright, let's see. Alright, chat, we gotta get this man's wand now. Oh god, I don't know the answer to this. Yay, I did it. Beautiful. It is MKGDX. 
Like this cat is a nice cat. Cool. Love the robot man. Robot man, chill. Oh god, Chad. I forgot all about this. Wait a minute. We have a brutal section. Also, I don't like this man. He gets clothing and then has spells with clothing. I'm sure he's an innocent man, but I'm just saying, I don't trust any man who wants to collect a 10-year-old girl's clothing. You know, mumbo magic? He might. Alright, we did it. Oh shit, hold on. Beautiful. Alright, Chad, we're doing it. You know what? I'm down to run back this game in the future. Like, I feel like I actually want to run back Frambo for once. Like, the Unity version is so much fucking better. Oh god, I clicked out the window. My bad. Hold on. Oh hey, and look, we're back to the good part of the game, by the way, Chad. Also, cat violence. I apologize. We're back to the game being good. No. Well, she is crying about it, so it's all fair. That's not the real cat, by the way. It's an illum It's a, a hallucination, Chad. She's tripping. That isn't delicious. I'll be doing good. What the hell is that? I think that's called a horror game. She's tripping about uh, harming her cat because her cat's her best friend. Also, one not there. Oh, God. Oh god, Chad, I don't remember this puzzle, but this fucker has rocks. Doing alright, can't complain. Embarking on an epic journey to run every game I've ever done, Chad. And uh, currently we're on game two of uh, 160 or so. And I hope I remember the order, because I don't. Uh, let's see. Uh... Well, that was actually really easy, never mind. Chad, am I a fucking jobber? I might be a jobber. Hold on, that was actually really easy. What was the first name? Clock Tower. It's on the splits over there. Hey, I'm just saying, my PB is like an hour and 50 minutes, Chad. Right now, like an hour 30. Like, I'm not gonna be beating my PB, but like, I'm admittedly not doing all that bad, all things considered. Kind of sax stack. Hey, we're back to the game actually mattering. By the way, Chad, I like how <laughs> they do the fucking uh the box Frambo falls to the cardboard box trap. <laughs> hey look, drugs! Chad, I can't believe it. It's how you catch the average raver. You just put pills on the ground and put a little fishing net on them. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Once he gets Bengals. Bengals and Bengals. I don't know if I want to name my cats Bengals and Bengals, chat. Oh, was, oh I answered that one. But yeah, it was uh, Clock Tower the first game. It's Sans, the book guy. No, bingles and bangles. Yeah, I don't think I can handle two cats. I don't know if I can handle one cat. Uh, now the game gets weird about realities and shit. Alright, chat, we need water and fire berries. Yeah. Okay. Hey, drugs! We're back in business, baby. There we go. 
Uh, Bengus? No, I'm not gonna have Bengus. No Bengus. Hey Chad, I got the berries. I could break my legs. I could break my legs. My old woman, get my bucket of water. It's me, Wallace and Gromit played. Uh, I'm only doing games on the Wheel of Games. Wallace and Gromit is not on the Wheel of Games. And chat, I'm not gonna play Wallace and Gromit without $5,000. That is on the list of exempt games. Just saying. Either way, we did. And the water. That's great. Well, yeah. I, the only I mentioned in the beginning, the only games I'm not doing are Walsh and Gromit, Luigi's Mansion, uh, Undertale. Uh, and then, um, a few other ones. That's not $5,000, but all things with the gift itself going to $5,000. Thank you. Thank you very much. And then as well, I still, I can't run in of the Dark Descent or a Claire anymore. It was a good attempt. What could I say? I wasn't in the fine print. I mentioned in the very beginning when I was starting this what was going to happen. There we go. Also, oh, chat, this lazy bastard make, makes me fix his ship. All right, let's do this. Uh, do I need the feather? No, okay. I do not try the screen is upside down. We'll be doing night trap stuff. Oh shit, I don't remember this puzzle, holy shit. I did it. Beautiful. Uh, oh god, do I remember to do the tubes? Oh god, I don't remember anything about this. Oh boy. Oh, there it is. Okay, hold on. Uh, okay, hold on. FM 18. Okay. PF R15 N166. Okay. Hold on. R2 PF R15 N166. Okay, hold on, hold on. Uh, 2 PF uh, R15 N166. Um, then how do the tubes go again? I don't remember. Uh, pink tube R15 to 2 PF. Blue tube. Okay. Go. Brand area. Uh, there's one more tube, I think. Chat, I need to play an ad, by the way. It's me three minutes. I've watched Twitch Tour sub to the channel, avoid it. It's gonna happen right about now. I need to remember to do this puzzle anyway, so it works out. So uh, here we go, chat. Here it comes. Ready? Ad time. Hey, was it not this one? 
Oh, shit, sure, there we go. Wait a minute, I think I'm missing something. I'm missing a tube, chat. Oh, god damn, there's the tube. I, I, god damn it. Alright, we got it. We did it, we did it, we're good. Alright, we did it. Yay! Alright, got the juice. Okay, I made the fuel. We did it. This man's a bit of rabbits. No, the juice is not loose. Yeah, you didn't. How you don't have you have your sub? You do not have an ad at all. <laughs> all right, this man's afraid of rabbits. By the way, you know what? I get it. I too am afraid of rabbits sometimes. Look at that rat! Oh wait, it's in the corner. Chat, you can't actually see it. I'm actually bot blocking. He's pointing at me. Uh oh. Oh, that's not very nice, actually. On, uh, I don't have the screwdriver yet. I thought I did. Our wrench. I'm scary? I could be. It is highly possible. Wait, I never have the battery. Shit, wait. There's the battery. Perfect. Oh, I was in, by the way, Spiner. Well, actually, I guess we'll be back once the ad is back. The ad. Hooray! Freedom! No, chat! Oh, son of a bitch! There's a safe combination I don't remember! Oh, God! That comes later, that's right. Good lord, I do not remember the answer to that puzzle at all. Hold on. Carrot. Oh, eight? Hold on. Hold on. It's, uh, eight. You're a carrot, asshole. Thank you. All right, eight, five. Eight, five, um. Well, it's not Walsing and Ramen. Eight, eight, five, eight. Eight, five, Eight five eight six. Nine. Okay. Eight five eight six five nine. No. Uh. Yeah, I did it. I'm not sure you're no help at all. Answer's not Walsh and Gromit chats, no. Hooray, we did it, okay. Beautiful. No, I wanted the actual code chat. I had the brute force answers to puzzles I don't remember from years ago. Is this to help? Yes. All 
right, cool. We're doing it, Chad. Cheater, cheater. But I actually solved the puzzle by myself. I'll swing back from the ad, everyone. Okay, Chad. We're gonna have to get to work. Uh, wait, how long am I to do again? I don't remember. Oh, uh, yeah, I remember now. I have to go up. Wait, it's not there? There's the fucker. Yeah, I'm gonna turn this guy into a gamer. Oh, wait, hold on, dumb. Oh, the raid. How was the stream? I'll be having a good time, Bob. Who always is seeing you around? I'm trying to brute force games I've not ran in years. I hope you're doing good today. Oh, uh, Sportsman, same devs. God, where do I get water again? I don't remember where the gamers get water, chat. Where's the gamer meant to get water, chat? Welcome on in, Raiders. I am McDyces. I do a lot of horror games. And I am absolutely washed. Hold on. I don't remember what the fuck I'm doing. We shall see. Same universe too? Yes. My understanding, yes. Alright, there we go. Why don't you out water, but like, you don't get it immediately. Like, you have to like, do something for it. Like, let's you take it. New, no, I never played a little misfortune for that one. There we go. That's the answer. All right, chat. Ready to kill a gamer? Oh yeah, that was most recent games. That's me at the very end of the marathon, like after the very end of everything. We're gonna have to water the gamer. Ah, uh, Slurpee. The gamer streaming is streaming. I thought the point of remember being here. Uh there's a good few people who end up uh, coming in the stream. They've coming on a raid. All right, chat. Time to make this gamer suffer. Ready? You give him a shower, and then he just dies. Thank you, Abu. Hope you've been good. You did it. Discord mod? Average Discord mod. Exactly. Now the gamer's washed? Well, that's why he left for the boat, Miss Hey, Fox. Yeah, I'm just saying, I'm actually not that far off my PB. <laughs> like, I think my PB is a two hour run, and uh, I'm like, I'm on the, I'm on chapter 4B right now, and we're like an hour 40 into this, and also like, I ended up uh, starting, like, I didn't start immediately, because I ended Clock Tower on Ending Age. I don't think I'll be behind my PB, but I'm actually less bad than I think I am in this game. And considering I'm brute forcing everything from my brief memory and the help of chat. A long game. Oh, this game's fucking long. Oh, I think the uni version does make it faster. If I was on the OG version, this would be much, much longer. Alright, chat. It's time to break into the house. Perfect. And that's how I ran this? Uh, 2018. A good song, Slowry. Yeah, uh, 2018. 
Five years ago? It's been a while. It's been quite a while, Chad. The fact that I remember as much as I do is kind of wild. I'm Red Knight. It's all right so far, Fran. I'll be doing good. Also, Fran Contell. This is Franbo. <laughs> Look, it's some guy. No, this is like the doctor in the beginning of the game. There we go. Now I just mash through everything. Oh, so the point of the game where Fran's gonna be tripping on more drugs just naturally. This is also a short chapter. And you know the story? The story gets convoluted near the end because it's kind of hard to point what's a dream and what's reality. Depending on how you see it, like, it depends on the sense of realism. Belmore the Raid. Oh, we have a nice stream. What are you doing today? I don't know though. Why are you driving in the middle of the road? Why not? Tell look, free crowbar. Hell yeah. Time to smack a club up. If I have a mod, you get a nice shout out. But welcome to Felmo Raiders. I am McDysis. I do a lot of horror games. And I want to run every horror game I've ever done. I'm doing a lot of streams dedicated to this. It's going to take, uh... I'm estimating over 160 hours. But we'll have to see. There's a lot of games, Felmore. I'll be doing it today. Also, time to break down this man's door. Is it one you need to play? I like Frambo. I, I haven't played in a while. I, I don't know if it is, Patch. Three streams at the best can be 72 hours. Also, chat, I feel bad. Uh, sorry, car fans. Fran's about to fuck up this man's decal. Imagine just taking a knife to your, uh, the car seats. Oh, I thought you were just really excited about Frambo. Wait, what are you doing today, Thelma? I've had a good time. I mean, I get it. This is a fun game. You know, Chad, I genuinely think this game might come back more. I kind of have missed running it, and the Unity version makes this game less terrible to run. You may have actually talked me into playing more Frambo. I don't know how you did it, but you may have done it. Gathering Hand of Doom sounds like fun. Like, I'm actually kind of surprised, Chad. There we go. By the way, I like how the doctor makes Fran open all the coffins. Jackass does that. Hey, I know your parents died. Dig up their graves and open the coffins. And also, here's your dead cat, probably. Also, Satan? Nice. Good luck with the interview. Thought that was a bit morbid. Everything in this game is morbid. It's about a 10 year old girl, almost 11, fighting Satine. Oh, my back's crap. How uh, rude? A little bit. And now she's chained to the bed. Alright, final chapter, chat. We're almost there. Almost done with the game. That's fairly spectacular. All right, we're almost done with the game. Final chapter. Uh. Oh, uh, I think it's a. Uh... Oh, what was the code again?
I don't remember. Uh, it's something like you gotta rub its ears and rub its ass. Uh, I don't fucking remember. Hold on. Oh, hey, there we go. Oh god, do I remember what key it is? I don't remember, but Tiny Fan has like a thing full of keys. Imagine collecting keys, chat. I think it's... Hold on. Which key is it? Uh, I think it's this one. Yeah, it was! See, chat, I remembered. Hold on, uh, I'll scream, where's the Press it by the ears, first twice to the left, once to the right. Rub only eye two times to his ears. Left, left, right, eye, eye, left, okay. Left, left, right, eye, left, eye, eye, left, okay. I hope you're answering me right, Slurpee. All right, chat. Yeah, it's time to open the box. Uh, left, left, right. I, I. Wait, what? God damn! I can't read. Uh, hold on. Uh, twice the left, once the right. Ah, oh, god damn it! Hey, I did it. It happens, Grab. What can we say? Uh, now I got supplies, and then, uh, hold on. Hooray! Now I open the cap. I think it's the wants. That's unfortunate. I don't know what to do here. There's balloons. I think I need to, hold on. I know, um. You take the button. Thank you. Here's a reference to Alice. Wait, no. Chat, here's a reference to Alice. Oh my god, it's Alice. That, that's all. Get that. And I think we're done here. Uh, I get that one later, I think. I'm trying to remember everything I gotta do. Do I need shoes? No. Time to bully me? I've been getting bullied by Franbo plenty, Roz. I deserve only the kindest of things. Uh... Oh shit, uh, inside the little house. Dude, I remember the phone number? I don't. I remember this gamer. You see, chat, this guy doesn't want soap because he's a gamer. I mean, I get it, man. What a gamer. In the bathtub and- Chat, come on, you can't just be chilling in a bathtub. You gotta use soap. There we go. Uh, fine. Give me you. I think we cool. I think it's one of the four next. Yeah. Light bulb. This man wants a hairbrush. I like the giant eye, by the way. Nice, steady. I hope you're doing good. That was an easy you did. You're doing quite a lot of Franbo. What could we say? There we go. Uh, MO choose five guys. You'll never recover. I can't believe it. Chat, we need porn off for Tech and Andrew. I'll never financially recover from this. Uh, uh, uh. Hold on.
Alright, give me the plug now. Fine. Alrighty, we're making good progress so far. Anyway, chat, what do we say to a man uh, who's trying to take this key? I feel bad for this guy. Ready? You see this guy and his poor teeth? I'm gonna teach him a viable lesson. You oh. <laughs> should have coughed up the key, fucker. We did it. Ow? Well, he learned a valuable lesson. Alright, there we go. That's horrifying? It's fun. Anyway, chat, you want to see what we do to gamers, by the way? I'm going to open this window. There's going to be a gamer chilling on the house. Right here. So, uh, eat this gamer. Fran fucking whiffed that entirely. Fran, you failed. Fran, you failed. Holy shit. Gamer. There we go. That's you? Got hit by water and then immediately fucking got launched. Take a bat. I have all the keys. Uh, yes. Yeah, Give me your clock. Thanks, lad. Dad, don't you like the cat bridge? The cat bridge is fun, chat. I could appreciate cat bridge. Bad trip right now. I'm sure it'll be fun. Cat crime? Some cat crimes, Ross. Hey, shout out the upside. I'll have no red splits tentatively today. All my splits will be red today. Cat crime. What kind of crimes can a cat commit, chat? I know, Ross, but I told you about the pedo. Pedo the cat. A felony. Haha. <laughs> uh, by the way, what's the answer again? Uh, I got everything. I say I just combine everything, right? Come on. Uh. One moment. Dark Lunar within the tomb for eight months. Enjoy the emotes in the city. Thank you very much. Hope you're doing good. Let's see. Hope you're doing your dark lunar, dude. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you. I'm in Maryland a second time. No. Uh, hold on. Uh, how do I do this again? I have everything. The case working bulb. Where the fuck did I put this again? Uh, hold on, is it this? No. Yeah, what was the order? Uh, speedrun's going rusty as hell, study. Rusty as all hell. I have enjoyed Pepito coming home quite often. It's a nice thing, chat. Wait, how the fuck do I combine everything? I don't remember that part. Uh, on the back of the drink. Oh, that's right. You throw it in the cat, then he vomits it up. That's right. Okay. All right, chat. Time to deposit everything into a cat. I'm doing it. 
Also, I'm realizing right now I'm blocking a good chunk of where I'm putting shit, but you can tell it's going the right spot. Getting inspired by having a mouth and a scream? I wouldn't say entirely, nah. I was gonna go, could be doing good. I did a brother up in the corner. He's chilling. Game on a lame mode? Sounds good. Chat, spam a. spam. spam grill. Grill's always a good time, right? Spam grill. Or rat. Both work quite well. Chat, time for the ultimate horror, by the way. Ready? I bet you're wondering, what's in Super Hell? Because obviously there's something down here. What do you think's down there if you had to take a wild guess? What goes beyond Super Hell? That's white. It's a rating room. Mm -hmm. Anime then two one for fourteen months. Enjoy the emotes and the season. Thank you. Hope you're doing good. Take dicey Leon, it's dicey Leon. Oh, hold on. Okay, here we go. Also, I think welcome back. And Anime Elf, thank you once again for the 14 months. So, be doing good today. Do enjoy the emotes and the scissors. I'm an 84. It's like the end of Beetlejuice. Hold on. You're on the right? Oh, of course. Uh. Oh, I didn't talk to the guy, shit. This loser. Alright, let's see. Alright, now I can do the mission. You have to sell this guy's ticket, and like you talk to the eye, and he gives you the tears. I remember a lot more about this game than I should. Like, it's really weird how much I remember about this game, what I don't remember. Oh, so I'm glad the giant eyeball just has a jar ready to collect tears. I guess, in fairness, that's what you would have, right? That's how it goes, Twice Spectator. What can we say? Yeah, it is like Beetlejuice. Alright, chat, we're almost done. This game took me about maybe a little over two hours. It wasn't all that bad. Not what I thought. I like how this guy looks like an ape, by the way. I don't know. It looks like the skeleton of an ape. I like all these fucking chumps. All right, Chad, and I have to call the phone number and then we're almost gonna go. I remember when I asked this number, but the details of speed run I've done in years, you'd be surprised. Anyway, what's the phone number again? Uh, on. Hooray! Oh, I'm back, Elfar, yeah. Made the appointment, chat. Poor guy lost his teeth. Also, taking Andrew. I wanted to follow up. How's your five guys? How's your $1,000 sandwich? That is the real question. Alright, chat. Look, it's Satan. Oh my god, he's the doctor. The whole time, the real villain was modern medicine. Ah! I mean, not really. Now, uh, five guys? Vogue Rogue. I didn't know you uh, you're a, uh, you're J, J.P. Morgan, Mr. Rockefeller. I can't believe you have infinite money on you. <laughs> oh, it's a chat. The plot was Fran killed her parents. Ah! It's actually pretty badass, but still.
And fries for those prices? Well, yeah, chat. It cost a thousand dollars to eat a sandwich for five minutes. My oilers in chat. If you say you can afford five guys, clearly you have an oil, like you're an oil baron. That's what I learned in chat. Uh, alright. Alright. By the way, she jammed the syringe into his fucking neck. Like, god damn. It's up in there the burger only had four guys in it. Well, Chad, that's why I have the five guys speed run as well, one of the channel point redemptions. If you redeem that channel point redemption, I go bankrupt. That's what it is. It's just, it, it just declares bankruptcy. You wouldn't want to make a poor man go bankrupt, would you? Uh, this, like, this chick's fucking insane, by the way. She just launches the cat off the edge of the world. Imagine having an actual edge of the world and then thinking, ah, yes, let's dump the cat off of it. Because he's a traitor. Although, I'm not gonna lie, there's a few things I'm worried about here. For one, I mean... How do you let a 10-year-old girl overpower you, for one? Also, this man didn't fucking hesitate. He just got out of his... He, he got the strap and shot a 10-year-old girl. And also, like, why would you even bother antagonizing the 10-year-old girl who murdered her parents? What the fuck? I mean, he, the man's strapped. What can we say? Uh, anyway, it's fine. Uh, for, for which part? I mean, I don't know why he shot a 10-year-old girl. He just had it. Don't worry, the cat lives. Chat, we're almost done with the Franvo speedrun. It only took me two hours and ten minutes, roughly. I'm just saying, for a D-Rust, this is a lot better than I thought. Cas okay? Yeah, exactly. You found that to be a convenient. You think he was just aching to shoot someone today? Like, the man just. Like, the way he was holding that, he seemed ready. He had to muster all of his energy for that. It was a fever dream. I can't believe it. He's the, uh, the, the least trigger happy American citizen. I can't believe it. Alright, chat. We're almost done. It says, let's go, kitty. It's GG. Kaz, okay? Yep. I wanted her brain. He did want her brain. That's actually true. All right, if you shoot someone, doesn't their brain stop working? Hey, the ending of this game? Yeah. Yay! I did it! It only took me about two hours and ten minutes. Because... He did it. And Chad, if I submit this to the leaderboard, I would be last place. Yeah! I mean, I still had it in me. What's this game about? Uh, society. And drugs. Person would say she actually got shot? Well, it's the miracle of mod- Chad, it's all about alternative medicine, clearly. And that's why she lived, because apparently baking in pink goo will clear a bullet wound. Game's out loss? I can't believe it. They predicted the famous comic of loss. Lost to two hours for a crabby ending. No! The only crabby part is chapter three. I like the ending. It's not bad. Game's out bone zone? It is. Chat, it's all about exactly Battle of the Man. It's all about stun seed. It's gonna have multiple endings? No. Oh, I saw the homecoming is certainly one of the games that really got me into speedrunning. Uh, I don't know why I wanted to learn this, um, but I always had a really good time with this game when I was in high school, funny enough. This is the second ever Silent Hill game I ever played. Because uh, I played Silent Hill 1 when I was a kid, and then I got more into Silent Hill when I got Homecoming in high school. 
Um, and I just have a lot of good memories in this game, funny enough. It reminds me a lot of uh, high school with that. A lot of the games I played, I just really liked at the time, which is why that worked out. But, you know, it's kind of nice. Um, you know, I guess I don't want to dwell too much on it early. But with Rambo, I'm just being reminded with all these early games, like, chat. Like, the first, like, maybe, like, up to maybe Outlaw, like, Sonal 2. Like, the first few games, I ran all these games because I really liked them. That was the big thing. I didn't really like these games. So, not to say I don't like all the games I run. You know, I run them for a reason. It's just... Yeah, I ended up wanting to run this. I'll be running this on the Xbox. However, when I first ran this, I did on the PC version. For logical reasons, we're not doing the PC version. But, you know... It's kind of neat going down that memory lane. And chat, by the way... If you want the true test of a speedrunner, I'll tell you right now. Did they make it? it was me doing Homecoming. I learned sound of Homecoming in 2017 and I'm one of the oldest runners of this game. And I learned this game on the PC version with no assistance. Nobody helped me. I did it on PC. Uh, dude, after me, have I done Home for? Yeah, it's on my it's on YouTube. Uh okay. I'm one of four runners to do home port too, which down will happen much later, but uh no. hey. Yeah, for homecoming. I'm one of the oldest runners of this game, and it's trippy thinking about that. No, no, it is rough D man. One of my favorite parts about uh the PC port, by the way, uh D Man. Back when I used to run it, I found very exclusive tech to the PC port, as in there was a seven minute cutscene. That you were forced to watch because you couldn't skip it. Uh, there was also the, uh... There was a part where the game would just freeze. Oh, wait, orange. And you had to hope it didn't freeze. Uh, here's orange, by the way, friend. Uh, I'll keep it a little longer, by the way. I'll, like, make sure it doesn't get redeemed immediately. So. But yeah, anyway, chat. You ready for Homecoming? Only one person ever touched me. No, a few people have at this point. Um, I, I was the only one for a while, and I think Schmumler got around to it. Is that a one-sitting run? Oh, shit, no, no. Duh. I'm not doing that, I forgot. It looks nice? Yeah. Alright, chat, let's homecoming. Alrighty. Josh. Which, by the way, I'm not expecting to PB any of the games we're doing, so, uh... We're doing each of the games individually, Grogatha. If you want to watch Home Poor, check out my YouTube video. Because if you watch it, I get a like on YouTube. I get a view on YouTube. That works. But I want to focus on each game, each game individually because I think each game should have its own attention to it. I want to make sure we can actually give the attention to each game that the game warrants. Um, funny enough, chat, I did first start learning New Game Plus, but I think New Game's more fun, so we're doing New Game. I really warmed up to the New Game category. And I don't know, I've been running a New Game a lot more. But I started on New Game Plus because that's the category everybody did. But admittedly, I think New Game is just a cooler category. So I like running New Game. And yeah. It's kind of weird because as much as I like Homecoming, this game's always kind of felt like I've been on the fringe of things. And with speedrunning, hell in general, chat, like... I never really felt like I got fully involved in a lot of communities. Because, like I mentioned, for Homecoming, I learned everything on my own. And by on my own, I mean, like, I didn't have anyone, like, you know, give me a tutorial. There were no tutorials when I learned the game. I had to watch world record runs at the time and just sort of piece together what the hell was going on. And then just try it on my own and find what worked. Uh, a lot of the resources for this game happened after I learned it, which is, uh... Always fun there, but that's how it goes. Hello, nurse. Exactly. Hello, nurse. But it's kind of neat how this game goes now. Also, one thing I noticed that's really weird, and as we go through this, a lot of my earliest games, I still do pretty frequently today. Like, I've been doing Homecoming a lot more lately because I like this game. I do Clock Tower a lot, I do The Rising a lot, I do Sonal 2 a lot. Like, it's kind of funny that a lot of the games I, you know, that I ran really early, I still do quite frequently. 
And I know a lot of people who run a game like years ago and then never touch it again. Like, Franbo would definitely have that. I'm not saying every game I've, I've done is going to be that case, but, uh... It is kind of nice to have games in the pocket. Nice. Do I do Sonic with Green 4 very often? I do a good amount. Uh, I do Sonic 4 more than 3, but I it ebbs and flows. It's kind of weird, Delirium, because uh, part of this marathon also came from the idea... I don't do 8-hour grinds anymore. I honestly believe that in many cases that unless you're gunning for world record or you just really are known as a competitive speedrunner, I think the age of just grinding a game for 8 hours is kind of over for a lot of people. Like, I really don't think it's as fun as just doing a bunch of games. Like, I realize, especially on my own end, that doing giant marathons um, works a lot better. People like it, watching it more, it's more fun. So, in that case, I don't really get to grind games like I used to. What are you doing here? Yeah. I want my toy. How did you get here? Some now to play in. What do you mean, be two puppets? They told me Robbie was here. They lied. Nothing wrong with that, K Corona. Hope you can find some good ones. Fine, and like, I'll definitely say. I don't think this is everyone. I think some people can really get into a game, but there's a ramp up that like. At a certain point, it doesn't work anymore. Like, you can't just grind a game for eight hours. You have to find a way to change it up. And this is where a lot of people have been doing it for years. If you're up and upcoming fresh speedrunners, dude, pick one game you like and grind that for a while. I have fun with it. But for people like me, people who have been doing this for years, like, I can't just grind a game for eight hours. Chat doesn't want to watch it. I don't want to quite do it all the time. It's much more fun to do everything. Anyway, B. No, I wouldn't say 16 hour grind. I would be. I would say 16 hour grinds are the jam. Makes sense to you, man. Well, I mean, like, I was talking about this uh, yesterday, but, like, in the case of a lot of games, like, only up speedrunning is already dead. People grinded it out for a week, and now it's gone. Uh, a lot of games will have certain lifespans that really hit with that, and that's fine. It just. A lot of it's going to be very fast on the pacing of things. You like to write stuff down or you plan just to run it and see where it goes? It depends on the game. Sometimes one, sometimes the other. Uh, usually my splits are my notes. Which, funny enough, I'm not playing with splits for any of these games. So it should be fun with that. And, um, yeah. I have notes, though, for a lot of my old games, which is nice. It's the bats on home. Funny enough, I, I wouldn't say any Silent Hill game truly hits an area of bad, though. Like, most of these games are pretty competent, believe it or not. Like, the only bad Silent Hill games are the ones that are, like, really, really weird on their own right. Like, I like a lot of the Silent Hill games. Do I need splits? Some games I might, but, like, honestly, I should be able to do all the games without splits. I definitely don't need it for most of the games today, I don't think. The only game I might need it for might be uh, Resident Evil 1 Remake. Oh my god! That's on Conquer as a monster? It's fine. Where are splits? You see the thing over the right listing all the games? It's how you keep track of the time. The thing is, splits are entirely arbitrary. They're only ever used to uh, know your own pace and your own rhythm. They're really nice for doing, and they're really nice, but, like, admittedly, I don't need them for all my games. But like I said, for games today, we're probably going to be going to, like, uh, probably, like, here? Probably Fatal Frame? Maybe RE1 Remake? Uh, it really depends on how long everything's going to take. Right, I can't believe it's the Origins guy. Honestly, the monsters are one of the best parts about this game. Easily. Nice opportunity? E-Man, no, we do the jump scare. You missed it. It was this one. It was boo. E-Man, I like getting by my own steam. I think every community should have their own own jams, you know? So I hope that jump scare didn't terrify you. Sorry, I had to do another one. You can blame E-Man, chat. Honestly, unoriginal? Dude, Scarlet's one of the best designs in all of Silent Hill. What do you mean? There was Asphyxia and a Minion. And even Sepulchre's pretty good. You're looking away? Oh, the ghost. Yeah, E-Man and D-Man? That's true. Hello? Hello? Don't worry, I'll keep it safe. Uh, that's E-Man. 
Scarlet is Aggie's cat. Wait, is Aggie's cat actually named Scarlet? I didn't know. I don't. I didn't know that. I didn't know the name of Aggie's cat. That's why Aggie had an adorable cat. Cause I've heard uh, him and Parky talk about the cat. I don't remember the name. I'm gonna go look around. You just stay. Ah uh, yes, except for a good portion of the game, the monsters look uninteresting. You mean the monsters that are literally in the other games? I think you're. I think you're coping, DML. I focus on the positives, man. And this monster's cool, what do you mean? Oh wait, no, not that. It's down yeah, downpour's monsters are hit and miss, but these games have good monsters. Ghost is too scary, it is. What does it represent then? It represents D's. There we go. D's. Go for that. There you go. Pretty much, I'm saying, I don't know, man. You can just enjoy things. No, that's the Origins. Alex is fine. Alex is stupid. Origins, the that guy. Man, it's a hard six out of ten. Since when is six out of ten bad? You, you know, six out of ten is better than a half, right? That's actually really good. This isn't the American school system. Hi, Edward Dusk. Hope you're doing good. Alex only stolen Valor. He's not quite stolen Valor. He's more uh, mentally insane. Alright, I guess more psychotic breakdown, I suppose. Which would happen after you kill your brother. There we go. Uh, Tokyo Ghoul. I feel like I've heard of that before. I know Tokyo Ghoul, actually. I've seen a bit of it. My brother was watching at one point. Either way, I'm going to focus on the speedrun route. Spoilers? Which part? Like metal? I don't care about metal music. I don't listen to it as much as I used to, but I still enjoy it when I can. That's true, Jenny Jin. That is true. Oh, so that was in Jamal. Here we go. Love metal? Nice. Honestly, if I really were to choose a genre, though, I'm a funky dude. I listen to a lot of funk. A lot of groovy music. New wave. I like metal, though, when I listen to it, but I don't listen to it all the time. I used to listen a lot more when I was younger. You know, I still do, though, just not as frequently as I used to be. Depends on what comes up. Like, I'm gonna see Ghost, uh, as that counts for anything, I'll see Ghost soon. Yeah, I probably broke your finger, I'll be alright. Oh shit, wrong one. I hope you'll be alright, Jermail. You see though, demo. The fun part is, I don't care. I like this game. You should did more? I like this game. I like what I got. I'm not complaining. It's okay to enjoy things. Damn, we've seen it go so much too hard. Sound Hall fans of Bitch and Sound Hall 2. Nothing's gonna change that. Enjoy media you enjoy, and you don't have a lot of people rag on it, yeah. This game has flaws, sure, but like, I'm speedrunning it. What's the dog doing? Getting knifed. Now, chat, uh, we haven't really been talking too much yet about what makes this game so likable for me right now. There's a lot of uh, cool speed tech. Out of all the Silent Hill games, this is absolutely the best speedrun. Easily. By the way, chat, I can tell you right now, for horror gaming, this game is sincerely a 5 out of 5. This game is an S-tier speedrun. It is an S-tier speedrun, and I can confidently say it with my chest. High praise? Absolutely. I think Silent Hill Homecoming is one of the best horror game speedruns around. And it gets easily slapped on. For what you think about a speedrun, I think Homecoming nails in every which way possible. By the criteria, 
So that's a good question, Kabano, because I mentioned that Clock Tower SNES was a 4 out of 5 and Franvo was a 2 out of 5. And I mentioned this was a 5 out of 5. So I think a good speedrun should, you know, give you a good exploration of the game for one. Like, you don't want to go straight to the end. If you just go immediately to the end of the game, I don't think it's very fun, even though you can break the game. Um, pacing is nice. Yes, pacing is very good. So, you know, you're going to be doing quite a lot. You go through the game at a nice level. But also, it makes the game a unique experience. I think speedrunning does it quite nice at making the game a unique experience in one way or another. It's how is the game changing? Because obviously, if you're going through as fast as possible, you might have things like, oh, we're going to use certain weapons because they're stronger. We're going to use certain characters. We're going to do certain tricks. And this game has a really cool out of bounds system. And it's one that's really neat in the way it works, which I'll explain it once we get there. But when I look at this game, like when people talk about various games, you might see it like a GDQ or something or like, you know, just in general for like what you want to have in the idea of speedrunning. I think this game really is one of the games that drives it home. How long is this run? It's probably an hour. Um, world record, I think, is like 30, like mid 30 minute thing for this category. My run's gonna be about 40 ish because it's really ebb and flow on the uh, on the glitches. Um, how I can't even do all the glitches. There's one trick I can never get the hang of, but it's just a short boss fight I have to do instead. But also, speedrunning is a very personal endeavor in general. It's about beating your own times and being able to do that. But I think a direct one-to-one -one gameplay isn't always the best run. Sometimes it can be. Some games really do work that way, when, funny enough. And it's going to be weird on how I rank these things because I think a game like House of the Dead actually is kind of a fun run, even though it really is one-to-one -one gameplay. As well, as different genres within horror are going to be really, really weird because it's going to be weird if I rank like, oh, why is Franbo 2 out of 5 and House of the Dead's like higher? Because I'll tell you right now, I know what, what I'm thinking about for some of the House of the Dead games. Hey, man. How's it going? And it's what the game wants to do in its own framing. So. Hey, you're and yeah, having, I think, Ray Cypher, out of bounds tricks that don't remove the entirety of the game, it can be really fun. I'm busy. And some out of bounds get, makes it wild. However, the problem too much out of bounds is it will absolutely make it, uh, you know, it becomes a different game entirely. Definitely you can use, uh, you know, a other tier list system, but like if you're wondering, uh, like the standard S to F or F to B D or whatever, like, you know, high tier, low tier, this is S tier. I think this is an S tier game. Let's go with that. I'll go with that as well. Like five out of five S tier. This is a high good speed game. Well, it's fun because sometimes both can be nice, Gen H It really depends on what exactly the way it works. Because I'll tell you right now, the speedrun without glitches is about an hour 40 minutes. With glitches, it saves about an hour of time. But the thing is, while it saves an hour of time, you really don't feel like you're missing all that much. That yeah, sounds pizza. Also, Homecoming really does prove that a game doesn't need to be a 10 out of 10 game to be a great speedrun. Better than one game, your record is valid among all countries, languages, English spoken gamers. Uh, anyone, you know, you can be anywhere you want, Albert Wesker. Uh, yeah, it's speedrun.com just takes anywhere and you can be anywhere you want. Like, it's just a general leaderboard. And also, it's pretty low entry to enter. You just have to have a VOD of you playing a game. Nice BP. That's what I said as well, man, Mike. On my end, I'm going to be ranking primarily horror games because I don't know anything about, you know, a lot of other genres. I know horror. I know horror type games. I only say with all the games I got going on, Homecoming's really high up. I might be down to like maybe a one, like, imagine a 160 to rank one list and talking about each game. Either way, I'll say right now, this game's five out of five. But yeah, so chat, here's the thing. The gun lets you go and clip through walls. I'm now officially halfway through the game. This game's also long. Yeah, we'll have to see. I mean, right now I'm definitely giving my thoughts on each game and I'm going to write them down at the end of the stream as well. But, uh, like I said, this one is five out of five. And also, you get to see a lot of cool things as well. One of the neat things here is that you get to see, uh... You have a bunch of weapons. Which uh, I learned later on. Uh, what's the word? You knew feeling like I said she was real working on a 4-speed run. No offense, you're not good playing. Uh... 
I don't know what to tell you, dude. I, 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 good for you, I guess? I, I really... I don't really care. Underrated? It is. Oh, you know what I care about? Homecoming speedrun right now. Speedrunning is entirely arbitrary. My dog has the world record for taking the most shits on my lawn. You know why? A lot of people don't take shits on my lawn. There's ending. We can do any ending we want. It's probably going to be the world. You, you know what ending will be. You know damn well what ending we're going to do. I like the RE4 re oh, remake sniper rifle glitch. I think it's a cool one. I like, I guess, sorry if I sound a bit rude there, but like, I oh, don't know, I really don't care about the grind or world of record. It's arbitrary. You can put world record on your title and you can just say, oh, try it. You know what? Every single game I run, I have world record in. All of them. Every single game I run. All of them. I ran a game, I have world record in it. You know why? The category I run is Ecdysis Runs. All of these games. Ecdi uh, for anyone named Ecdysis running Sonal Homecoming, I have the world record for all the people named Ecdysis. That's on Topaz. Well, Chad, nobody else is named Ecdysis. You can't really compete with me. It's a one out of one recce right there. Do you believe me? Well, yeah, it's a one out of one category. I'm the only person named Ecdysis running these games. But no one else is Ecdysis. Only I am Ecdysis. You ran them all? Damn. God, you can't be Ecdysis. I am Ecdysis. Yeah. Like, honestly, man, I really don't care all that much, I guess, is what I'm saying. You know all the best things you can do with chat? I don't know. Ignore it. Like, going into the case of, I guess, of Albert Wesker talking about it, if someone's masquerading around saying they have a roll the record in RE4, why do I care? I just won't watch it. I know someone's better, which, I don't know, someone probably is, because I know whoever's world record right now, and his name is Spicy, probably. Or someone adjacent to Spicy. I thought you lost in Frambo. Less bad than I thought. It was actually roughly around the estimate I thought it would be. But, like, yeah, it's arbitrary. I also don't know how they're ranking it or categorizing it. I saw last place in RE4. You're goddamn right. Well, at least in uh, normal, I think. Leon has roll the record. That he does. Uh, how's it going, Luxie Doodle? It does suck in your taste. Hi, cat. Oh, you're not Ecdysis. I'm Ecdysis. Now, chat, allow me to show you what really made me stick to a speed game. This shit right here, I would spend so much time dedicating myself to just aiming at this wall. It probably took me actual weeks to learn this in offline practice. Back in the day when I actually practiced games offline. What a mad lad. But this trick right here, I had to learn entirely by myself by watching four separate VODs of runners. Not a good idea, man. I had no one helping me. I had to do it all on my own. But you know what? I figured it out. Well, not that one, but I figured out how to do it. And now I can do it pretty easily. Why? Because I know how to do it. This is me labbing it on my own. Helped out quite a lot and made it stick pretty well. Oh, I am uh, choking a little bit here. There we go. There's just a pain to learn. It's fun when you get the hang of it. But the thing is, like this glitch, I can't really tell you how it works entirely. Why? Because the way it works is that you aim your gun at the wall while going left and right. Meaning you move, and then you aim, and then that propels you forward, and then allows you to get a little bit of a boost going on the wall. That's how you would do it. However, it doesn't work that way. Why? Because you gotta feel it and figure out how the fuck to do it on your own. I watched so many VODs of people doing it, and then I kept doing it, so I figured out a strat that worked for me, and then I found a way that it worked for me specifically. I don't. Even, I think people do different methods for that, but it's something you entirely have to feel your way through. Every glitch in this game, I never got a walkthrough. I had to learn by watching other people just do record runs. The resources just weren't available when I ran this game. Nowadays, there's a lot more involved, thank God, but that's how it was back in the day. So, I want to mention, by the way, Chad... Back when I did this, I did it on PC. Also, shout out to Voxybox for helping you remember that. I always forgot how to that puzzle, but there we go. That was a lot of cool stuff you can do, like this. Oh, wait, not that one. 
Am I doing good okay, Ryukyu? No, you're doing good. Nice. See? Nice and easy. Miss Rambo? That you did. That you did, Pedroka. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I thought Frambo was my third, like my fourth game. Apparently, Frambo was the second ever game I decided to speedrun. I didn't remember that. But uh, yeah, we uh, suffered through Frambo, and now we're here. Is that because of Havoc? I have no idea. Uh, it just works. And chat, I had to work so hard to get that glitch working. Like, it's just so much practice, and now it, I can do it off the cuff. Uh, do you come across many, any games with zero glitches? Of course. Not every game has glitches. Sometimes you just play a game legitly, not every game will have glitches. I like Frambo, but uh, the run is a 2 out of 5. It's better than I remember, but it's still pretty rough. Nice. Do not recommend? Fair. Ah, uh, good night. Uh, second biggest loser. Hope you have to sleep well. Go out the runs. Thanks. I think it'll go well. But chat. I don't know. Uh, I guess if I, in general, I seem like I'm trying to avoid a lot of just negative comments in general, like on topics. I don't really care. You know what? You know what? This this marathon idea. I want to revisit myself. I want to reclaim who I am. And it's been nice. I feel like after a while, you just lose the initial drive of what made you start doing things. Actually, you know how many people out there just kind of go through the motions of streaming and shit? It's a lot. I don't like the idea of just doing something for the, you know, because it seems like I have to do it. That's nice? Yeah. You know why I ran all these games? I wanted to. I wanted to speed on games because it was something cool I watched my old job. And you know what? I really liked running these games. That's also why I'm talking. Uh, Sound of the Arcade. Uh, let's just say I have a machine. I have access to a machine. Let's say that much. I don't think anyone wants to truly stagnate. I have a lot of thought, though. Worry about it. That kind of cross for two months? It could be that way, but it could be a lot of things. Honestly, you know what this is, Chet? This is the speedrunner's equivalent of chopping off your hair. But also, I don't know anyone who's ever done something to this degree. At least, uh, in terms of, like, every game. Like, the only thing I know recently is Distortion did something similar, but... That's actually why I announced it earlier. Thank you, Alva Wesker. Yeah, that's why I like a lot of just a lot of the general positivities. I don't really care about World of Record because, I mean... I'll talk more about that when we get to Little Nightmares, but World of Records are fleeting, Chad. Records are meant to be broken. It's a very fleeting hobby. Enjoy the effort you put in and be happy with yourself. But yeah, Sound Hole the Arcade was my fourth run. Which, funny enough, Forest Leaf, I am the only speedrunner who's done Sound Hole the Arcade on official hardware. Which, uh, yeah. That's, uh... That's a sentence. Pretzels are also meant to be broken. Are they? I guess you eat them, but you don't really break them, do you? I thought you were meant to... You don't really break them, do you? I don't think you do. Pretzels. The teeth? That's called the eating. How else do you dip them? I used to get that. And I finished like, all my games one. No! No, 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 Kakduma. Um If I tried doing all my games in one stream, I would literally die. I suppose Team Anne. That'd be doing good. 
Like, one person cannot do all these games in one stream. At that chat, I'm pretty sure if I really wanted to get all these games done in one, like, you know, one stream, I would, like, I think I literally run enough games to fill an entire GD here. Alex, are you there? Like, I can probably create a marathon idea out of all my games at one point or another. Isn't like 100 plus games? It's about 160 games, and assuming each game is about 100, one hour, uh, it's very likely that this is going to take around 160 hours. Now, keep in mind, a lot of the games are short. However, a lot of the games are long, so it's probably reasonable to estimate we're probably going to be looking at about, um, I don't know, about 160 hours, more, give or take. It could be less, it could be more. I don't actually know. I've never tallied all the time. Like, for every Clock Tower Mobile, you also have a fucking Book of Memories. Which, wow, 8-hour speedrun, no way. And they're like, oh, you're on a bunch of 30-second games. You can't ignore the 8-hour game then, jackass. Uh, the longest one is Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories at 12 hours. However, that game could be faster. I'm not doing 160-hour streams. Clock Tower is the first game, yeah. Uh, I'm doing the games mostly in chronological order. Yeah, Grey Cyber. You go for me memory took me 12 hours. It might take more, though. Last time I tried doing it, it didn't go very well. By the way, yes, chat. I'm going to get proper sleep. I was going to tell. So what's going to happen is when we hit, like, around the end of the stream mark, I'm going to pause the timer. We'll note the time. We'll mark all the times so for the games we're doing. And then, um... Yeah. Make sure we're uh, all good there. We'll have to see. I don't know how many days it's gonna take. It's a good question, Mrs. Fiendish. It was a fall, by the way. Two weeks? It could take two weeks. It could take one week. It could take uh, a month. Actually, chat, I already know what I want to do to celebrate. Y'all wanna know? I can tell you right now. Being on a game? We're gonna do a Games I Feel Like Marathon. Probably good for you for sleep, I'll see. Oh my god, why do I keep choking here? Hold on, hold on. Well, games I feel like it's only eight hours. Like, that's easy, you know? Why am I choking on this? I don't really choke on this. Hey, okay, there we go. But yeah, like I said, there's a lot of out-of-bounds stuck in this game that are pretty interesting. I love the past, embrace the future. I agree. Chat, it's very important to know where you come from. I think a lot of people don't remember where they came from. Sweden? Oh, there you go, Sonia. Right, I made it in. Oh, isn't this weapon swapping? Oh, you go to a shotgun to pistol. That allows you to get a little boost forward and it immediately puts you through the wall, which is nice. And looking for, you aren't looking forward to rerunning Corpse Party. Corpse Party is going to be one of my least favorites I'm going to revisit, probably. Uh, let's see. Games I know I'm going to hate. Uh, games I am not excited for. Corpse Party, Harvester, um, Alice, Mattis Returns. There's a good few I'm not going to be happy with. They're hard. Well, I mean, Harvester is mostly just my brain fucking with me. Every game? No. Oh, what, oh, I mean, oh, wait, you mean for the marathon? Yeah, we're doing every single game I've ever ran in the past uh, six years. Uh, except for the Forbidden Games. Or sorry, old or new, whatever I have on Steam. I play Phantasmagoria? No, no panic, bro. Mainly because I heard that uh, game has some weird uh, 
weird cutscenes I don't want to deal with. Forbidden games? Yeah, Sonya. Yeah. It's stuff like Waltz and Gromit, Luigi's Mansion, uh, Undertale. Games I just don't really stream anymore for a variety of reasons. Unless someone wants to give me $5,000. God, where the hell are we? I don't know, Wheeler, but we have to keep moving. Yeah, Alice Matters Returns is going to be hell. Can't escape Shattered Memories. I don't actually mind running Shattered Memories because, Kaza, I'm going to buy a new Wii controller before then. Luigi's Mansion? I have ran Luigi's Mansion and I probably remember a lot of it. I just don't want to do it because people don't care to watch it and I don't want my viewership to tank. Squall, Wallace, and Gromit is genuinely good and you are also genuinely good. And I'm happy that you're both here. Let's go. So, but also, I, I already don't list those games on Wheel of Games. The way I'm pulling it's from the whatever's on the Wheel of Games shop. All the games that would be from there. It does suck, Ryan Cole, and you get test. Which, that being said, before you ask, yes, Nightmare on Elm Street is an option we're doing. Uh, the only games we're not doing are um, Amnesia, Claire. Hey, Esman. And the Prime Gang for six months. Enjoy the emotes and the scissors once again. And now they're green. And thank you. I'll be doing great today. Nice. Oh yeah, Kat, did I tell you? I got to level 53 in Hardcore WoW. I'm almost 54. I might make it. I'm actually kind of surprised. Beautiful boss? Funny enough, this boss predates the human centipede. A lot of people don't know that. I also, chat, I also have the brilliant idea of naming my splits for this boss, Auto-Erotic Asphyxia. Her name is Asphyxia. She was choked out. I'm a dumbass. There. Antonio 50? I'm surprised. I mean, uh, yeah. I might make it to the end. It's possible. Evil Within's pretty hard? No, I wouldn't say like super. We're actually doing pretty good yesterday on Evil Within, funny enough. Maybe I make it until official uh, server comes. I want to make it before the official server if I can, but I don't know if I'll be able to. Five Nights at Freddy's would be easy. No, no, no. We'll be good. We'll be good. Also, chat, luckily enough, I'm going to have some leeway of being able to study up a little bit before the day of what we're doing. Like, I'll be able to see, like, all right, probably for tomorrow, I should study up Corpse Party, because Corpse Party is going to happen tomorrow, most likely. So, shockingly enough, if I do my little streamer homework, then maybe I'll be better at the game. Luck? Uh, we'll see how it goes, man. Oh, we shall see. The wild part is I had to learn this clip, uh... I was on my own for a while, and then Tally helped me out, then Tiggleton helped me out. I've been coming in the show for six months. Enjoy the green scissors in the emotes, and thank you. I'll be doing good. Cheers. I did not run mail your event. Chat, but fight a game casually does not quite count. What games have you finished so far? Clock Tower and Frambo. I did not speedrun Revengeance. I might learn it afterward, but uh, I have not done Revengeance yet. That's dead. I'm only counting games I actually ran, chat. Me playing a game casually is not me running a game. Got a horrible joke? Horrible hell. You gonna try to trick IRL? Good luck with that. The trick's also hard as hell. You know, back when I learned this game, we didn't do this trick. We did the other, the longer one. It's a prison joke? Eh, probably gonna ignore it then. I was gonna say, if you profess it with a horrible joke, I'm probably, probably okay. Not tapping it. Nope, I played Revengeance casually. Oh, so close. Next, they have the two over 19 months. Enjoy the emotes and the scissors, and thank you. Hope you're doing good. 
Cheers, Nexus. Cheers. I'm gonna be eating a lot of duffs, by the way. This is a hard trick. You know what's gonna have me fucked up, though? I think RE1 make my... I have notes for that game, but oh boy. Like, the auto splitter helps a lot for RE1 make. Wow, that's awkward. I never done that way. <laughs> oh, we got Tapper Gaming. Come on. Thank you for the Prime Gaming for nine months as a Twitch baby. Enjoy the emotes and the scissors, and thank you very much. Hope you're doing good. That's all good, Jamail. Okay, Metro new. It'll be fun next. We got a lot planned for this. It'll be a fun time. I never got the trick by that, and I was by the new eat. Yeah, we have a hype train. We hit level five. I'll hit the Boston button. And we go beyond level five. Uh, I'll give you a singular thumbs up because that's what we do. I'm to bust. We'll see. We're gonna race. What AGDQ run? Which one? What do you mean, Spendal? Thank you for the hundred bitties, Rachel. Rachel. We've got a bust. Oh, look at this man. Ah! I love how he just breaks out like, ah! <laughs> Can't remember? All good. Bitch. Donald One already has a remake, by the way, Chad. Called Shattered Memories. Which, it's been really neat seeing how uh, the order I learned games. Hey man, getting 12 subs of community, going to, uh, I think it's Bothake, Ventra, and I think it's Bothake, I could be wrong. Uh, and on the Dragon, Respit, uh, Daz Hardy, uh, Blasting Speed, uh, Popow, uh, uh, Inown, uh, The Weirding Way, Taco Supreme, and La Ruffle Face. Enjoy the emotes and the scissors, and thank you very much, D man. Ow, hold on. What are we imagining? Konami calls it a remake. You did not make the game. Konami made the game. So, um, when you when you create Shattered Memories, you can call it reimagining all you want. Until you have uh, invented Shattered Memories, it's a remake. Thank you again, D-Man. I try to kill you. She doesn't like you. Ow. There we go. Ow, chat boss. That's fair. We shall see, though. But yes, on their history thing, they kind of list shattered memories as the, uh, you know, as the whole thing. Also, what is a reimagining if not a genuine remake itself? Like, I don't know what else it would be. Uh, you can argue that RE1 make is a reimagining of the original Resident Evil, which that would be accurate, in fact. They could remake RE1 uh, Sonal 1 again, but like right now, um, yeah, it's very unlikely they'll remake Sonal 1. It's probably more likely they'll just, I don't know, probably go to 3. God. Right, hold on. Out of bounds time. No care for the game? That's the case, yes. But yeah, even still, like game earns Wheaties, it does its jam. Yep, we'll be doing a lot more games tomorrow, friend. Uh should be fun. All right, come on. Come on, game. By the way, I've never been able to accurately do this. I sort of just wing it every time. That's accurate. I 
Hang in there. Thanks. All right, we just started, Simone Tepe. Thank you. Thank you for the kind words. All right, Lampor here. Uh, you're going to get launched up the pillar. I really can't define it as more. You just got to feel it. Problem is, if you start seeing the pipe, you get launched backwards into the pipe up there. And you don't want to get launched into that. You want to get launched into the pillar. You definitely know when you get it. It's one of those things you know when you get it. And uh, there's not really a way I can say to do this properly outside of just hope and pray. Sometimes it's first try, sometimes it's like 20. There we go. Got it. Yeah, you just sort of hope it works. Uh, deals into ones and zeros. No, it's all about the human element, baby. Human element. It's a good question, Luxie Doodle. I still got the moves, by the way, Chad. Order of games start to win. Uh, it's not the wheel. Uh, order of games is going to be older to newer. Uh, however, there will be some exceptions on Thursdays where I let chat vote. Community voting will still be a thing. I don't know how I'm going to do that exactly, but we'll play it by ear. But I'm making the schedule day by day. But for the most part, it'll be older to newer. Nice. But shit, there's your train, by the way, Chad. You tried. So the next game will be Sot and Hold the Arcade, because that was my fourth ever speed run. Which, um, that's certainly a game to make your fourth ever speed run, I'll tell you that much. go by the way chat back in the day this clip was the worst thing in the world you had to like jut yourself in the wall to the right and then hope you can get to the door and then um so much easier i mean you tried well for busting you did not get busting meaning it was a good attempt at busting i'm not doing psychonauts because i never learned psychonauts but I did mention that earlier when I was talking about uh, Clock Tower fine enough. Well, you'll see Sound of the Arcade in one moment here, because we're almost done with this game. One. No, it's not all Sound Hill games tonight. Yeah. Some Bizzle. You know, I'm one of the oldest speedrunners of Homecoming. Homecoming is a certified Dice's channel meme. I'm quite. I'm the only people older than me right now are Sasam, uh, Starwin, UFO Techie, and Nub Zombie. Anyone else comes after me. It's an old. It's an official like Dice's game right here. You gotta hit me with the grill. Chat. Any grillers in chat? Much more accurate. There we go. All snares are in length of time speed running it. Length of time speed running it. Uh, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a young lad in, the, in terms of that one. Of course it comes after it. That's a Chimera. I've been running, I've been legit. I've been running this game since 2017. I had to learn it on my own, too. No one helped me. I had to learn this show on my own. Ow. That's the difference right there. The games are a lot easier when you have the tools of people helping you out. I don't get the luxuries. Why? I don't do a lot with luxuries yet. I don't get a lot of them. There we go. And I taught Star on how to run on PC, so. There we go. Drilling is a luxury, and that's how you spam drill. Nice. Alright, let's go. And bop. 
Oh, see, I have no idea how I got working, guys. I don't know that's on Bizzle. Hope you're doing good. And howdy, angry scootsman. Hope you're doing great today. Do love the howdy emote. Thanks for the good luck. And I'm a young, I'm a young lad, Delirium. And there's a lot of horror people who are older than me. Oh, I'm Tarek, hope you're doing good. GG. Hey, you don't So, there to go. We did it. But yeah. I mean, this is like one of the first few games I learned before I even started streaming. Stay up day nice. Oh, I actually got a bond with Starwin over Homecoming when I uh, met Starwin at Calathon. I taught him how to run it on PC. I actually taught him how to do it on PC, chat. That's, that's wild, huh? That's fucking wild. And it's nice how you're able to, you know, I guess develop um, friendships over speed games. You know, Chad, the cool thing about this game is that I would argue that this game is one of the first times I actually made a friend with speedrunning. Uh, I've been friends with Starwin for years, and um, I got to meet Starwin in person, and I became a really good friend because of Homecoming. I knew him that way. Uh, at the Calathon back in, like, I think 2019, I actually uh, couched for him, and I got to talk a lot with the guy. Still a great fun. Try for days and just couldn't. I have no idea how I got it to work. I just got it to work years ago and I got like working again, so now it just works. Alright, gentlemen, nice for its skin. That's good stuff. Uh, which by the way, I don't even know if I remember how I, how I got it working, but uh, hopefully I didn't mess up Sound Hold the Arcade. But we shall see. I just understand it's going to be a pain and I might need to reboot the game a couple times because it's one of those things where, um, yeah, I have to run it on full screen, and I don't know how it's going to work with OBS, but that'll be fun to figure out. Also, chat, when I sped around Sound of the Arcade, I did it on a live cabinet. Six years ago. Which, uh, yeah, that's wild to think about. Also, Cap, the rule of the game is if we softlock, if it dies, we go back to the intro of that game and do it all again. That is the way we're doing it. Yep. He became Pyramid Head? Yeah. He got his summer beach body. He's ready to watch Barbie in theaters now. Crap, I'm going to watch Barbie. Uh, by the way, in case you're wondering, I forgot to mention the schedule this week. I'm taking Friday and Saturday off. In case you're wondering, I'm going to be watching Barbie this weekend. <laughs> so I'm taking the day off to watch Barbie. And Oppenheimer. There we go. Okay. It's going to be better. I can read you better now, chat. There we go. Oh, sorry about my kid. I saw the music? Yes. Um... Um. Um. Okay, got you. Uh, some of you guys, so it does. I guess I get to look over there. Cinema, it is. All right, chat, ready? We're back from the ad, right? Roll back from the ad. Over back from the ad. You don't need chat. All right, here we go. Anyway, Silent Hill, the arcade. By the way, Chad, if you don't know, I'm the only runner on physical hardware because I live near around one that has this. I'm also the head moderator for this game. Why? I don't value my time. Anyway, fun part about this game, if you click off the window on accident, it crashes. Beautiful game, right, chat? Beautiful game. Oh, no, do not loot my food and booze. I need that. So I'm not going to be able to alt tap for a while. And I look at chat all over there. Or here, down here. By the cabin, the arcade cloak goes. It's around one. It's not going to close. There we go. Have you seen this one? Most people haven't seen this one. Because I ran this because I could. That's it. I ran this because I could, chat. Sometimes that's the goal. You do it because you can. Also, chat, if you see anyone running Soundhole the Arcade online, 
it's very likely I help them set it up. I'll tell you right now, for like a lot of a lot of streamers who run this game, like there's very few who can't thank me for setting this shit up. And you know who I thank? Nub Zombie for helping me get this game. However, he told me, uh, yeah, you have to figure out how to set it up. Good luck. And I had to figure out how to set this shit up, and then I helped everyone else get it going. You know what? They don't thank all like Dices. So, Kat, I can probably help you set it up, too, if you want. I'll have to remember how the fuck I did it, though. I think recently I helped Eurothug set it up. I don't know the whole pin guide. There we go. There we go. Yeah, for like a lot of the major sound hull streamers, though, I pretty much helped like a good chunk of them set it up. Is it curves? I mean, I mean, they're pretty nice, you know, like to help people out if they ask. In terms of like mutuals and all that. Also, I want you to cannon. They can be. But Chad, I don't think uh, a lot of people are going to be thanking me anymore for that, so just keep that in mind. Oh my god, it's the nurses! No way! What a beautiful game, right, chat? Don't you just love this game? Sound Hole the Arcade. What? Well, how is this game as a speedrun? It's bad! When I ran it, the round one I went to had a burnt screen. I kept putting money in because I kept dying. And honestly, it's pretty terrible. There we go. On this game, I think it's about 40 minutes. There we go. It's screen good now? It's working. Oh no, no, it's still broken. Uh, yeah. Uh, and then, in case you're wondering, for uh, railgun light shooters, or rail, rail shooters? Like on rail shooter? Uh, yeah, ra on rails games. Yeah, it's not really amazing, chat. Like, I'll tell you that right now, because there's some really good on, you know, rail shooters. This isn't one of them. And I bet you're wondering, why not? Because it's mostly just trivial. You don't do anything, you just shoot. It doesn't have the fun of, like, House of the Dead. It doesn't have the charm of, like, anything else. It's that no creativity like Time Crisis, or, you know, uh, any of the uh, the cool rail shooters, you just shoot. That's it. In this game, cinema. Oh, of course. It looks and feels mid. It feels like they saw House of the Dead and wanted to make money in arcades. Hey, did you just? I think you can get the UFO ending, but I don't know how to do it. You just imagined it. Also, I think I don't think you can do it these days. Like, I think you're meant to have, like, an e amusement pass, and you need, like, a saved game to do it. And I don't know if you can even hook that up anymore. Uh, shooting gallery games, uh, snaps will count? Yeah, they can count for, like, rail shooters. I need. I heard a scream from somewhere. Now. Stop it. Oh my god, Chad, it's Pyramid Head. No way. I can't believe it. But that's all you do. You just shoot them. I'm not reloading, by the way, chat. The game just reloads if you shoot enough bullets. That's it. Well, again, Area 51 was at least decent. Like, rail shooters like that were at least decent enough because they had mechanics. This doesn't have mechanics in the same way. You just shoot. Some of the bosses are neat, but, like, chat. I rank this game as a speedrun right now, I can tell you. This game's a 2 out of 5. I already know. This is a 2 out of 5 game very easily. Why? Honestly, it's not really interesting, but you know what? It's inoffensive. This is a very inoffensive game. You just shoot. Uh, honestly, the hardest part about this run is getting the port working, which that's fair. And making sure you don't crash it. Also, the other problem isn't really to blame on the game. It's more to blame on the general instance of round ones and screens around the world. Surprisingly enough, most round ones aren't going to have a good screen anymore. Why? Well, because why would they? Ah, oh, yeah, so I maintain my Silent Hill, the arcade cabinet. You know, the one making all the money. 
Well, again, it's pretty inoffensive from what I said. Carnival's fucking ass. I hate Carnival. Let's fucking flashbang the shit out of your eyes. It'd be better if it didn't flashbang your eyes repeatedly and have some of the meanest game mechanics ever. Like, for what it's worth, this game is mostly a boring game. It's not really a bad one. It's mostly you just keep clicking. And also it does bullshit like that where you eat a free hit. Hey, we didn't take enough of your money. Give me your money, buddy. Let's return to the motel for now. Yeah. By the way, chef, if I'm not paying attention as much, I quite literally cannot read you in the same way as previously. Wondering why, uh, it jutted all of my my screens. The fact that I have this game running is a miracle in of itself. I have you on my phone. Flashbang? Correct, Big Boss Isaac. No, we can't get through from here. Let's try and find another route. I have played those ones. They're fun. They're cheap as hell, but they're fun. Nice. By the way, like I said, if I click too much over here, I kill the game. So I have to be careful not aiming too much to the right. I'd rather just eat a hit. That being said, one of the weird things about rail shooters is always going to be very easy when it comes to playing on PC. Like, when you can click everywhere, dude, you aim more accurately, you can kill fast. It's actually kind of nice. Hurry up! Emily is in grave danger! Oh, it is absolute ass. It is absolutely terrible running this, playing this game. Uh, let's see. And like I said, if you want to see some, we'll see good rail, like, rail shooters later. And you know what those are? House of the Dead. House of the Dead. All the House of the Dead games, they're good. This game, uh, no. Oh, uh, Chad, the time about this game, though, I have a really fun memory. So when I wanted to speed on this game, I used to go with one of my IRL buddies, um, he shows it every now and again, but his, uh, his handle is one of my mods, and um, you might remember him, but he's in my buddy Lunar Dial. I had him go with me to round one, and the VOD's still on Twitch, by the way. You can still watch this VOD. Uh, I had him hold up the phone for the hour, like, using my cell phone. Uh, and then I had another phone as a timer uh, on screen for an on-screen timer, and I did, like, an IRL stream at round one, and it was a lot of fun. I looked at chat and, I don't know, it was really cheeky. It was a really fun memory out of my buddy. Sounds wild, that was a good memory. Oh yeah, we got the key, chat. By the way, I guessed, I had no idea where the fuck I was going. Sounds fun and goofy. It was. Oh, like I said, I just wanted to play a lot of games. I want to be the first person to ever speedrun the Asan Holy Arcade on legit hardware. And, like, that was the thing. Like, anyone I know who did it never did it on legit hardware. So I was like, oh, what if I did it? Because I could, and I lived near one. And it was a really sweet memory. But I hope you don't mind me reminiscing about various games as I, um, as I play them. It's kind of a way of going down memory lane for a lot of games. And it's quite nice. I like remembering where I came from quite a lot. I don't think about Emily. She might be. She might just be. Tell the Yeah. I mean, I don't run a lot of these games quite a lot. Which... God, getting, by the way, getting this game working, I didn't think I had to do it so quickly. Uh, I forgot this game was so early, so I had to get it working again, and that was actually part of the reason why I started later than I did. I actually was ready to start, like, right at 9, I was like, ah, shit, it's not only arcade. Uh, so getting this game functional took me a bit. Like, I tried getting on windowed mode, because I can alt-type in windowed mode, but the problem is it didn't work because I couldn't shoot the gun. So I had to play on a full-screen mode that just saw my windows to the side. What was that crime? It's behind 
In all fairness, uh, this game is about on par with most rail shooter uh, voice acting. I think I'm the two bits blue there, boy. All right, boss time chat. I love this boss. He's just a big guy. For you. Kill him. Yeah, honestly, like for a Silent Hill game, like boss design wise, it's pretty cool. Nice. He's pretty great running bucks. But yeah, the one thing I do give this game credit for is that the actual boss fights are kind of cool. I'm not going to entirely just throw insults in this game. I do like this game. I am the moderator for this game, chat. There's a reason why I moderate it. Like, I do like this game for what it's worth. Like, you know, I don't think this game's the greatest. I, I do like it. Cool. Good fight. Rank A, baby. This game came out uh, many years ago. I was indeed. We got any good. I was in Pito. Oh my god, I'll glass up! Oh, it's a lot easier this way. Nice. I got stuff. Yeah, it came out a while ago. 1973. Maybe a little bit younger than that. Nice. Also, it's kind of neat to see all the Silent Hill enemies. Like, admittedly, this game has, like, a, like, a lot of enemies in general. And it kind of visits a lot of the Silent Hill games. Like, I like that part. Like, right now, you see the, the fat boys from Silent 3. You see this worm from Silent 3. No, no, I think it's kind of fun. Also, you can rack up combo points by shooting enemies like this. You can just keep shooting dead bodies, too. This game's nostalgia bait? Well, it's a rail shooter uh, made for money. Yeah, absolutely, it's nostalgia bait. Good. Is that rare to me so bad? Well, like, the pyramid had hit fucking cheap as hell, I'll tell you that much. And also, I guess the funny part is, like, I don't think the game's overtly terrible if you can actually get it going. It's just most machines you're going to play aren't going to be upkept well, and then they're very likely going to have burnt screens and shit. So you're almost not going to play. Is it available on Steam? God, no. No, no. Game this game works a pain in the ass. Um, it is not something easy. Uh, I got it off the back of a truck. Let's say that much. I own a round one, chat. Clearly, I, I've actually been uh, sinking in... I'm kidding, I, I don't own a round one. But clearly, I've been sinking in uh, arcade ownership. I run my own arcade, clearly. The Dice is important of arcade games. Oh, it's funny, because most arcades are just like a computer for this, like, for this game. It's just like a shell. But no, you can't really buy this game in a, a way. Nice. Perfetti, thank you for coming 22 months. Good timing. Hope you're doing good today. Enjoy the emotes in the city once again, and thank you very much. You're doing good. 
I went to round one to practice? Oh, I ran it around one. I beat the whole game there. I liked round one. I was doing confetti. I was doing Skull of the Night. I've been doing all right today. Uh, I'm embarking on the grandest speedrun journey that anyone has ever tried. I am going to be running every single game I have ever ran. You're going to be seeing a lot of classics, so I hope you enjoy that. Currently, we're on game four out of about 160. There we go. Uh, I don't think you're going to get this working on Steam Deck. I'm not going to lie to you. Even if you got the game working, I don't... The getting this game working is such a pain in the ass, like, I don't know if you'll get it on a Steam Deck. I have played Obscure. It's fun. I played it solo, though. I probably should have played with another person. I played it solo. I mean, you can get it working and go for it, but, uh, I'm just saying, I don't know. Like, this game's a pain in the ass to get working in general. Oh, yeah, Crepetti. It's, um... I don't run this game all the time because it's a pain in the ass to get working. Let me rack up my score. You miss House of the Dead? I mean, they made a House of the Dead remake literally last year. The bombed. It's pretty bad. I bought it. Ooh, I gotta chill. Yeah, look, it's Ethan's foreskin. I can't believe it. Ethan Winters in my video game? My hero? More likely than you think, Chad. Oh, yeah, it was pretty bad. Oh, Chad, you know what the best part about the House of the Dead remake was? Reload! 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 The guy just shouting for his life and telling you to reload, and it happened all the fucking time. I can't believe it. They had Ethan Winters in here. How long do I think it'll take? Well, I don't know. Um, I run about 160 games, and in theory, you can probably estimate that every game's gonna take about an hour. I mean, obviously, there's gonna be some that take a lot less, but there's gonna be a lot that take a lot more than one hour, so I don't really know. I'm guessing around 160 hours, could be less, could be more. I don't actually know. The only way to know would be, um, going. Funny enough, chat, I have good news and bad news. Um, I have House of the Dead one working now. We're gonna do both House of the Deads, because suddenly I can't, I had, did actually speed on House of the Dead one. I just never actually, um, all right, I did do both versions. I just never actually did the, um, I never uploaded my remake run, but I can run the remake. I just, it fucks in my hands, so I'm gonna be careful with that. Yeah, I actually did get uh, a lot of my games working. Because for the Wheel of Games, I want to make sure things actually work. I was actually, I've been playing this for a bit now. So yesterday, I took, uh, not yesterday, the day before that, I took a lot of time making sure the games actually work. Well, I don't think we're going to go to, like, a full-blown eight-hour grind of Franbo, but, like, expect it to show up probably during more of the general marathons, I think. Because honestly, I don't hate Franbo as much as I thought I did. I don't know, maybe caring less about grinding for record and just soften my edges a bit, which is kind of nice. Not doing the Wheel of Games bitch yet. Oh shit, is that command still up? Oh god, sorry, I forgot to remove that. Uh, that was yesterday, I apologize. I forgot to remove the, the command. And I don't have any mods present to remove it for me, so... Such is the life. Go. All right, not bad. Isn't Sonal Homecoming? I'm on Sonal Holy Arcade. That's just a Sonal Holy Arcade on my uh, everything. Ah, oh, Mr. Row. I can see the title on my, like both my phone and the directory. It definitely says the arcade. 
I said, mod? Oh yeah, Rugs. Uh, do you know how to change? I can do it later, but uh, do you know how to change titles or not or not? How long is the book of memory? It's, quite, it's gonna be a while. I don't know. I don't know when. Like I'm, I'm double. I'm going through my vods essentially. Chat, I have about 800 vods on Twitch. And um, yeah. Uh, come on. Nice. Yes, we are safe. I'll change it later, chat. We fine. It's not, it's not a huge deal. Look, there are two doors. Which one should we go through? Or we could keep going further down here. Damn, doors locked. This is not going to Let's try another way. I don't remember this puzzle. It's fun. Yeah, I got the key. Hooray. Beautiful game. But yeah, uh, I'll definitely be showing the games like on the beginning of each day, but I'm not going to know immediately. As well, a lot of the like for voted on games, um, uh, that's going to fuck with the order a bit. I'm actually going to wonder if I should even have community voting. That'll be fun that way. Um... I'm gonna make it ranked choice voting as well. I'm gonna try to put a good balance of uh, maybe the upcoming games. Maybe we'll do that. I'm probably gonna look at the games at years five and four and then try to make it go that way. Not bad. Exactly. I'll get it later. It's all good, though. I'll probably better that way. Okay, let's see. Not bad. Cool. You know, I, you know, I didn't think I'd be playing this game today. Let's go on the wild things, Chad. Oh no, Roz, I still need the other commands. I still need the other ones. And also, now it doesn't have the proper capitalization. No, that's why I said don't change it. As it still needs the, um, fuck, where are they again? There's two other commands in there that I did need. Um, I think one of them was Dead Rising Drinks video, and then the other one was the merch? Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. And then the proper capitalization. I really like proper capitalization. It's nice. Yeah. I saw on the other command, just the Wheel of Games yesterday, so I was gonna remove that one. There we go. It's like a fucking spider, man. Cool boss over there, Porcelain Doll. There we go. Oh, gotcha. There's so much clicking. Oh, right, we did it. Rank ass. All right. This is a long run, by the way. Guess it's not inside the ship. Whatever. We need to find Emily. Yeah. Oh my God. Remember Sonic Three? I remember Sonic Three. No way. Yeah. I can't believe it. This is the original Sonic Three. I'm not even kidding. This is actually what Sonic Three was meant to be. Like, this is closer to the original image that they had than what we got. Well, yeah, Chad. Don't you know that Sonic Three was originally meant to be a rail shooter? A lot of people don't know that. Oh, it was, yeah.
Ow. Earning patch slot? You can't speed run a patch slot machine, so no, we're not doing it. I have one, but I'm not gonna speed run it. Uh, some Saw 3. This game came out way after Saw 3, chat. This is also an arcade rail shooter. I can't really say it bombed. I have never been to a shopping mall. It's a rail shooter. So quickly. It's an arcade. I don't really know what the selling rate of arcade cabinets are. It really after? Yeah. Now there is originally designed to be a rail shooter. They ended up changing to an actual game after that. Exactly, Siegi. There she is. I kind of got all of them from a distance. Badass. All right, we're not doing bad, chat. Doing nice and good here. We're walking sperm. These enemies are in Sonic 3, funny enough, though. Funny, like... It's weird, chat, but, like, all... This, this game is weirdly accurate to the enemies of the franchise. Like, talk whatever trash you want about this game, but it is actually pretty faithful to the games. Yeah, this is literally the Sonic 3 map, but it's a rail shooter. And then we are in Sonic 2's, um... Earlier with the, um... Tourist Center, I think. Well, the problem, Sharknado, is you're playing this on hardware. In most cases, you're not going to be on good hardware. Because most screens are burned to shit. So, they're hard to play on. I say this to someone who wasted a lot. I, I beat it on... I, again, I'm the only runner who's ever beat this on actual hardware. Penalty chat, I have world record in this game if you count legit runs. But I am literally the only speedrunner who has done it. Why? Because I live near around one that has one. I'm one of the very few people who can do that. Which, when again, if you're one of one, it doesn't matter. Do I have record? Actually, no, someone else does. But it's kind of going back to what I say that, again, I have the world record for ja chat. I have the world record for jacking off the most times in my bed. Why? I'm the only one who does it. Ho I hope. I hope I'm the only one who does that. But still. What kind of world is this? Are we inside Emily's it's the idea if you, you know, you frame competition in a different way, it's going to be a lot easier for you to win. Chad, I can't believe it! Marketable plushies! Stop them! No, I don't want to be a marketable plushie. Ghosts in that category? Why are the ghosts jerking off in my bed? No. I think they have giant heads. Yeah, cool. Oh god, she'll come Mario plushy. No, I don't want to be a Mario little plushy. I'm cool. sure the bed wasn't theirs first. It's my bed. No, chat. Smitty, Warbin, Jaegerman, Jensen, and not jerk off in my bed enough times to beat my record. <laughs> I hope nobody has. I hope nobody has more than one, in fact. Now I think about it. Any. Anyone else having more than one is kind of cursed. Oh, yeah. But also, it's like, you know, my dog taking the most shits in my lawn. Chat, you just define a record based on, um, 
arbitrary values, of course you're going to be the winner. So yes, I have world record in this game. Uh, on legit hardware. By virtue of being the only person who lives near around one who can do it. I want this fine. No. You are not Starkinado. Absolutely not. I know who is. Yeah, look, there's one other weapon in the game, finally. There's actually a shotgun. I think it's worse than the regular gun, if I remember correctly. It's not arcade in your room. Don't let your dreams be dreams. No one's gonna buy a plane ticket to speedrun this game. Thank you, Catboy? What do you mean? Oh, for plushies. It's cursing Aaron Dog. We need to find an escape route somehow. Never the fall, by the way. I'm glad you're enjoying this, uh, let's say, masterpiece of a game. I actually never realized to shoot the head. I don't know why I didn't think about that. It's smart, Chad. Me and Robbie the Rabbit have the same weakness. I'm too am weak to bullets in the head, Chad. Oh my god, I can't believe it. It's Pyramid Head. Chad, I'm gonna kill the franchise. I'm gonna do what John Konami does. Or Chad, hold on, I got a better one. Call me Bloomer Games. You're about to kill the franchise. <laughs> I'm gonna have that wall though, take it easy. Okay, there we go. Not bad. Oh, Sonic the Remake uh, 2 turns out to be good. I'll take literally anything Sonic Home makes. They can make anything and I will play it. I quite literally have that proven, chat. I am currently play. God damn it! God damn it! No! No! First one of the marathon. Some pause? You don't know how this works, clearly. Chad, I said in the very beginning, if I accidentally alt-tab, the entire run dies. I think I banked that time. Cool, back to intro. <sighs> No, uh, the enemies are so high up, I accidentally went to the monitor above me because I forgot there's a monitor above me. Probably, yes, yes, Chad. Anyway, back to... God damn it! Well, I hope you enjoyed this game, Chad, because I have to go back to intro. Oh, beautiful.
on sale with the other displays because this game fucks with my monitors anyway and I'd rather not fuck my monitors. Also, uh, you don't think about it until it happens. Just don't make the mistake, forehead. How many stages? We're uh, about on the final boss. I learned the monitor above me. I want to see Grill. If you're gonna, if you're gonna learn a lesson, I want to have a Joel in there, a Leon. Put Leon at least. Make me feel better. Otherwise, I'm just gonna feel like shit. If you're gonna laugh at me, do it with a Leon. It makes you feel better. Oh God. Well, chat. Like I said, we learned the lesson of this marathon well. First mistake in four games. Hi, Swordfish. Uh. Konnichiwa, Genki desu ka? I can't see the bottom of this. I just have to remember don't shoot enemies that high. But yes, San Hill the Arcade. Swordfish, I'm running every game I have ever done. All of them. That is rough. That is rough. Uh, Z dip. Well, like I said, uh, there might be some setbacks in games, and uh, oh boy, that was a big one. I was like right at the end too. I'm like, how much happened earlier? Yep. Uh, it's gonna be over many days. Yeah, that was heartbreaking. I can't tell you how heartbreaking that was. I didn't realize it. I didn't realize it until the very end. All right, now I get the circle. New, new reticle. Oh, God. Well, I mentioned earlier, like, it was it was a miracle I got this part working. So, um... Yeah. I have to be very careful. But that day, hey, we're learning the rules quickly, huh, chat? I feel like it. Yeah, that'll be the last game I do. Uh, I want to get better at it, though. Uh, so we're probably going to do a little bit more work to learn the faster route. I played it, and I had time left over after I beat the game, so I wanted to learn the game. That was the most recent game we did. I also did uh, Gregory Horror Show recently. I want to do that one again, too. Or am I going from all the old games to the newest games? Oh god, though, Chad, that was a heartbreaking, that was a heartbreaking defeat early, too. Yeah, but, you know, that's how they go, Chad. They can't all be winners. You know what? I'll make for an interesting saga, Chad. You know, I didn't think this would be the first L. Like, I, I knew that we eventually would have a game that we'd have issues. I didn't think it would be this one. How fast? They're about like 40 to 50 minutes. Is that for real? I think so, but I'm not positive. I earnestly lost about an hour because of that. Like, I, I wasted about maybe 30 minutes hey, did you just hear of that time. Noise? No, I think you just imagined it. Like, I, I got it in a really bad spot, too. I like I was told, just unpause it. That's why I announced at the very beginning. If you all tap on accident for any reason, uh, the run dies. I heard a scream from somewhere. Now. Stop it. I just didn't think about it. Alrighty. Thank you, John Skew. And we'll be good ordered us. We'll be good. At the very least, we get an early area of the stakes. You know, it's kinda nice chat. I really don't mind it as much as I do. I'll keep both of, I'll keep everything in the whole VOD. Because um it's about stakes, chat. We're way back on game four. My R what do you mean RG? Am I a real gamer? I could be.
Hold your fire. Oh, you're, lo you're linking shit. Hey, uh, Roz, can you uh, probably ban that person, I'm guessing? I don't know. I don't know. Hold on, wait, hold on. What do they try linking? Tell me what they link first. I don't think I can ban. What do you link? I should be able to do it right now. Give me a moment. It's not bad? Oh. Well, what do they link? Hold on. What do you link? Tinder.com? Oh, sorry about that. I don't get to see. I kind of saw a message with a confusing question, and then, um... Not bad. I apologize. Uh, whole menta, uh, mental. I just have no idea what you linked. I assumed it was, uh, something bad. Usually can someone ask a random question and then link something. I kind of, um, uh, hardwired to think that. Alright, we're good. Can't mind, I can't see anything right now, chat. You're all good, but I don't... What do you mean, RG? They're yeah, doing every game from Spiro.com. Let's return to the motel for now. Yeah. Oh, Emily? Oh. Am I the Frambo moderator? Uh, I might be why. You're, you're not gonna... Yeah. Might be why. If you're gonna tell me to, so, uh, so I can approve your run, I'm currently in the middle of many things. No, we can't get through from here. Let's try and find another route. I actually ran, I ran for Rambo earlier today. That was not a good experience. I actually pretty rough. Don't you love the instant hit shot? Okay. Let's see. What a game. Ow. I look at the monitor and include the walking monitor to the screen. It's not quite that simple. Like again, this game barely functions, and it's such a pain in the ass. It's a game issue. You know? Game issue is an accurate way I'd put this. So I'm just gonna make sure I don't do that next time. I gotta remember that. I mean, it was working mostly well, barring that shot. So, but yes, why why do you ask about me being the Frambo moderator? Yeah, you're here. Oh, I found the main phone. <sighs> oh, I was a quick stop, but I was rooting in the game. I got unlucky. <laughs> Happens to the best of us. What can I say? At least I remember where to go, chat. At least I remember. You know what? We save time this way for the real run, right? Who came out for this? Mad Father. Mad Father's gonna be easy. You know what, chat? Mad Father would be a nice way to detox this game. You know, I've never been so excited to play Mad Father. Fucking Mad Father. Right? Right. At the very least, it should be entertaining for the uh, YouTube bod. Love Mad Father? Me too. That's why Mad Father was the fifth game I ever learned. Well, I hope nothing happens. I can still hear the noise. Watch out, like I mentioned earlier, a lot of the games I learned is because I wanted to learn them. Uh, they're all games I really liked. Normally I do games because I, I like them. It's very important. Oh, Mad Father? That's like 30 minutes. Mad Father will be short. Like, thank God Mad Father is short. Ow.
So, Matt Father's usually- Matt Father's easy. Like, Matt Father would be really easy, thank god. I'm getting good headshots there, at least. By the way, I'm gonna look at the- like, the- Chat, when we get back to those bugs, I'm gonna be looking at that section, and I'm gonna be like- I'm gonna be hard panicking. I'm gonna be like, no. Don't. Don't. Do not. I can't believe I had to run solid the arcade twice. Well, chat, you know, you do know what they say. These things happen to the best of us. Wait, restart? Yeah, I accidentally alt tab. And uh, if you alt tab, the whole run dies. It's like the one thing you can't really do. Yep. Every part of someone then told me, just unpause the game. Huh. That's an alt tap. Uh, yeah, so the reason why is because, um... What's the word? The mouse cursor isn't locked to the monitor. And it's really awkward for the game. But it, like... It barely works. Like, I tried locking it to a window in windowed mode, it didn't work at all. Like, so, I so you have to play it a very particular way, which is such a pain in the ass. Oh, what can we say? There we go, Chad. We're keep removing. Got his ass. Look at that. Beautiful. He's gone. He is Magus. Good kill. Good. You know what's really weird, by the way? I like how they don't include a lot of Sonal 2 enemies. There's like five Sonal 2 enemies. How you doing? Doing all right, Zexans. Uh, I had my arcade run die. So we have to do it again. That's going to be about 30 minutes of setback. Uh, I didn't think I'd be eating 30 minutes of time loss in the first four hours, but... uh. There we go. There's that about being the Frambo mod. Yeah, what about it? Is it curse or blessed? Left after asking? I can imagine. Are they fall oh, actually no, I'll just I wasn't sure if they're following the channel, but I don't actually know. Where's the key? This one I'm pretty sure they want me to verify the run on speedrun.com. That's usually if someone's mentioning about speedrun stuff. It's usually never a good thing. At least from being a moderator. Can't check? Oh, mods can. Well, you get to see the game now, Zexans. Chat, I'll tell you one thing I learned in the area of speedrunning. It's for the most important lesson you can learn. Not following at all? Big shocker. Do not ever be a moderator for a game. No matter what you do, do not be a moderator. Do not be a moderator. Try not, do not try to seek it out. I really can't recommend this enough. Fucking suck. All the no bans. We're doing all of the wheel. We're doing every single game I've ever ran, Chuck, except for the, uh, you know, the band games, quote unquote. 
And yeah, Teddy, pretty much. What does speedrun game mod do? You have to uh, verify games on a leaderboard. And usually what that means is that uh, people will often just DM you or just cold message you like, Hey, can you accept my run upon immediately accept it, upon immediately submitting it? By wondering, Ecdysis, then why are you a moderator? Because if I don't do it in many cases, then my games don't get moderated. Because there's no moderators for the games I do. And what happens later on is something I do eventually gains popularity, and then other people will want to be a, be a part of it. And then they get mad at you because you're doing it certain ways, and it's like, oh my god, you're not doing it instantly? Why? I don't want to. I also get paid for it. How long do I think it'll take? Uh, at least 160 hours. Oh. Oh, you can just click on a name, Magos. That's all you have to do. You can just click on someone's name. You can see their stats, follow age, sub, all that jazz. Come on. Oh lord, the worm. When's that birthday month? August. Oh my god, Chad, it's Ethan Winters. I'm making the joke again. Yeah, I don't really ever do anything for my birthday, Chad. Alright, there we go. Ethan Winters. Nice. Oh no, you mean me. Uh, I mean, I, I don't know, I don't really do anything. You know what I do for my birthday? I normally work. Yeah, I don't have a lot of good uh, birthday memories, chat, or a lot of good birthdays in general. Usually it's pretty late or just, uh, in general people don't remember it. I remember one year for my birthday when I was in college, I was hanging out with a group of friends and we got Korean barbecue on my birthday. Except nobody actually knew it was my birthday, they just planned it for that day. However, during the same time, uh, someone else had a birthday like a week prior and everyone was wishing that person a happy birthday. Nobody knew it was my birthday. Skill issue, as they say. Damn, skill issue. Happy birthday? Thank you. But it's pretty far away. I mean, she did it? I, well, I mean, it could be worse. Oh, it happens in every aspect. I literally had streamers, like... Like, I, I, I don't... I, I've seen streamers try to, like, draw attention away from my birthday once. It was, uh, pretty... tacky. What's the date? August 30th. Oh, yeah. I should say streamer, not streamers. Yeah. Nice. Same birthday? It's a pretty calm birthday. There you go. Good. 
But yeah, people don't really do much for my birthday chat. Nice. That part nice. Oh, I think this I think this year for my birthday too. I'm working. I actually have GDU Hotfix that exact day, so I'm probably just gonna do GDU Hotfix and maybe afterward just have a show and that'll be fun. Or do birthday here like. This. Well, we'll see. Uh, yeah, I'm stream. Thank you, Land Coop. Yes, we're safe. Oh, we're doing good. Look. Oh, then the best birth I ever had is one that I planned. Or we could keep going further down here. Oh God, I'm I almost clipped off. I should be very careful with that. There we go. That's where it's Sarah Straw Flare. What you, what's Sarah Straw? I guess that answers the question, but. Can I join the stream? There you go. I like cats. Cats are nice. What I like? Well, I don't really know all the time. I don't really ask for a lot because I don't really ever get a whole bunch. I don't really know. I always kind of have limited birthdays, and I don't really have a whole lot I want. As well, I'm not really used to the idea of getting anything either. Give me a variety of reasons. I usually opted for simpler birthdays too, because for a good while my family lived in poverty, and I didn't want anyone to stress. So, except I've seen Amazon wishlist, but like, I'm, I'm not, I don't really have a whole lot I really want, chat. That's actually why I never made a throne. I like surprises because they're nice and, you know, someone thought about me, but like, admittedly, I never really had a whole lot I wanted or anything because, well, I grew up in poverty. Which isn't anything in that case. It's just, um, I don't really think about it. Usually, most of my money goes to booze and food. Look at this. I found it under the uh, it's kind of sour. Well, the problem with a lot of like jelly, jelly, jelly-based candies are like, like gummy kind of things. A lot of them are gelatin-based, and I can't have gelatin. Oh. Cat, look, it's a queen. My queen. Look at her. You know, chat, I'm just saying right now for this monster, wood. Wood. Tell me I'm wrong. Wrong at all? I know I'm not wrong. A scary puppet, she's kind of a baddie, Chad. Wood or wood? The second one. Mommy. Yeah, I, I, that's kind of the case, though. But, like, I mean, a lot of stuff I really don't mind, Chad. Like, I lived in a hallway for 10 years. Um, I never ended up getting braces. I tried to, you know, help family save money as I could. Nothing bad, just, you know, uh, 
You kind of just want to help family out a lot more that way. I was, yeah. I was friends. There we go. I like how I got slashed. It is a solid green wall. Ow. I think I died here last time, by the way. Alright, we're finally back on track, thank god. Alright, let's see here. Ow. I'm gonna eat a death in a moment. I have never been to a shopping mall that I've wanted to leave so quickly. Yeah, really. Ooh. But, you know, a lot of people have the ways of dealing with things, Chad. So, um... Yeah, anyway, that's how my birthday thing works, I guess. Is there sound of four section? Yes, actually. I think we we're like on there a lot, like right before the last run died. All right, good. Hey, I'm not dead yet somehow. Actually, I'm doing a 1cc at the moment. Oddly enough, I'm surprised. Here all the top of the screen? Yeah, you don't have to tell me twice, I know. Believe me, you, you figure that out once you- you fuck up once, you remember that. Oh, chat, even when I tried streaming initially, I never really got super into streaming because I didn't have a room. I had a hallway. I had a car spaced out of my garage to officially do it, and, um... I'm glad it worked out, but, like, yeah. Uh, probably could stream a year earlier if I had a room, but, um... I, uh... I didn't. I didn't have a room until like 20, mid 2018. I see. So, I like my room though. I mean, it's not huge, but more than I had for many years. I tired, man. Which, like I said as well, I never hated the hallway. Actually, I actually really liked the hallway. I just can't really stream in the hallway. I mean, yeah, things are a lot better these days. I'll say it right now. Things are much, much better these days. What kind of world is this? Are we inside? Uh, it just, you know, this is a reflection of the past many years, and um, that's going to be sad. Um, well, this game I ended up running because I lived close enough to a round one where I can actually uh, speed on this game on an actual hardware. So I thought it'd be funny to IRL stream from my phone, and uh, I had my buddy hold up the, the camera while I played the game and had Twitch chat up. That was kind of funny. Well, having a closet means you have a room or a door, Zeke. It doesn't mean you're in a public area. Not bad. Back to business. True? Yeah. Here, VJ Smith. It's always fun stuff. But yeah, and I've kind of been like mentioning the story of every game as we've been going. Uh, and that is like, you know, the first games I just really liked them. And I did that because, you know, why not? They're fun to do. I had a few times I could stream, and, you know, I did a lot of work offline too. Nice. Are these coins you're collecting? Uh, they're just coins in the game in general. That's it. They don't really do anything except boost up your score, which is used to get on a leaderboard for the arcade cabinet. That's about it. Just for points? Yeah. Ooh.
Nice. Okay. Not bad, chat. Not bad. GDQ Chess Games in the arcade. Uh, I don't think they're going to have access to a cab. GDQ has Carnival, though, and that's why I know I hate uh, Carnival. And do you have to import this? Probably. This is Sonal 1. This is the part of Sonal 3 with all the Robbie the Rabbits. Sonal 1's the intro, technically. Our evil is impossible, it genuinely is, thanks to the follow as well. Oh well, yeah, the machines are uh, kind of rare, I suppose. Oh, I don't really want the gun. I think it's going to be faster for me not to have the gun. Certified quarter reader? Yeah, Carnival fucking is rough. Like, you legit can't 1cc it. Nice. Alright, I was going Mars. I'll be doing good today. Alright, cool. Let's see how this goes. Don't you love Sonal 3 chat? My favorite. I can't believe it. We're surrounded. We need to find an escape route somehow. All right, not bad. I'm playing nights and saving, mostly staying around the middle. Okay, good. Nice, beautiful. I don't really the point of sound. Yeah, they did. They absolutely did, Shinra. Well, this is what Silent Hill is always about. Not See, everyone's done. talking about the deepest lore and, like, therapy. Nah. Dude, it was all about shooting Pyramid Head repeatedly. That's what the franchise has always been about. People saying otherwise are lying to you. They don't really know Silent Hill, man. All right, uh, do you die here? Oh, you, you can just use Kai. Luckily, uh, Cabano, uh, I have enough quarters to buy another credit. So I can just go back and do that. Dice just needs your help. He's running out of coin at the arcade and he's gonna have to run to the vending machine. Yeah. All right, this time, Ignisus, you fucking prick, do not click off the screen. Okay. They'll come to you. Do not worry about going all the way up. Just, they'll come to you. What's up there? Haha, <laughs> I get it. Yeah, you're allowed to laugh at that L, by the way. That was so sad when it happened. You could tank hits, but it's faster to actually play the game properly. Exactly, Chad. Every quarter will go to me playing the game. Also, I apologize in advance of any ads play during this. I have no idea how the ad management's going, because I have no... Uh, I can't see my usual screen. I'm assuming we're not going to have an ad for this run, but, like, um... Can't really say for certain. Oh, ladies, not all at once. Ladies, oh god, oh no. I mean, chat, who wouldn't dream of being covered in San Hill nurses? In all fairness, I, I get it, man. It should have been me, not him. It's not fair. Oh, god. Is Pal on you? It should have been me, not him. All 
Okay. And they smell funny, so no big no. But I don't like the clothes spin. The worst part is I don't think I had to kill those enemies either, so I just lost the run because I'm fucking stupid. What a badass line, chat. Come get me. I'm going to knock you out. Oh, God. Oh my gosh, we have to fight the franchise! I was gonna go dollar. Ah, I can't see you, ass! Okay. All right, let's go. Oh, it's going J-Rock. Hope you're doing good. Did you hear my idea? I'm gonna run every single game I've ever ran. And many streams. What a beautiful boss fight. Oh my God, look, he moved to the left. What a monster. Wow, he's so talented. I love the pyramid head strat of just moving slightly to the left. Hey, hey Chad, you like Sonic 4? Here we go. Our right, clock tower mobile day? It'll be 30 seconds one moment. Clearly, you have to keep the stream open 24 7 to watch clock tower mobile chat. You know, kind of is D man. And I love the dogmen. Thank you, dogmen. All right, nice. Me too, Pookie. Yeah, nice. Hey, the fall, by the way. There we go. What a game, huh? Alright, that's pretty good. In fairness, it's better than the actual stairs in Sonic 4. I don't know why, I feel just more moment, more eventful. I'm not saying Sonic 4 is a bad game, it just, I don't know, I kind of like the, 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 this is a rail shooter kind of deal. All right, chat, final boss time. I wasn't kidding, we were literally at the end of the game in a crash last time. All right, chat, time for the boss fight. We have the shoe of its hands. Is an order available somewhere? Uh, it's my oldest game, essentially. I've ran a lot of games over the years on Spear.com, and it's gonna be my oldest games. So, um, yeah, that's about it. Thank you for the raid. I'm not sure who raided yet. Give me a moment. Uh, Tragic, Emmy, soon to be Emmy. I hope you're doing good today. Chat! Wait a minute, we're almost done, God! I was in stream, sorry we can't read all the messages. Uh, this game's kind of fucked with my monitors, and I can't really read chat. 
Welcome on in Raiders. Hope you're doing good today. Those of you who do not know, I am running every game I've ever done in a row. By the way, we just did it. That's a, I'll hit time once I can actually close the game. I don't want to hit extra. Yeah, no, I can. All right, yeah, we did it. Yay. Emily. Emily. You gotta have those any emotes or tragic emotes. Conduit, that's not a tragic emote. It's a tragic raid. You need the, yeah, there you go, the tots. Yashiku gets it. Welcome, tragic raiders. You don't know tragic, you should. She's good people. How's it, Rex? How's it, everyone? Yeah. I agree, I agree tragic. I agree. So it's like, you gotta, you gotta hit us with the, the raid emote. Welcome on in, everyone. I am McDysis. Uh, I am running every single game I have ever done, possibly, uh, uh, you know, over the course of many streams. Um, we have now completed game four of 160. That's a cry I made when I accidentally killed the game. How's it, Paul's legacy? We knew you were new. Welcome on in. How's it, Shaggy? Yeah, Shaggy beat the game. Um, we're gonna be doing Mad Father next, but yeah, I run a lot of speedruns and we're doing a big, big thing. Sound of a happy ending? Uh, maybe. Hey, the follow up. If you have any questions, let me know. If you do not know Tragic, you should. Hopefully, I can have a mod shout her out, but uh, let's see. That's a tragic, tragic on Twitch. Yeah, it's uh, yeah, ch uh, chat for uh, tragic raiders. Uh, show me your favorite emote from her. Do you have one? If you do not, if you do if you not have one, uh, you know what? Spam grill so you can show our favorite emote or rap. I have no idea what the story is by the way. I just shoot. That's all I do. I just. There we go. All tragic, tragic to the people. By the way, the good ending is you have to beat the graveyard boss fast enough. You have to get all the hands, I think. What's the lore of the fairy? The lore of the fairy is that I'm killing the game. All right, chat, we get it. You know what? Anyway, we're on Mad Father now, chat. This is the fifth game in the marathon. Um, yeah, uh, anyway, uh, I guess we're ready to go. So game number five, let's go. And, uh, boom. All right, let's go. Mad Father. I mean, no other option but to keep moving forward. It's, it's all based on that. It's always hard to have things like disconnect. You just have to crash your and call it pressure person through. I mean, it's not entirely about that, I suppose. And, you know, I'll get back up, maybe. Oh, it's Mad uh, Mad was about 30 minutes. I like this game a lot, funny enough, chat. I ended up playing it because I saw it recommended on Steam, and it looked cool. So I really wanted to play it, and I enjoyed this game. It's a nice game. I like Mad Father. It's a very simple RPG maker. Loud noise. I didn't want to get the heads up there. But, I mean... It'll probably be okay. It's, uh, yeah. Also, do no, I'm not resetting the whole marathon. I'm resetting it per game, but not the whole marathon. So I'm scared, I told you. Uh, hold on. Um. Yeah, hold on. Give me one moment, chat. Uh, moment. Oh, it's not too loud, by the way. I might need to turn it down a little bit more, potentially. Um... Nice. Would it be funny if we did that, though? No, I'm not gonna do that. I literally spent five hours, Joe. I'm not... No. I'm not gonna re... I'm not gonna kill the marathon because one, uh, you know, there's a crash. All loud? Uh, I had a feeling. Give me one moment. I'll just do it right now. I really don't mind. Um... That should be better. Actually, it's still pretty loud. Holy shit, this game gets so loud. Alright, should be good. Better. Okay. No, I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I don't want to do that, though. I turn it down, too. I turn it down. Anyway, hold on. You just said people with the fucking answers. So Maryland makes map out a personal fifth. Well, I mean, I ended up just picking games. Uh, I kept going because I thought it would be fun. But, um... 
This wasn't like the fifth game I picked on my first five. I just picked, kept going with games I wanted to do. The first five games I wanted to try doing were, um... Super Mario Sunshine, uh, Psychonauts, Bioshock, You Give Forbidden Memories, and Clock Tower. And then later I just kept learning games, and this ended up being the first game, the fifth game I learned. But yeah, I guess the annoying part though is now I'm about to download the VODs and like, uh, like, there's no way of combining Twitch VODs on Twitch, right? I'm gonna Sly Cooper? I didn't want to run Sly Cooper, though. Uh, wait, what the hell is the answer again? It's like... 4, 8... 7, 2? Oh, no, no, it was... Uh, ah, oh, shit. Wait, what was the answer again? I don't remember. Wait, hold on. I usually just... 4892, I think? No. I was thinking your daddy going? Pretty terrible, my stream crashed. I'm gonna look at the answer. Hold on, I can just do that. 7482. 7482. I usually write these down. Thank you, Delirium. It's much appreciated. But yeah, system, my whole stream crashed. It's going pretty bad, actually. Um. It was good for a moment, but, um... Yeah, my whole stream crashed. So. I know Zane the Chone for nine months. Enjoy the emotes and decisions. Thank you. I'll do what doing you today, at least. Yeah, I pretty much uh, dropped the viewership by a thousand, and, um... That's heartbreaking to see. That worked. Either way, it worked out. Thank you very much for those of you who looked. Or, thank you, Delane. You can see it, sir. I see. Yeah, I don't really get a lot of good things happening to me quite a lot. It's kind of a lot of I put in work and then I have to persevere. So, um. Maybe today we'll do eight hours and then tomorrow try for more or something. We'll see how it goes. So I'm maybe with you. Right, but but the thing is though, boy, the nifty is streaming is a lot of momentum based things. So I kind of actively get screwed if some of that happened because then a lot of the momentum of the day kind of drops. And I'm glad that people are here to support it, but uh, yeah, I kind of lose a lot of momentum based on that. Ah, uh, exactly, Swordfish. Mad Father. I like Mad Father. Very strong. I would prefer. I'd much prefer a uh, what's the word? A Leon. That's not very inspiring to me at all. I'm not going to lie to you. In fact, it doesn't raise my spirits at all. I like Leon. He's much more uh, inspiring. Yeah, Darbound gets it. Or Grill or something inspiring. Perseverance? I mean, perseverance in my whole life. And the thing is, Chad, you either... I either get busy living or get busy dying. Sorry, I'm just doing the list. Saw. You guys huge following Japan? Yeah, Swordfish! Uh, this is the, um... Wait, I don't really get the oil. Huh? I did. Oh, I don't really get the lighter. Wait, I don't really get the lighter? Wait, what? Anonymous, thank you for the five gifted subs. You're going to Fred. Uh, wait, hold on. I don't have the lighter. Uh, lighter oil. Wait, wait I don't have the lighter. Wait. Gem? No, oh, that's pendant. I didn't need that. Wait, where's the lighter? Oh, I'm a. I forgot to do this one. That's fine. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, this is my first, uh, my fifth game, Swordfish. Hi, Luwick. Thank you again, Anonymous. It is much appreciated there. Yeah, Yutaka. There we go. Okay, now we're ready. Hey, you ever seen Louie Man on Fire, by the way? Is it game casually? Yes. 
Third game to stream, probably Clock Tower or Dead Rising or something, or Silent Hill. Yeah, it's not like this, exactly. But, cut. And then with Perseverance, is every now and again, you kind of just want something to come easy, you know? My life's kind of been one of not coming easy. It's been just a lot of happening in general. I got the four bits, by the way. Oh, uh, if you want the alerts, by the way, they're capped on, the, like, they happen to start at 15. People were spamming it, like, way in the past, so I had to make it higher. Like, you know that? I've been kind of just persevering after persevering after persevering. I mean, I just something just went. I didn't have to persevere for once. So. Hey, look! It's the money. That's how they call it, that Chad. Alrighty. Yeah, what I might end up doing though, Chad, is, uh, you know, depending on how today goes, maybe I'll do a normal length stream today and then go longer tomorrow or something as a result of the, uh, the crash. It might not be a terrible idea. I still just feel so terrible about it. But, like, not enough to where I want to lose total steam or, like, end early, early. You know, the games, uh, exclamation mark speedrun. Thank you, no problem. Huh? And then the mini chainsaw. Oh my god. I can't even, I, I have no idea why it crashed. Actually, no, I think I know why it crashed, but like, it's unfortunate. One of the things that would fix crashing issues would be if I had two PCs, but I don't have any room. I'd have a two PC sub if I had the room for it, but I don't have the room. Oh no, Chad, we're getting dragged by a ghost. Uh, uh right, nice. Um. Ah, oh, shit. That being said, Chad, Madfather's not a bad speedrun, but this game's kind of in a weird area. I know that I can say this game's the best speedrun ever made. Oh wait, wrong way. I play one of the speedruns of all time. Uh, mainly because, like, you know, RPG makers would be fun, but this one in particular is a lot of, like, dialogue. Like, this is probably, like, yeah, three is about right, I would say. Like, I don't think it's terrible, but, and, like, thank God you can skip dialogue, but there's a lot of just... What's the word? For input and movement, yeah. Like, the very input-heavy games, um, you mostly just move properly. And different games have different types of movement. Uh, this game, um, hold on. Uh, Aya kind of controls like she's on butter, if that makes sense. Like, I think the gold standard of RPG, ma oh wait, it's this way. Uh, the gold standard of RPG maker games is probably Corpse Party. As much as I don't like Corpse Party, I still think movement wise, it's easily one of the best ones. But Aya controls like she's on butter. I did, Cor I did, which is how it's funny enough, and I like that one. But yeah, a lot of the games are just uh, ooh, properly. Yeah, Aya is very, very slippery, and it's kind of weird how different RPG makers feel different too. Rune, tell me the input to move it. That sounds about right. Oh, yeah, if you want to grind record in any of these games, they're very just know what, like, where you're moving, what you gotta do. It's very just 
move properly. But horror games in general are very much move properly. Like some games have tricks, but most horror games are going to be optimization of movement. And if you're not moving properly, you're going to be losing time. Which, that is the case. Uh, I'm still just... I'm still just bummed out about everything, chat. Like, you know, it's not going to totally ruin the day, but like... We had nice momentum going. Also, I think I did the vibe check, but uh, hope you're doing good. What game am I most excited for the this marathon? Clock Tower. It's all downhill. I've already gone downhill, though. Yeah, I'm sorry. I don't even blame the crash on going downhill. The moment we finished the first run, it's been downhill since then. It doesn't get better than the first one. <laughs> what could I say? Exactly, Zoris. Vibes? I think I asked about the vibe check, but I hope your vibes are doing a good chat. Mine are... I think it's getting there. They were definitely a lot higher about an hour ago, but... Or, yeah, about an hour ago, but... Oh, what can you do? Bring your first? Exactly. Vibes. I have very mediocre vibes. Just kind of existing. I love finding man. Oh, they've been the cheer one for nine months. Enjoy the Twitch baby, the emote in the system. Thank you. And the system. Yeah, are we doing good? The chainsaw? Yeah, he's also mad and a father. Oh, have you been good? been pretty bad. Oh, it sounds good. Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. Alright, there we go. Hello, key. Oh yeah, she had to clean it. Chai, you must understand. Putting it in a bucket of water, cleaning the toilet key. There you go. Well, that's how it goes. Yeah, look, it's Blue Boy, the man with the blue balls. Ah, oh my god. I'm not saying I agree with Blue Boy here for choking out a child, but I mean, I don't think he's absolutely villainous. This is an evil child, after all. Prov's creation. Which creation would that be? That is my question. Well, Ken Ari Survivor is based. Like, Ark can't beat him. Use my, like, my chin to get my phone. There we go. Oh my god, the knives. I think this is going to cause keybinds to the game, though. Uh, runner preference, but immediately my keybinds are kind of bad, and I'm thinking that myself. Um, I'm glad you like that guide, though. I wrote that guide back in my old job, and I wrote down every single room. It's in chronological like order. It is. Well, for the most part. I want to do better by speedrunning. I think a lot of speedrunning has gotten lazy. 
They're doing every single game I've ever done in a row. Also, I'm pretty excited about it. Or keybinds, um... Honestly, I don't know. It's hard to say. I can say I find on D because they smash a bunch of buttons, but, like, admittedly, I think higher-level runners might be better at that. Just because I'm not entirely sure, Delta. I'm good man. I tried. That's a try. All right, now I gotta mash buttons. Oh, it's like F2 or something. I, I have mine on D though. But yeah, funny enough, I didn't know my fourth game, or my, my fourth game was Sound Holy Arcade and my second game was Fran Bell. Kind of funny on the, uh, the way the order has been going. Hold on, um... I thought it was chains off. Wrong one. There we go. Wait, give me that. There we go. And so far, it's been good. I've had this idea for a while. I've kind of felt like, uh, in terms of speedrunning, there's a lot of uh, questions to be had. Especially in the world of um, identity, I suppose. But I am remembering how many games I really enjoy playing. So... And honestly, I don't know, I've never really seen a lot of people really do a marathon like this. I always like doing bigger and better things, and I'm going to keep pushing forward on that. I have a lot of creative ideas, and I don't know how many of them ever actually, you know. I don't know how many of them are appreciated, I suppose. House Caravan? Yeah, it's a 30 second meme game. I learned it for April Fools years ago. If you see a lot of weird games, a lot of them could be April Fools baits. I am bummed out though because we had a stream crash, which is quite sad. I'm Rachel, and you're getting something maxi. Hope we're doing good, and hope you're doing good. Enjoy the emotes and the scissors, and make sure you thank Rambo Rachel, the girl who makes stews. Chat, look, it's me after my stream crashed. Stare? Any stares in chat? There's one. Yeah, tired mind. Ah. Well, we got that, have that dicey stare. Oh, that's a duck. How do you like ducks? Alright. The entire website crashed? Everyone else looks good on mine, I think. Was it the website? I don't think it was the website, was it? Maybe no one else is streaming right now. It wasn't really punchy. My OBS had an issue because uh, I think the games I was doing, I saw my OBS free, so it could be that. How are we doing today, punchy? I'm on game five. Everyone else says low viewership? I can't tell. Honestly. Like, everyone seems like they started their stream, but, like, it seems about appropriate. I don't know. It's like, before the crash, or, like, 1,800. 1,700, I think. And now, um, you know, we're not in a bad spot in Italy, but, like, it definitely hurts having your view count drop by a thousand. And now, chat, look, it's the rats! Spam rats!
Uh, so it's 340. Yeah, the only thing was with me. You know, that's what happens. I'm more just bummed out that my VOD got split. Like, that's really the thing that annoys me, because now I have to, like, download my VODs and, like, edit them together normally. I can't just use the Twitch thing. You know, I guess I could experiment by making more of a... I don't know. Nah, nah, I want to just do whole VODs. I don't, like, want to do anything more than that. And I'll have to edit them. Isn't there an Omax 7 TV setting? Well, I guess a lot of, uh, I guess a thousand people don't have it. So, uh, yeah. Uh, okay. I'm gonna yellow, by the way. Ready? SMT in 2023. Why don't you use to get 7 TV? Because I don't like change. Oh. By the way, we're saving the game. Why? Uh, yeah, I ain't gonna reset this shit if I die. I don't think I will. But, uh... Yeah, I don't want to reset this run. I've already kind of had to reset all of Arcade, because I accidentally clicked out of Arcade. By the way, Punchy. I accidentally clicked out of Sun Hole the Arcade. I had the worst thing happen, and it was it was quite sad. Can you save? Yeah, I made my save save here. Like I don't think I'm gonna need it, but like you know, it doesn't guess. Like that used to kill me a lot. Oh, these days not as much, but yeah, you never know. You never know. Let's go for quick and easy video cutting and stitching. I have editing software I can use. It's more the fact I wanted to use Twitch's basic one where I could just easily highlight a whole VOD and then I could port it over to YouTube. It's a lot easier that way. Now I need to download things and import it to Adobe Premiere. And... I also didn't want to have to download two five-hour VODs. Well, I'll try. Let's see a cool trick. Whee! We just yellow it. Yeah, YouTube can switch after import. Is that an option? I don't think you can do that. Unless I can download the VODs? I don't know. I normally don't have to download five hours of videos. <laughs> Happens with the best of us, tired of mine. Good night. But yeah, shot. I wanted to embark on greater feats of speedrunning. And then by the end of it, no one can tell me I can't run 160 games. That's the grand thing about it. You'd be surprised, well, Chad. That's some real egos in speedrunning. Ah, of course I do. I mean, like, it's kind of funny because, like, a good chunk of the games are really small, and then a good chunk of the games are also really fucking long. And the thing is someone telling me, oh, you run a lot of games for like five minutes. I also run a lot of games that are eight hours. <laughs> I run several games that are over two hours. They definitely count and make up the difference, I assure you. <laughs> As long as I'm gonna run, you give from memories of 12 hours. Like, it was fucking long and painful. A rising off-the-record co-op run win? I don't know. I don't really do a lot of co-op runs. I have a co-op idea I want to do in the future, but I'm not exactly there yet. Probably after all my health progress. 
tier one in 30 months. A dicey, cozy, a dicey rat. Thank you very much, brand managers, for the tournament 30 months. They're the blue and bloody scissors, one of my favorite colors, and thank you. Hope you're doing good, and cheers, brand managers. Someone share its call pretty quick? No, it's not. No, it's gonna be over the course of many days. I'm gonna, like, once we get, like, maybe the 10 hour mark, well, um, what's the word? Like, I want to pause the timer at the 10 hour mark or something, or, like, uh, take note of what we got, and then we'll continue. It's probably gonna take several weeks, and, uh, Punchy, if I tried doing it, I would have to stream for a week straight. Like, I think I would die if I tried doing it all at once. Like, I would literally die. So the only rule is I don't need to get a good time. Every game just needs to be completed. Oh, okay. Correct. Like, I'm estimating that we probably run about, uh, what's the word? It's safe to say I probably run about 160 hours a game. That does slammer. That it does. Okay. So, um... Yeah. It could be more than 160 or less than 160 hours. It's hard to say, because, like, again, some games are, like, two minutes and other games are, like, 12 hours. And there's not really a good way of weighing that, you know? Oh, yeah. I'm just like that. I, I don't know, I'm just saying. And plenty of examples. Go. It's also one of those Mr. Hellkey roller coaster store adventure. It could be. I'm, down, I'm glad they set a volcano in here, right? That just has a volcano chilling. Woo. But yeah, and also punching, in case you're wondering as well, um, the way I'm um, calculating the games is, well, for one, I'm not even sticking entirely to chronological order because um, I still want community voting to be a thing. But uh, with that, I'm mostly going back to my Twitch VODs and I am looking at uh, the oldest VODs in my channel. And then I'm kind of looking roughly upon that when I highlighted everything. But it's how I remember that apparently Franbo was the second game I did. Everyone now just have a volcano under the house? I don't dead like coast. I have to go down the street. I think they call it the San Andreas Fault. Huh? Well, it's funny. Apparently, Hello Kitty Island Adventure actually is a game now. They actually finally turned that into a game. Which, uh, kind of wild to think in our current year that happened. Which MFN run are you doing? Uh, honestly, uh, I kind of did a rough run, which was, uh, no major glitches. Uh, just so I could learn the game, because I had time left over when I beat it. Um, but I've been watching, um, Damajugo do it. Honestly, I'd probably want to do no major glitches, because I kind of want to go through every level. Like, the glitches seem cool to, like, skip everything, but I kind of want to do all the levels. Like, it was fun that way. Nope, it's finally becoming a game. I'm just gonna got two skips are really bad. Yeah, I saw those. 
like I, I, the skips look fun, but like admittedly, no major glitch just seems more fun. But the the latest games that I learned before doing this was Gregory Horror Show and My Friendly Neighborhood. Which, by the way, My Friendly Neighborhood is the last game we'll do. That is going to be the very last game. I never did Jaws Unleashed as a speedrun. I did it casually. I can't actually speedrun that game for a funny reason, Senonosuke. I don't have a PS2 that can run it, meaning I'll have to get another version of the game, potentially. Ooh. Uh, got my answer. All right, chat. We're almost done with Madfather. It took an hour. It took like twenty minutes longer than it needed to because of the stream crash. Jaws froze on PS2. Oh, Dave the Hatman. Yeah. Um, Jaws Unleashed is only compatible with Fatboy PS2. So if you run it on a slim, it literally won't work. It's stupid. It's enough for his birthday day. Nice, J Rex. Oh, it's a nice time. But yeah, uh, it's kind of funny though, looking at the spread of games that I learned. Oh, hold on. Let's see what I learned in my first five chats. Um, fortunate but funny? Which one? Oh, the Jaws one? Oh, no, it's fine. The spread of games I learned we had Clock Tower, Homecoming, or uh, Frambo, Sound of the Arcade, and Madfather. Hey, did I get a late start? No, my stream crashed about six hours in. I've been streaming for about six hours. Uh, the stream crashed, my viewership dropped by about a thousand. Which, um, you know, all things considered, I can't really complain that we're still at 800, but, like, uh, y the idea of dropping a thousand viewers is fucking wild. Uh, if I'm arguing for... Oh, uh, Abu, I'm not doing My Friendly Neighborhood for about, um... If I had to guess, about maybe two weeks. Maybe three weeks. It's going to be weeks. Like, there is a... I have to add a lot. Yeah, there's a lot of games. I'll just show the last split. Bin. Oh, bin. Oh, we did. Yeah, so uh, for those of you who missed it, I mentioned Mad Father to me, I think, is about a 3 out of 5. I think it is an okay run. I don't think it's great. I don't think it's bad. Um, I think if there's less dialogue skipping, like, there's a lot of dialogue in that game. Like, it's a dialogue-heavy game. A lot of RPG makers are, but it's definitely more so than, like, other games, as weird as that seems. It's weird to put. Uh, anyway, though, we're now on Little Nightmares. And chat, Little Nightmares, this game is a game I fell in love with. I played it, and I thought it was great, and I hard-grinded this game for a while. Uh, this game is quite important to me, because it taught me that having a world record is pointless. Anyway, three, two, one, let's, uh, let's do this shit. Oh. So, in case you're wondering, I ran a lot of Little Nightmares, and back when I first started streaming, I actually did hard grind games for a while. And I wasn't bad at them by any means. Um, back when I ran Little Nightmares, world record was at 39, like, 30. And it was held by a runner by the name of Alyssa Mint and Chip. Um, Alyssa kind of dominated the game, and while she had that 39, 30, uh, the next closest runner was a 43 before I got into the game. After that, I got sub 43 and I kept pushing it down. I literally grinded this game out for like maybe a month, a good, a good month or so. And I uh, eventually beat it. It was hundreds of runs and I, I got I got myself a thub. I got world record in a little nightmares. Within three days, it got beat. I know what you're thinking. No, I mean, runners want to defend their title, right? Like. That's gonna happen. Yes, I agree with you. That will happen. Um, but uh, I didn't get beat by Alyssa. No, uh, Alyssa retired at that point. Uh, another runner, out of nowhere, came in and beat my time. Uh, before I had it, they didn't beat any times. The moment I got it, dead. GG. Ah, uh, hold on, it's gonna be a little bit. This is fun glitch. Uh, hold on, chat. If else again, I'm a loser. Let's do this. Ready? Yeah! Alright. That's cool glitch. You can uh, actually... There's a lot of tech in this game. It's really fun. I really like this game. It's more just the case of... 
My relationship with this game is a lot healthier now than it used to be. I record for three days. That will happen a lot. Whenever I get record, it almost always gets taken immediately. Is this bad? No, records are made to be broken. But it's kind of the thing, don't care about record. You're going to lose it almost instantly in many cases. Records don't hold forever. Chat, for years I had rolled the record in a game called The Ring Terror's Realm. Why? No one else ran it. And now people are running it. Now I have to do work as a moderator. Perhelion? Yeah, dude, Perhelion's a talented runner and he kicked ass. And, um... Now I don't know who has it. The, the runs, I think it might be... Is it Rodney who has it now? I don't remember. Either way, Lone Nightmares has popped the fuck off pretty hard. In case you're wondering, by the way, chat, I can tell you practically what the score for this run is. This game's a 5 out of 5. For, for like, S tier. This is an S tier game. Like, out of all the games out there, like, for horse speed running, this is an S tier game. I mean, it's... How, is, how the fuck's it not? It's very, very... Like, this is a skill-heavy game. Oh, wait, what the... I, I thought I was climbing. I think this is actually a really good game to learn how to speedrun too. I think more people should speedrun this game. It's really awesome. It's funny because Little Nightmares 2 got a lot more attention later on, but not a lot of people run this game. 5 out of 5. Yep, this is another 5 out of 5. By the way, I'm trying to withhold my own biases. I won't let, I won't let that be known. Like, I want to say it right now. Do you know how I, you know how I know I'm withholding my biases? Fox Tower got a 4 out of 5. Well, funny enough, this helped a lot, but he actually didn't find the most toxic skip. I don't remember who did it. I think it may have been Rodney. Kick bomb Rodney. I could be wrong. I may have been Perhelion, but the meanest skip in this game that was found was there's an out of bounds that requires you to get pushed by a chef. I don't do that skip. Uh, Dist helped find some really cool skips, though, and I think I do the ones that Dist found, but I don't do the ones after that. I know how they work. I don't, I'm just, I'm not going to do them. They're ridiculous. I think Dist led to the finding of two, which was, uh, a swing that is not always done because it's not really worth going for if you miss it. And then a, um, one I'll show you when we get to it. Uh, by the way, Chad, there's a skip here. I don't know how to do it, um, which is you can have these blocks jut you across the room. I could never figure out how that shit works. I have no idea. I think you trip into the blocks, but like it's just something I never figured out. And like there's a lot of tech in this game I don't know how to do anymore, but also uh, my relationship with Little Nightmares isn't the same as it used to be. I kind of mentioned the whole idea that I don't really want to grind this game the way I did because admittedly out of all the games that I grinded, like, I remember grinding this game, like, every day. And then just having it, you know, lost in three days really kind of fucked with me. Like, I have a very respectable relationship from this game away. I still have immense respect for this game, but, like... Do you ever have respect for, like, an ex-girlfriend chat? Every now and again you might grab coffee, but, like... You know damn well why you're not going to get back together. That's this game. No? Oh. Well. You get the point. Juo? I don't know if Juo's still here. Also, chat, here's the hunger skip. Check this out. I love doing these, by the way. You can skip hunger. By the way, I landed two for two right now. That was a Mayflower, you're doing good. Boom. I'm two for two at the moment. You don't need to get that one because you, you have to wait for food anyway. So talk to you and be friends with the active internet players in the end. It's been eight years. I mean, people drift and people grow. You might not always have the time and that's okay. But I don't know, neither did I for a while. Uh, gave that, man. Uh, when I was younger, I never really talked to a lot of my exes. That exes ended really badly, or, uh, actually, that was maybe the main reason why. When I started getting older, there's, like, definitely a, you know, an extra two I still talk to I'm really friendly with, and, like, I know what the issue was, and it was nothing that was, like, hateful. Here we go. One moment. So, chat, I think the, I... I could be wrong. I think the other skip that was kind of led to by Dist, I don't know if he found it, but I think someone in his community may have allowed it out. I could be wrong. Um, 
I'm trying to remember the history of this game. Because it's fortunate found the sausage skip or the sausage swing. Which the problem with that skip is while it is good, you don't always land it, and it's only worth going for once. So if you miss it, you don't get it. But the um the other one is about right here, and what happens normally is you would, like, go down, like, a giant chain, and then you would, um, like, do some, like, running away from slugs. But you can actually just backtrack, and it's faster. This guy. Oh, that's a good way. That's good they're able to recognize that. All right, cool. Like, in recent times, I suppose we only have, uh, I guess, one, uh, let's say X. That's not really the best to me. Uh, let's yellow it, by the way. So chat, here's the skip I was talking about. By the way, this is really difficult. First try, fucking easy. Boom, baby. Okay, that's the skip. Oh, God! Son of a bitch! No! <laughs> Shut up. I got the skip. Dude, what the f Oh my god. All right, so I got it twice now. I'm just messing up the easy part. That's fine. I do want to say that uh, the skip happened after I was grinding for record. Oh, God, that was a rough one. Wait. So there's a reason why I'm not the greatest at this. Well, in case you're wondering why I'm taking it slow, you can accidentally fall on the wall, and if that happens, you, uh, have to reset. There we go. There it is. Okay. That's what we have to want. Yeah, it's kind of awkward. You have to, like, jump at a very particular angle. It's kind of a pain. I'm, I'm glad you backed me, Flower. All right, let's see. All right, we good and nice. There we go. As long as I don't fall off the cliff or anything. So, that's the way I describe this game. That being said, there's been a really thriving community of speedrunners in this game, and there's been a lot of people who've uh, found their way. Although, I guess in general, like, I don't think people really remember all that I did for this game, which was mostly just as hard pushing it early. I put a lot of work into this game. Even now, I don't even know how many people actually know that I run this game. Uh, no, my stream crashed and I lost about a thousand viewers. So, uh, yeah. I got the skip. We're fine. But I guess in general, people who don't like, like, really glitch-heavy runs, all this game does have more glitches than it used to, it's still really good. Like, check this out. There's a uh, trick you can do right here where you jump, and then you land on this thing, and it skips the, uh, having to, like, get out of bed and platform. It's really cool, right? 
I gained one back? Well, thank you, at least. Hey, dear Smith. Thank you for gifting out a sub. Going to, uh, Altair's. Altair's. Enjoy the emotes in the citadel. Thank you, dear Smith. It is appreciated. Now! Yeah. Oh, and I'm here to refresh. I suppose that's fair. Look, the ape. Anyway, chat. Uh, I guess I need part about this game I want to talk about. Be wondering, I mean, is he playing on mouse or is he playing on keyboard? Oh, some parts of the game use mouse, other parts use keyboard. Like right now, use keyboard. Because this is the most important skip, the hunger skip. So what happens is you um do that. Uh, you just force a trip. I like I hold A and I mash D, and then you can uh, force a trip. So we're gonna do it at certain parts. Like we'll be doing it right here. Uh, there's a lot of a lot of fun stuff there. That's one of those things. Once you get the hang of it, it's pretty easy. Oh, that's more speed running. Ah, I, I greeted. I got greedy there. I got two or three. So right now I'm four for five. And I got the sleeper crowd. Yeah, but I mean, even still. Ah, there we go. I like how the only time I've ever gotten first try on that skip, I immediately died to the easy part. I was sad. I, I'm bummed out. I like, I'm, 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 I'm fun bummed out of that one. That's quite fun, man. I'm definitely enjoying remembering how I got into all these games. And then just a lot of the moves have con kind of gone with it. Yeah, when I was really, when I, in 2018, when I really started getting into speedrunning, I tried making it a goal that every week I wanted to learn a new game. And I did that for a while. Uh, a lot of games... Oh, wait. What the, this way. Some games have stuck a lot better than others. Ah, oh, really? Oh, God damn it. I thought it was close to I don't talk about. It's been mostly nice. I'm still bummed out that I pretty much lost my progress for the day. But, I mean, we're, we're getting it back till I guess. Alright, let's go. One. Two, three. Good. No, uh, it's uh, a lot of people sleep in the stream day of the hat, man. A lot of people can't really refresh because admittedly you're on the sleeping stream. Like, a lot of people who uh, watch the stream definitely uh, lurk for long periods of time overnight. But they can't really refresh because, um, you know, they're sleeping. I've kind of wondering for a while, because, you, you know, you always wonder the view counts and everything, but yeah. As well, I guess, you know, people always kind of wondered about, like, the validity of their own streaming. So, like, oh, I got, is it legit? Am I really doing this good? You know what, chat? You know what's kind of comforting in a way? It's not entirely comforting, but it's pretty comforting. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna call any names. It's absolutely not. And no worries, Corvo. No worries at all. You're allowed to do that. Something that's comforting about the world of lurkers. The, the lurk. Right. At the end of every single stream for about three years now, whenever I end stream and start giving the end of the announcements, my viewership drops like by hundreds. Like, I know a lot of people mention the uh oh um is the uh the raid number so much different. I know why the raid number's lower. Because whenever I end, I see 
Oh, like we're at 800, we'll drop down to 500. Because <laughs> there's just people like, oh, he's done. I'm out. <laughs> Which, it's not bad at all, by the way. You're allowed to do that. In fact, keep doing it. It's not a problem at all with me. It's, just, it's one of those things I know. It's like, well, be real people are definitely awake and they're definitely watching. <laughs> It's kind of comforting in a way. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. Honestly, I would say nothing wrong with that at all. But, you know, as I've streamed for so many years, I... I get to see that. Yeah, that's a nice thing. Guilty? Hey, don't be guilty at all. You're good. I also didn't mention anything by name, because, again, I don't know who all does why. I'm just... Thank you, talk about for the 100 I videos. I previously promised some noise, so here's some more. That is fair. That's fair. Oh, got my ass. Oh, there you go. Allowed to enjoy the lurk. I'm the more of a Leon kind of man. Brings me the joy I need. They're all good. Again, a lot of people will do that. Yeah, it's kind of fun because you get like people have different Twitch habits. I know a lot of people who like sleep to streams, and it's nice. I would do that if I had like speakers on my computer. I don't have speakers on my computer. I use headphones. Awesome. No worries there, BP. Use my phone. I don't want my phone dying in the middle of the night. It's one of my alarm clocks. Oh, what the? Fine. You know, person raid? Nothing wrong with that, Coral. Nothing wrong with that at all. I make the jump. Make the jump. All right, chat. Let's see if I get a cool skip here. Jander has a lot of cool tech. But it has been really neat seeing how I guess things have evolved over time. Haha, <laughs> dumbass. Oh, he's chasing me. Oh, I got the skip. A little bit sloppy, but I got it. Hey, I got that slide, too. I was a sloppy stream. I want to see if it was a good way to support the streamer and be subbed. Oh, absolutely. It definitely does help. That's why I appreciate the sleep stream. But also, that's kind of probably why it dropped by a lot. A lot of people can't refresh because they're sleeping. I'm Jexy. Also was streaming on TV. Nice. I like Little Nightmares too, but holy shit, that run is wild. Like, I blame Dist entirely for, uh, why Little Nightmares 2, I uh, do not want to run. They're all good day of the hat, man. One, two, as I get the three. Nice. Hey, Dismay, you're going to send the Dave the Hot Man. Go ahead and email to the citizen. Thank you very much, Dismay. Nice. Anything about the game? Uh, so the main reason I don't run it is because there's a glitch where you literally have to launch mono uh, a thousand feet in the air. And every skip in that game is difficult as fuck. This game's cozy. This game's nice. The Lammers 2 is like... You've, have you seen lately the Barbie and Oppenheimer memes where it's like the uh, Barbie chilling, like, you know, happy in her car and then Oppenheimer looking at the camera all sad? That's all Lammers 1 and 2 in comparison as a speedrun. Oh, God damn it. Unlucky. Boat physics. Like, no, 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 this game has tricks, but they're not, like, brutal. And this game's tricks are mostly pretty fair. 
Speaking of which, Chad, uh, let me show you why I like this speedrun. Well, first off, movement's fun. Second off, check it out. So, this is gonna be the Jander skip. Pay attention, Chad. I'm only gonna say this once. Why? We're doing it once. So, what's gonna happen is I'm gonna run to the middle right here. I'm gonna wait for the Jander. I'm gonna wait for him to make a weird noise. I'm gonna jump. What that does is that breaks his AI because now he's far behind. So, I'm now gonna make my way into the cage and I'm now gonna kill him immediately. Uh, by pulling that early before he gets in the room, it breaks out the fight and now I can touch his arm. By doing that, uh. Ready? Kill him! He's dead. You skip uh, the majority of that fight, which is really good because a lot of people are like, oh, I have to avoid him, I have to hide, but yeah, good shit right there. Still got the moves, chat, still got the moves. Good moves at that. Noodle arms was denoodled. That he was. Yeah, it's a lot of cool shit like that. Now, that being said, there is a trick here I don't know what to do. And I don't plan on learning it because it is wild. And that skip is you get a chef to shove you into a wall and uh, you go out of bounds. Wait, chat, am I going to make the hook? Let's see. Oh, no, I didn't make it. You can never make that one. I'm sorry. I was lying to you. I I'm debating you. Exactly, Dark Reaper. Have a mustache? I do. People call it the reverse Hitler. Or the Fu Manchu. My favorite part, by the way, is every now and again I'll have dudes trying to insult my mustache. And, uh, if you're wondering, do I care if dudes are insulting my mustache? No. Because I don't care what dudes think about, my, about me. I'm not gonna lie, I have never at any moment uh, have given a shit what a dude thinks about my appearance. Why? I'm not in dudes. Rat! Delicious rat shot. Exactly. Oh, the command for book guy. There are some funny people. Not just the nature of Twitch. Exactly, D man. Anyone want to grill the rat chat? If I'm going to be proud. Oh, I'm very proud of myself. I like how I look, Chad. I like my mustache. Oh, hold on. Am I going to... I'm, I'm going to die. Yep. That's reset. That's fine. Luckily, this game has generous checkpoints. But yeah, the out of bounds is you get this chef to shove you through the wall on the right. So I have no idea why I'm really good at getting that trick second try. Selling burgers for the rats. Good. You missed the arcade? Uh, I did two runs of it too, though, Nexus. Because the first run ended up crashing. Okay. Oh, I love doing that, by the way, chat. It's faster and it's a swag strat. Although, tentatively, you only do it during no major glitches. Oh, yeah, again, you get busy living or you get busy dying. It took me a lot of practice to get those raptors done. The, the, the zoomer speedrunners these days, they don't do that trick anymore, Chad. Why? It's too risky. He'll say it's not worth killing you run over like two seconds. Oh, 
exactly tired of mine. Exactly. Kids these... Wait, hold on. Kids these days. I don't have any more left. I'm faking it. That big marathon. I did poem. We're going long. Oh, we're doing a lot of speed runs in a row. Thank you. Hooray! Freedom. Yeah, there's some wild tech found in this game. Although, you know what's nice about this game? And I really do like it. Now, I have mentioned chat that, you know, outside of stray runnings of this game, I don't really run this game anymore. I'm really happy with how the community has been going. There's always been kind of a dedicated community of runners in this game, and they put a lot of work into the uh, the grind. They found wild tech, wild optimizations, and just a lot more than when I was doing it. And it's kind of nice to know that a game is continuously evolving even after you're gone. No, I never ran Inside Out, or Inside. Uh, I, I think, I know the game of time, but I never ran it. I never played it, in fact, but I know what you're talking about. It's kind of like Limbo, right? Damn, so close. Get in there, ham. Thank you. And if you love tech, if I grind in this game consistently, yes, I absolutely can. You know, so, oh, assuming I can actually do it. I need to chat. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's sausage. I need 2.5 sausages. That is enough for a growing lass. All right, cool. Get sausage. How long is the stream today? Uh, we'll see. Well, it depends on how we're feeling and how we're doing. Like, with the stream crash, I'm not sure how much I want to go for, just because I do feel a bit bad about the stream crash, but... Uh, let's say anywhere from 8 to 12 hours. I did want to originally go longer, but with the stream crash, I don't know if I want to. I will see. Dude, he fucking went for it immediately. This man, what the? F Airplay 2? No. I missed the moment he mastered? Yep, it's right after this. Dude, my man with lightning hands. And she? I've never seen him attack that quickly. The little Emmer's uh, to a prequel for this? Yes. Lightning hands over here. Hey, look, that's what he normally does. And then you just juke him, and then you're good to go. Can't believe it, Chet. That man's ready for Evo. He's going. <laughs> It should be fun, Palm. Now, chat, let me show you the most important thing I end up uh, developing for the run. This is my one major contribution. Ready? So, it was found that there's a strat where you can jump on the table. Originally, they went to the back. I uh, made he'll go to the front. And I made it both safer and faster for a strat. That movement right there is my grand contribution to the speedrun. Oh, wait, wait, I just found another skip. It's a very minor one, but I think he found a jump right here. As a magnum opus for this game, yes. Oh, uh, let's go one more go. 
damn straight, son. Look at that. You're over the door by yourself. Yeah, you know what? It's weird what I'm getting and not getting in this run. Like, what the fuck? How did I get that? I know, this is found by a casual player named Tab. So you just... Oh, uh, hold on one more. You can do this. Oh, close one. Might take me a few tries. If I'm out any skips, I probably found a good amount, but like, a lot of stuff just happens. But yeah, Little Nightmares is right after this. There we go. Wait, I'm on keyboard. There we go. Yeah, I think sure whenever I find skips, they tend to get patched these days. See ya, nerds. You know they can hit you with the wine bottle? It's rare, but they can't hit you with the wine bottle. They did. They did Dave that man. I remember that one. Do not. Not fall off. What the fuck? Okay. He almost fell off. And I would have cried. I don't know why she's about to fall off. It's so weird. Oh, yeah. Although, Black Magus right now, I'm gaming for 21 months. Enjoy the emotion and series, and thank you. I'll be doing good today. It is. Also, cheers. Is old enough to drink in the States. You know, they Tuesday. might. They might be P. Thank you, Black Magus. I'm be doing good today. Also, cheers. You know what one of the weird things about today is, though, chat? I... I I don't think I really, like, I don't know. I don't ever see a lot of, uh, runners of the various, I don't know, games I do. Choke for said games, I guess. And the more I think about it, I definitely feel a bit, um, separated from the speedrun communities as a whole. It's a really weird area. I'm not sure how to put it. But there's probably a few reasons for that. Well, one kind of tends to be the other Crimson Dakota. It's been alright. Um, runs have been okay, but my stream crashed. I ended up dropping uh, down by 1k in terms of viewership. Did it? Yeah. And then, uh, Mad Father was kind of rough, and then Sonic the Arcade, I actually had to reset. Because I accidentally crashed it. In hindsight, I guess doing Sonic the Arcade would actually break my computer, which would make sense. But even still. See. All right, time for the ending here, chat. We have a lot, well, not the ending, but we have a lot of fun trips in this level. I also have a hungry man just chilling at this table. Look at this dude. He's just chilling. All the games in general? Which sense? Oh yeah, but I guess that is a weird thing though, chat. I've really never felt like I've really connected with many speedrun communities. Like, maybe one or two I feel somewhat connected to. In most cases, I'm kind of friends with fringe, uh, like, general fringe, I suppose. I don't know, so I get the saw to skip. Wait, hold on. Game. Damn, what the fuck? Damn, nope, didn't get it. Not worth it. Well, went through it once. In fact, the setup took longer than it would have taken for me just to do the trick. Nice. Alright, 
Good stuff. Hey, look, we did a check. Back in business. That, no, I did not. No. I did not. Hungry boys, they are hungry. And Laura's been so obsessed with eating you. Well, it's called gluttony. They're gluttons. Not any part of spearing communities? Wait, what the fuck? Where did it land? Wait, what? I mean, it'd be nice to be a part of speedrunning communities. It's kind of nice to see everyone in the reindeer games and wanting, I think anyone wants to feel like they belong. I like how I choked on that. It's really weird what I'm doing good on and what I'm not doing good on. Oh, boy, I crushed. Uh, it's gonna take a couple attempts, yeah. This gets kind of hard. Yeah, let's make it go here. Yeah, honestly, I think most of you want to have a sense of belonging. Dude, what the fuck is going on here? Used to be so good at this kid, but lately I fucked this one up. I don't know why. It's weird what I can get again. What weird I can get right, what I can get wrong. Anyway, let me describe it really quick, chat. So the idea with the skip is that normally you'd have to like lure this guy, run back and go over him. But there's a like a, a seam on the wall here. You can just kind of go through. I'm not getting it. Might take a few attempts here, but we'll be fine. Nah, this isn't a cycle thing. This one's more of the uh like the way I normally do it is that you need six to be like hugging the wall. Like that. And then you need to not bunk on the wall after that. Oh god, I hate the camera in this game so fucking much sometimes. This game does have a problem, and the problem with this game is uh the 2.5D movement's kinda awkward. Still a really good game speed on just uh there we go. Oh, I got that time. There we go, see. Yeah, it's never GG till you're officially done with this. an awkward amount of time. Good question. Chat, you ready? POV, you're a girl who joined a Discord server. Or I guess a gaming Discord server, I should say. You know, I guess I could have said an average speedrunning community, but then it kind of just be, uh, and I just kind of be confirming the fact that maybe that's why people don't want to talk to me in the world of speedrunning. Because I'm kind of a dick. For real? For real. You see a single fedora there? Well, they're chasing, they fell off. With the anonymous mask, though, didn't you see that guy wearing his anonymous mask? <laughs> that makes sense, Chad. That's why people don't like me, because I'm an asshole. That would make sense. By the way, okay, that's the button. I was like, what button do I have for my split button? I gotta remember that. Really? Where the fuck is it? Alright, I finally got it. I, I took way too long on that. I lost time doing that. False? Why has been kind to you? That's fair. A uh, single lady? Well, they're trying to hunt her down, apparently. I need to check. Look, sausage. Except it's not sausage. It's man.
Hey, I got the skip here, I think. Ready? Woo! I love that skip. You can actually beat the elevator. Beat the elevator allegation shit. Get it. Again, weird what I can and can get. Also, this game has a really weird trick that's kind of annoying. It's called pulsing. Uh, while you're sprinting, you don't hold down the button. You let go of it while sprinting. Is it, she won't white? She won't like quite wind down immediately. And actually, save a bit of stamina this way. That me, Jessica, my be. It's actually the smallest of Jessica. The smallest of nightmares. I anyway, with the tier 3 of 31 months. Enjoy the emotes and the scissors and the advanced emotes. Thank you. Hope you're doing good. My stream crashed. I'm sad about that. A video game world I like to live in forever? I don't know. Not really, uh, not really any good answers, I don't think. Outside of that, something that's uh, absolutely hedonistic, I suppose. Oh, well, all too well. Yeah. Uh, viewership dropped by 1,000. Which is, uh, wild to think about. All right, chat, we're done. I, now I do a little bunny hops. Almost done. Getting close. You see that my problem with a lot of games are like farming sims is that, uh, Chat, I like the sense of progression and the drive and the passion of man. As much as I like games like Animal Crossing and games like that, I get bored quickly because I kind of need direction. A drive, baby. Oh, I don't want to be a farmer, no. The cozy life of being a farmer is not for me. Ah. All right, let's do this. Hey, look, this time I'm gonna get the weird fucking spawn underneath me. Perfect. And then chat, next is Mummy D Master, which I think we should be able to get during the, uh, without playing another ad, unless I really fuck up. the funny part is, by the way, all of these games that did before Dead Rising, I think a lot will know me for Dead Rising. That is the nature of things, I guess. <sighs> oh, God, big stretch. I've definitely played it a few times in the modern age. Today's gem was arguably Franbo. I think Franbo was the big, uh, like, surprise of the day for a lot of people. Same time, first thing this for me. Oh, I do this game decently often. I've definitely done this game a couple times this, like, a few times this year, in fact. Oh, it's going to Lily Fangs and Freckles. That'll be doing good. Yep, Frambo is in the VOD. Frambo. Anyway, to celebrate every time, we have to take a bite. You gotta. I mean, just, just one bite, Chad. Come on. A little bit of cannibalism never hurt anybody. 
Except don't commit cannibalism. It will hurt you. Welcome to Flavortown. Um, I'm not sure tonight. Well, that's nice. Yeah, we'll probably be going for a good bit more, although I'm not sure how much more, but we shall see. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I lost two followers on Twitter. How did I lose two followers on Twitter? <laughs> Every time, man. God, I think I've been at the same follow count on Twitter. For, oh, I guess people are deleting their X. That's X now. It is Nervy Destroyer. Anyway, chat, we have now officially done six games out of 160. Game number six and Little Nightmares S tier game. Five out of five. This game's fucking great as a speedrun. So. I mean, I'm not walking through all this. This is a long cutscene. She kills all the heavy people. All right, let's go. And it was a Maki trailer. I think I, I think I seen it online, but not quite yet. Yeah, ten buff followers. Well, there you go. Well, that's unfortunate. But still. There we go. All right, chat. Three, two, one. Let's go. Anyway, the Mummy Demastered. Uh, I actually ran this game because it came out when I started learning games, and this game was awesome. Uh, I really wanted to put work into this game, and you know what? I'm happy I did. Um, I actually ended up routing a lot of this game. It's like one of the first new games I ever want to learn. Like when the game came out, I tried learning this game. And uh, for what it's worth, I put some good work into it, chat. Um, the only thing I really found was that you can damage abuse, but I didn't really find any spots that are applicable to the run. Uh, the, the spot I found was to get the flamethrower, but they found other spots later on. Game that's rather than the movie it's based on. By the way, is the game loud at all? I can turn it down. I might need to do that, in fact. Right, let me do that right now. I, I don't trust this game. It's actually a little bit loud. No, it's actually quiet. Never mind. The game's as loud as fuck. Alright. It does suck, I'd watch. Any of your taste. It's accurate. Right, we should be good, hopefully. And I'm trying to the world's greatest strategy. Yes. This looks dope. It is. I gotta learn many games in my tenure, chat. Anyway, ready for a banger? Because you're about to get a banger. Why this game suck? It doesn't. The movie sucks. This game is awesome. Yeah, it's kind of neat though. I kind of jumped around a lot of uh, different types of horror games. You like the Mummy movie, the 2016 or 27, the one Tom Cruise? I'm ashamed of you. God no. Well, that's why we're saying the Mummy 2016 sucks. I'm telling you that was 2017. It still. You kind of get to see me in a different element. I, uh... This is actually the very first, like, Metroidvania game I ever played in my life. They did! Well, that came out in 2017, but yeah. Um, and I actually helped route the early speedrun. Which is kind of funny, but also, chat, going more into the idea that I never really felt, like, at home with lost speedrunners. I remember when this game got routed, uh, every single runner on the board became a moderator but me. Which, um... 
And again, my general thoughts on moderation as a whole, but like, I'm not gonna lie, it feels like it's saying a statement that was kind of polluting, uh, I guess, now. Like, maybe just a me issue, man. I don't fucking know. Maybe it's always been a me issue. Can I just up this? Nice. You punch things in this game? No. Game is just the Mummy Demastered. It's a really cool game. I was pissed. Sorry, we didn't get today. But it's like I'm saying, a lot of my general, um, a lot of the things I say, I definitely don't think are unfounded at all, Chad. Weird if that sounds. How's everyone? I'm doing okay. It's okay enough, I think. E okay. I'm kind of lamenting the general idea that I don't think I've ever felt a part of any kind of, uh, Twitch group or uh, speedrunning thing. I thought you one of the upsides of this game is actually based on IGT. So we should be good there to see what I push I get. This is actually one of the only runs that I actually get to see how I did. Something else only is RTA or real time and uh, not too much in uh, IGT. Wait, I kind of need another grenade. Come here, rat. Oh. Uh, that's much of the thing. I mean, it came out after a lot of other Metroidvanias. Back to business. They yeah, also way forward games. So pretty, pretty tight. In case you're wondering, by the way, Chad, for the uh, I guess the the whole thing I talk about, I guess of general feeling and outsider speed running. I bet you're wondering, that just well that happened to me. And also, is there a way for you to get out of it? It likely won't happen with you, and there's no way for me to get out of it. Man. Holy rat. Uh, part of the problem is that I'm a jack of all trades, meaning since I run so many games, uh, I don't think anyone ever really cares to talk to me outside those games, which in fairness, I mean, it makes sense. We only like running and watching certain games, so I do do everything. But with me being such a weirdo, it doesn't really work in the sense of, um... I don't really give you a part of community, I suppose. Yeah, WayForward made this, uh, Gen Agent. Funny enough, one of the favorite things I learned is that there's a picture of, like, the, um, the director. And it's supposed to be, like, uh, an actor, uh, who, um, was, like, in the movie. But they couldn't get the, like, the picture of him that they needed. Uh, because they wanted to, like, get a picture of him for the game. So the director of the game actually, uh, dressed up, uh, and took the picture, which is nice. I learned a lot about this game because I actually got to meet the director of the game. <laughs> He's on the couch for GDQ, and I got to uh, chow with him a bit. He's a nice guy. Shit. Oh, yeah. I guess as a result as well, though, chat, like, I never joined any Twitch teams. I never, like, got, like, involved. But that's kind of a general thing. I never got involved in anything, chat. Anyway, you know what you can get involved in though, chat? This banger of a song. We have a, a round of bone checks in Twitch chat. This is a, absolutely a bone check moment. I try it out. If it's perfect to the song. And look at them go. Look at them go. Look at the boys go. Text anything good. Alright. Alright. 
Get back. Fine. Turn in the chairs, we cool skip. Uh, as long as you're touching a platform, you can jump from them. Bad vibing? Good vibe or bad vibe? I hope the vibes are good. I'm uh, going down memory lane, Texan. There's a lot of games I've ran over the years, and I plan on doing every single one of them. Good vibes? Good to hear it. Boom! First drop. Anyway, there's damage use. Uh, no, not bold check. Bone. <laughs> Bone check. I was Rambo. Better than I remember, funny enough. We'll probably do it again after we're done with all this. Ow. Nice. Oh no, you're good, you're good. It's funny. But yeah, it's kind of wild to think about how many games I've really done. Well, it's a realistically, we haven't struggled too much outside of maybe Frambo. And even then with Frambo, I didn't really struggle. It's more the... I mean, I did. No, I absolutely did. I'm not going to say I didn't. I remembered more than I thought I would, chat. You got to give me credit. There's a good amount of shit I remember for not playing a game since 20... Uh, you know. Twenty eighteen. No, I actually never played Middle of Misfortune. Uh, it's been on my wishlist for the longest time, and I never got around to it. I probably should play that game casually. I was actually asked if I wanted to moderate that game when it happened on speedrun.com, and I didn't, like, I think I am the moderator of that game. I've never played it, though, which is... I actually told the moderator, like, I never played this game. Are you sure I'm going to moderate it? Yeah, yeah, you're good. I was like, oh. Gamer, I like video games. I mean, look, I think they're cool. There's a lot of cool shit out there. And chats, like I said, we're gonna be doing one of every run, except for our Silent Hill of the Arcade, which has two. Fucking Silent Hill of the Arcade. I can't believe that ended up being a resetter already. Any any resetters? Fucking Silent Hill of the Arcade, man. Of all the goddamn games. Yeah, I am salty, but in a fun way. Fucking song over here, okay? It's just so sad. Let's see. Classic RE. Well, I didn't think I would accidentally click out of the game. I'm not gonna lie to you. Ooh, chat. I have a fun poll we could probably make tomorrow. I'll let the naysayers possibly have their moments. We shall see. Oh, God. you plug back in. Um, get back in. God damn, I hate this controller. You finally breaking? Um, game. Do you wanna? Gonna work. What the fuck? Uh, how do I fire gun? I know what to do. I know what to do. Hold on, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I know what to do. Um, what are my keys? What are my keys? What are my keys? Uh, map keys. How the fuck do I shoot? Uh, J? Who the fuck fires with J? Alright, um, that works. Uh, J, H. Swap up an E, okay. 
Alright, hold on. Uh, how do I roll? I'm not gonna be able to roll for a bit. Me and Moe and Chad, I know how to fix this. I know how to fix this. This is gonna be a little bit, though. Um... Uh, action? Is it K or H? H? H. K is rolling, okay. Alright, cool. H. Uh, J. This is gonna be really awkward if I play. Go go! I don't know what that is. God damn it! Come on, why don't you work? This will be fine, chat. This will be fine. I like how I had to essentially learn a new control style while playing the game. Uh, I don't know what you Shogo is, so no, I've never played it. I mean, the scuff was entirely, like, not even my fault. Like, my control, like, nudged and, like, it broke for the control scheme. Alright, but the save is coming up soon, so we should be fun. Shit. I take no blame on any drops I have for momentum right now, chat. You know why? I blame the game. The game should have been playing better. I haven't seen any day of that man, in fact. Is he dead rising now? Oh shit, it probably did. One moment, I'll fix it. There you go. So I knew. Yeah, that helps. Thank you. Alright, that's better. Die straight up. I'm not gonna die right now. Game. Uh, game. Thank you. This is really fucking awkward. Okay. Oh goddamn. I know John Skew. Pretty sure I mentioned it. Let's go. Like I said, chat, I take no blame for shoddy movement right now. Not kill me, I kinda need to be at least somewhat alive. Thank you. I'm playing so fucking safe. Okay, uh, how do I interact with this? Okay. There! Game saved. Alright. Set this shit. All right, you fix. Uh, she's, I had to go. Yeah, the controller wasn't working, and I had no save yet. Sometimes you just gotta make do with what you got, chat. You can't always uh, have the best. Uh... Best uh, setup. Dude, what the fuck is this? for Windows, Dr. Reaper. Oh, we're good. No! Oh, no, Chad! Oh, my, I, oh, my God, I died! Oh, no, what happened? I can't believe it! Oh, my God! I, uh, well, Chad, look, I have to say. We'll be fine. Must be this controller. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't 
All right, chat. I'll exist on this man and win the fight. I died again. I guess uh, just didn't watch of this game, huh? Wow, I can't believe it. Some just wash, aren't I? I mean, like Kylians. Alright, cool. Cats, I'm lying to you. It was merely a ruse. Yeah, you do have a cool skip by uh, damage abusing. And I've now skipped the second boss of the game. Cool, right? Boy, Bone Man. That cool then laugh? I thought it was funny. That's what's important. Where are we, dog? Alright. Oh god, Trey, I can't believe it! Hey, right, put in the work right now, buddy kid. I'll tell you that much. Fish I got caught by a fish? Dude, look at that speed. It's D Master of Oh, it's D Master of the movie. How? Oh. Ah, that's what I said. Ah, yeah, what I said. Stop boning me! Fish. I kind of need that. It's fine. There we go. Oh. Well, it's not like the 2017 movie, but yeah. No, oh, D-Master, it, uh, it says graphically, which human being graphic- uh, human beings existing is better graphically than, uh, video game, yes. That, that was a uh, thing. But I'm making playing it safe. But it does not imply that, no. Damn it. I should have seen the head. I don't know why I didn't see it. It's fine. Lloyd flaming skeleton. Alright, nice. Good brew, right, chat? Alright. 
good stuff so far. Or the D Master 4. Well, this is the only game that's ever used the title. And I guess Bloodborne did, but. Oh, wait, am I gonna make that? Ew. Apparently, I'm gonna make it. Cool. Alright, we did it. Four. So. Luckily, by the way, you get a lot of, you don't get a lot of health, so. Or D make same idea. Yeah, this game's creative though. It's a fun game. I like this game a lot. I said, yeah, we're doing every game, including Lowrider. Lowrider will show up at one point or another. Uh, regardless of how chat may feel about Lowrider, we will be doing Lowrider. Lowrider will be done at one point. Find you a metal slug? Hey, I got you. Exit. <laughs> Well, I'm fucked up here. What the f How did the brain... It's a brain. How did he dodge that? I know, it's a neat thing about this game. Uh, how many games we got left tonight? Uh, we've beaten 6 out of 160 games. So, um, a lot. Goddamn. So chat, this trick actually gets really hard because I don't have the item you need to pass this, and it's kind of awkward. I don't know, Because normally you'd want, like, a, an ability to grab onto ceilings, but I never grabbed it. So, uh, I have to do a running jump, which is not easy. Which means specifically, uh, do not know. It depends on how we're feeling within the somewhere between 8 to 12 hours. God damn, this skip's so fucking difficult. 160? I run a lot of games, Eprog. Yes, I run the most horror games out of literally anybody. I don't care when I say that. Oh, God. Some of the balls. I'll have to do it later. Oh, my God. I hate this skip so much. Yeah, you gotta love it, right? Stay hydrated. Thanks. Oh, I take care of myself. There we go. We're on 161. Well, I said 160 plus. I think the actual one might be well, higher than 161. I guess it's probably. I don't know. 162? I don't actually know the exact number. I thought it was 165, but I realized. Uh, I had a duplicate on there, and I removed two, but I also added one more. I need 162. I know you're me. Thank you. Boom! Yeah. Yeah, I was in charge. Actually, we're doing good. How many days? I have no idea. That's why we're gonna keep going until we're done. So, yeah, you can, I don't know, you can tell a bunch of other people how, uh, I don't know, how excited you are about things. Here's a hard boss fight. Ready? Here's an easy cap. Let's see. But like, yeah, I only have a lot of experience really tear my achievement though, chat. Not gonna lie. Alright. 
Come on. That was gonna turn out today. Yeah, he might. We'll have to see. But also, yeah, today I kinda wanna I don't know if I'm gonna go to normal map, but we'll see because I don't know. Stream died, but we'll see. Long fight. Back, welcome back. Wait, we need you back, you're just here, weren't you? Did hi everyone, yeah. Welcome back, though. All right, Chad, I beat that very difficult boss fight. I know, challenging, I know. Another this human? You're okay, Kotex. I hope that you're doing as good as you can. I can't imagine how difficult that is for you right now. Yeah, you're all good. I just, uh... I saw the message as well. I just want to let you know that. But, yeah, I hope that you're doing as good as you can. If you do need to fence at all, you can talk to chats, and... You can always, uh, type in chats as well, and... Do the... Hold on. Oh god, I messed up the ending. That's fine. Yeah, it's incredibly heavy, so I hope that you'll be alright. I am wishing all the best for you, Kotex. Alright, we here. It's a fun game. Uh, it's a Metroidvania made by WayForward, so you can't really go wrong, right? Kinda hard to fuck up when you got WayForward. <laughs> That's a good thing. Okay! Fell. Go. No, I didn't jump far enough. This is one of the hardest tricks in the game, and it has no white to it. I have no idea why the fuck this is so hard. Like, even casually, like, this is just wildly. Di I think it's because you're meant to come back here later with better power ups, but, like, it's weirdly difficult for how, like, what you're doing. <laughs> Uh, there we go. We made it. Anyway, chat, in case you're wondering, is this mandatory? Absolutely mandatory. Uh, you end up losing, uh, or you end up getting double attack damage by doing this. Yeah. No worries at all, Kotex. I am wishing all the best for you, and I'm hoping that you and your family are going to be good in these, uh, you know, with all the... What's the word? stuff you're gonna have to do. Processes. There's a lot that has to go on with that. I would say grieving, but grieving is kind of the standard, I suppose. Or, like, you're already dirty grieving. Which, you probably know about that one, but yeah, it's gonna be like a, a lot of stuff that's a pain in the ass to deal with, so I don't envy that at all, and I'm hoping you're gonna be alright. Oh god. As well, especially a lot of times, it can feel like, uh, what's the word? Not a lot of places to vent or listen to, or... Oh god, hold on. Uh, there we go. I got... Not like a, a ton of bricks hit you at once in a way. Holy oh, bird. Holy oh, bird. I'm gonna make this. No, I didn't make that fun. Oh, so welcome back, Nelly Q. There you go. You know that for Absolutely. put in the work chat. These are, uh, the mummy's hardest working soldiers right now. These dogs. Now, chat, by the way, you're wondering, how is this a horror game, McDyces? Well, I can actually tell you why it's a horror game. Did you know this game takes place in Britain? Ah! Oh, 
Sorry, chat, but you know how to do it, too. Of course, it's a horror game the whole time. I was gonna tell you, I could, you know, outside of the US, I think the second most viewed country in terms of viewership is Britain. So cheers to any British viewers in sincerity, because I'm glad they enjoy the memes. I'm glad they're quite, uh, you know, polite, all things considered. I'm excited. I suppose we also do a joke pretty equally about uh, the general state of uh, America, so. It's all in good fun. Shit. Back down the town. Clocked out, uh... That's clocked out the horror game. Also accurate. Wow, this is the Mac Daddy of all clock towers. This is Big Ben, not Small Ben. Chat, I'm gonna play it safe, actually. I don't think I need to do this, but, I mean, better have not near the name I have, right? Beautiful. Also, one moment. Game saved. Pause it, because I also want to do that. My controller's unplugged, by the way. Alright, so it just broke last time. That's so weird. Okay. Alright, chat, yeah, it's time for the first actual boss fight of the game. Ready? Go. But an actual boss is not all just me fucking around. It might just be Sarasky. Is somebody raiding? Ha 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 ha. No, no, no. Oh, what the? God damn it. That was such a cheap head. You rats bastard. I recognize the song? I wonder how. Ooh, that's a bad hit.
Hi, Wondrous. There's that song. We're going through all the history of old Ignisus. Done quite a lot, Chad, and a lot of gaming in my in my time. Not bad. Alright, didn't need to save. We're good. Sounds familiar? Yes, that is my rating music, too. That is the music I have been using for raids for quite literally years now. So I guess fun thing, chat. Uh, you actually get to see a lot of uh, where the channel stuff comes from. If you had questions where a lot of this shit comes from, like, dude, you saw my follow alert, you saw my, uh, I guess it'd be, you know, uh, sub icon in general, clock tower. Oh, wait, not this way. I might just be some of the game. Oh, I'm down with that. Ow. Playing nice and safe. There's no reason not to. Whoa. Okay. Nice. Have not say you did that, man. Well, yeah, I mean, I've done, I've done quite a lot of streaming. I know, chat, really quick, I do need to play an ad, so I think I might do it now or heading to the final boss, because I'd rather you not miss the final boss. Um, unfortunately, some of the controller issues did lose more time than I thought we would. But, um... I'm just letting you know now. So I'm gonna do that now. So we have locked control or something in the channel, alright? I'll uh, we'll be there. Uh, we'll probably get ready for the final boss by the time we get there. Yeah, it's just standard 8%. There's not only really 100% or anything, so I'm doing it now. Alright, ready? Ow. Alright, doing it now. Yeah. Prime Gaming. It is for Lacey. Ooh, I put this on. Ow. Ow. Wrong way, by the way. It's fine. Wait. Did I? Wait, where the hell am I going? Twitch Turbo? Uh, it's something on Twitch that lets you watch all of Twitch ad free. No, it's not that one. I got hit by the back of that ghost? What the fuck? Oh, right. That's right. This is a skip. That's right. Dude, please stop that. Oop, oh, hold on. Good. Good. I hate these birds so much. There we go. Holy shit. Okay. It's a lot riskier than it had to be, chat. Okay. Okay. Out of the way, fish. Out of the way, fish. Nice. And nice and safe. I'm playing super fucking safe right now, chat. Whoop. Those things are gonna be lethal right now. E please stop that. Holy shit, okay, we're good. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. Holy shit, why was that so fucking complicated? It did not need to be. Ow. Oh, my back doesn't crack. Yeah, don't you love how I grabbed extra health and almost died anyway? Alright, uh, please, more 
health on the farm. Thanks for stream. Thanks, uh, not for a while now. Good lord, I hate these bugs. I think I like these bugs, given bugs, but like. I gotta grab that ability. Ouch. Okay, playing super safe. God, I hate the climb. This is the worst climb in the game. Final boss right here, chat. Not the actual boss, but the climb. Soul play, welcome on in. Okay, ready? Welcome back from the ad, by the way. Chad, in case you missed anything, we're really just starting from the final boss right now. Like I said, we'll get to the boss. Yeah. I'm eating a lot of bats too, because these bats are assholes. Oh, we should be fine in a moment here. Alright, I think one more bit of health and we're good. Ow. Maybe not. Uh, maybe that's not good. Maybe. Uh, I can make do with this. Alright, let's. Uh, maybe a little more. Good. All our phones. Please go all our phones. Ah, for sugar. You know, Metroidvanias. This is like one of the only ones I play, funny enough. I'm not even really good at it, I'm okay at it. I was gonna sound so play, that would be doing good. Alright, chat, ready? Final boss time. Alright, showtime! Let's do this shit. This game scary? Can be. Scary when you realize it. It's based on a movie! Uh... Scary movie, The Mummy, 2017. And it didn't feature Brendan Fraser. It took almost an hour. Well, it's controller troubleshooting for a while. And, uh, this also includes setup time. So, we'll see what the ITT was by the end of this. I'll tell you right now, by the way, and you can agree with me or disagree with me. Ominet's a baddie. And like, I get it, man. Like, I, I get it. Like, I, I like my eternal soul, but like, you can't deny she's a baddie. She is? She absolutely is. Like, look at her. Like, I understand, like, I, I don't want her, I can't obviously, you can't let her take over the world, but would, yes, would. <laughs> Uh, Senate, not as much of a baddie. This guy is, uh... I mean, maybe some of you might be into him, chat. Not me. Uh, I'm not into giant heads. Uh, and also dudes. I'm not into dudes. Probably should have led with that one, but, uh... You get the point. My god, baddies, we are. Go. Ow, what the fuck? Actually, if I die, it's really bad. Good. Come on. 
Please die. Please die. Please die. How the fuck are you not dead yet? There you go. Thank you. It does have sticks. Absolutely better. Your girl offers to give you a giant head, but it's the god of the death. It's the god of death. Gets him every time. I know you tried. Ready? Absolute banger time. We're gonna we're gonna live by the way. We're gonna get this man out of here. Oh, we're happy with the runs. Happy with the games themselves. My stream ended up crashing during uh, right before Mad Father, which is a bit sad. But I mean, the games have been fun. I'm just a bit bummed out about the stream crash. It's never nice having a you know one of my days' progress is kind of be uh, a little bit wasted. I guess I feel wasted. Chat. I would absolutely uh, end the run now. However, it doesn't feel right if I don't go for a triumphant ending, right? We gotta go for it. You gotta have the fun music too. Like, it's going. GG! Woohoo! GG! Alright, chat, 7 out of 10 game. This game? Honestly, I think this game's a solid 4 out of 5. That's an A tier. It's absolutely not bad. It's kind of weird to put it. I'm not sure why I'd rank this under some of the little nightmares, though. It's kind of more of a gut feeling, if that makes sense. What it does, it does very well. It just, I mean, outside of damage abuse, there's not a whole lot of tech, I guess. You just sort of play the game. I like some of the... Oh, I know why. Uh, some of the fucking, like, skips kind of make the game, like, much harder as a whole. So, that's why. I know why. I know why. I can tell you, chat, this game is 4 out of 5. A tier. Is the limited order to the games? Yes and no. I'm going from older to newer. However, Thursday is going to be a bit of wild cards, because I'm letting Thursday have votes. So, um... Yeah, GG. Yep, that is, uh, what, seven? Seven out of, uh, more. Seven out of 160 or so. So. Ow. Anyway, uh, we can see the IGT if we want, chat. Do you want to see the IGT? I'm going to let it play out. 60? Yeah. Actually, this works. Uh, I'm not actually be dead rising. I don't need to play an ad, but uh, I do need to piss. So, uh, you'll see what the IGT is. Also, like Tom Hulin, who? I'm gonna go piss. Nick, you're in charge.
45 points. You know, not all that bad considering I had a controller swap part way through. Bear, let's show the spirits a bit. Well, this is a game that chat is quite literally a game that needs no introduction. Let's go. But thus, with a tier one for 19 months, enjoy the emotes and the scissors, and thank you. Hope you're doing good. And there are praying, you know, zombies praying on the car. It makes sense. A game that needs no introduction, chat. Dead Rising. Well, I mean, it's kind of funny that, like... So, chat, going into it, all the other games that I just did... Maybe Frog, I've been trying for five months, by the way. Frogs don't sound like that. Oh, of course. Frogs don't sound like that. Well, thank you. For the Prime Gaming for five months, showing the most of Thank you. So, every game I just did, right... Up to, up to Mummy Demastered, all of those games I did in 2017. All of them. This is the first game that when I started going full, like, you know, streaming consistently. This is the first game we did, chat, of new games that we decided to set sail on. Little Nightmares was done often, but for games that truly happened... Oh, it's right here, baby. And, uh... Yeah, from then on, goddamn chat. Uh, uh, Dead Rising has definitely earned its place at the table, which, by the way, we're not resetting and I already have terrible RNG. But we'll make it work. I'm glad, Labod Duster. I'm very glad for that. Now, uh, chat, in case you're wondering as well, you don't get a reset, you know, outside of hard world record grinds. Your ass has to play it. Alright, cool. Play it safe, by the way. You gotta find out how to make that consistent, baby. Or have saves and shit. Yep, it's been fun, Zexans. Dead Rising has done quite a lot for me. I definitely do not shy away from that. It's kind of funny because while I definitely have my roots in Clock Tower, I can't deny that Dead Rising is uh, probably the game that uh, can be most defined as me. I don't know how it happened, but a Dead Rising man. Nice little master. Wolf. It's a fun game. The bloody on the scissors is pretty good. The chat, I was talking about this game really quick. I wanted to run it for a long time, but I always mentioned that I would run it if a mod was found for time skip. And then, you know, the mod finally got more developed and uh, made, so... Um, yeah, we ended up uh, running Dead Rising 1. And from then, I haven't really looked back. A lot's happened in the Dead Rising community, and Dead Rising is funny enough, I, like, if Little Nightmare is a community that really showed me how segmented I feel, and, like, you know, all the other games showed me how, like, alone it is in speedrunning, Dead Rising is one of the only communities I actually feel like I'm actually a part of a community. It's kind of nice. I don't know. It's always been nice. I don't think I'm super involved all the time, but... I actually feel like I can talk with runners and I know who's doing what, like... Very ingrained in it, I suppose. And hell, all my earliest streams are Little Nightmares and Dead Rising. Those were the, the two big games I was doing back in 2018. Why are there two hunks of meat? What the fuck? Three hunks of meat! Why are there three hunks of meat? Alright. That's probably accurate. Hmm. One. Two. But, uh, yeah, I've done quite a lot to get, uh, Dead Rising 3, uh, to where it is. Well, not, there wasn't, there wasn't one to the way it is. Oh, it's absolutely, uh, killer runners these days, too, but... I did a lot of work for this game. I did a lot of the community. Yeah, Dead Rising 1 is um, probably one of the games I'm genuinely really good at. A 
Like, when I look at a lot of games, I do have to wonder how good or bad I am. And, like, you know, if we have Franbo earlier and me struggling to get a two-hour run on my last place time, Dead Rising is definitely the game where, like, yeah, I have a pretty confident, like, top five. Like, I probably should try to go back and PB again at some point, but the grind's pretty rough. But even then, that's kind of the beauty of it. I have thousands of runs in this game, or I think over a thousand at this point. I don't remember how many I had. I don't have like 2k yet. And hell, more shit just kept getting found in this game, and I always wanted to be uh, up to date to the latest shit. Alright, chat, ready? These days, this is what makes Dead Rising pretty awesome. Like, I think this is the thing that helped get into GDQ right here, too. That right there is pretty awesome. Nice and easy. That's called bike zip. You just kind of launch yourself across the plaza and then uh, you're back here. Little trick, right? Got jump kick, all right. Not bad. And then uh, time skip in action. But yeah, time skip is the move. I made a whole video talking about time skip, and it's a good video. I'm very glad I did it a while back. Is there an amount of time? I don't remember. A good amount of time. A good amount of time. I don't remember the exact amount, but it's a good amount. A thousand five hundred and twenty-four? That sounded about right. Thousand and a half. We'll go with that then. It's been a good amount, chat. It's wild to think about, too. Technically, it would, but none of these runs are counting for their official marks. Anyway, you know, chat, there is a faster strat I can do. But... How about we have one for the road? So, it would say 15 seconds to not do this, but, uh... I used to beat the shit out of this man with a hockey stick, and, um... You know... I missed it. Okay. Get eat puck, you fuck. Remember the vine? I want, by the way, that may have actually fucked up my shotgun route, but uh, it'll be fun. Well, it'll be alright, we'll walk it off. I got health, by the way. Alright. That's perfectly fine. Not good, but fine. By the way, Chad, in case you're wondering as well, dude, Dead Rising's easily top, like, 5 out of 5. Come on. Not even a question. This game's, uh, easily one of my favorite speedruns I do. It's a banger. Anyway, older up. Not bad. Only 755 out of the day. Well, shockingly enough, a lot of the games I really like. Like, it's kind of, I, I was looking at it, but. What's the word? A lot of my favorites tend to be pretty good. And I'm a self play in the 215 months. Enjoy the emotional decision. Thank you very much. Hope you're doing good. Lots of cheers. Also, this game just has it all. Like, I, with the inclusion of Bike Zip, I can confidently say this game's like S tier now. But 
What do you mean, Ricky Guitarist? Also, give me a skateboard and a pool. Damn, peace. Yeah, the hockey stick, uh, I mean, SMG's a lot faster these days, but I had to do the hockey stick. Like, come on. I haven't done it in so long. It was kind of nice. Come on. Oh, I don't get that at all. I never, again, the, chat, the only Metal Gear Solid game I've ever played was, uh, Revengeance. Uh, there's barriers, there's down patch version? No. It's all time based. Also, depends on when you're going. Boom. Boom. Nah, you need a cool emote for that. You gotta have a, someone with a katana. Any swords? Any have a sword emote? It is Zesmilion. How's it Orange? Morning to you. Hope you're doing good. That works. Yeah, see? That makes more sense. I thought it's not ripping. What are you ripping at that point? Oh, evil. Wait, we have evil. It's scissors. Thank you for drop first drop in for the car. Yeah, bombing run shit starts to close. At bombing run, you have to be very careful. Like that's a like specific like event based thing. Yeah, any uh, let's do a like, evil. Any evil spam. Basically evil. There's blood on those scissors too. Joker gets it. Because otherwise, what would you be ripping if you don't have something to rip? You do like Joel. Wife evil. That's fair. Uh, do I need a new board? Dude, my boarding is terrible right now. Playing nice and safe. This is rough. There we go. Oh no, Sophie's dead. Oh, was not sexually doing good today. Oh my god. Oh, I can't let you have to double that early. Happens. Anyway, chat, time for the most important part of the run. Spam McDicey Stare, because it's time to... I assure you, it's absolutely necessary. We had to, Chad. You gotta, gotta look right on in there. It's like looking at the sun. You gotta look directly at it. Morning, Candy Quartz. Let's play us nice and safe right now. You know, Chad, I saw the sunglasses from when I did the sunglasses, like... Which deal thing? I, I still haven't had the chance to look directly into the sun, but soon. Ooh, maybe I'll take him to uh, watch Barbie. Chat, I'm watching Barbenheimer. I'm watching Oppenheimer and then Barbie. Morning, you candy courts. I think the order I got, by the way, chat. Ew? What do you mean, ew? Which one, Oppenheimer or Barbie? It's two movies. In like six hours of the theater? I mean, I don't mind it. Double feature, baby. I'm taking a day off for a chat. I'm gonna, I'm gonna wake up, start my morning with a cup of, cup of coffee. Uh, cup of coffee and a cigarette. 
Then afterward, I'm gonna just uh, down a fucking glass of uh, whiskey. And then I'll watch Oppenheimer. Uh, after that, I'm gonna get brunch. Get some mimosas in there. And then I'll watch Barbie. After Barbie, White Claws and uh, chilling. Alright, so good. I'm gonna watch it. I'm actually uh, dead watching Barbie. Why, well, Metagalax? You don't like Ryan Gosling? I like Ryan Gosling. I watch a lot of movies he does. Yeah. You're more than welcome to not enjoy it, but, uh, yeah. It's not, it looks like fun. I don't know. Kind of down. I like Michael Sarah. I like Ryan Gosling. For the foot fans, they get to stare at, uh, what's the word? Number one on Wiki Feet. There's a lot to have there, chat. <laughs> Alright, good to know, Moose. Good to know. Chat, Margot Robbie is number one on Wikifeet. I'm pretty sure that she just makes it in all of her contracts that she has to show her feet. She's like a perfect uh, match with Quentin Tarantino. Uh, I'm tired of something about to you. I mean, that sounds fun, but also, I, I, dude, Ryan Gosling's fun. I like that guy. He's a cool guy. Coffee and a cigarette? I think it's called a finished breakfast, Tech and Andrew. It's depressing. I think that's a finished breakfast, right? Like, I've seen, I've seen a picture of it once. It's just uh, coffee and a cigarette. Yes? Yeah. You gotta hit the bleak, the bleakest breakfast you can think about. Which, it's the finished breakfast, chat. Coffee and a cigarette. That That is the saddest breakfast you can have. And it's not like, um, you know, nothing. Am I addicted to nicotine? I didn't. It's just the saddest breakfast you can have to watch Oppenheimer. Because you gotta start with the bleak reality of the world and then going into the fun. Yeah, I mean, I'll say right now though, Medic Alex, like, you don't have to watch Barbie if you don't want to. It's your prerogative. Also, I, I, I'll, I'll go against the grain of chat and say, I definitely don't think you should waste money watching a movie you don't want to watch. You know? But, yeah, I have no problem watching it. Sounds like fun. Yeah, it's nothing to do Oppenheimer and a Barbie. I also watched Morbius three times in a row. I don't think my movie-going habits are exactly going to be uh, any lower than they are. And then the last time I did a double feature, I watched uh, Mario Bros. and Scream 6, which they don't really go together, but I, I wanted to watch it. Is Morbin out? Well, it was free on Twitch.tv when people were illegally streaming it. Is the guy dead? I mean, more power to him. I'm not gonna, like... They don't feel comfortable with that. That's fine with me. I mean... I'm, I'm, I always ask why, but admittedly, chat, like... If they're not comfortable wanting to watch it or they don't want to, that's their prerogative, yeah. You were streaming on Twitch? Absolutely, yeah. Like, obviously, you know, sounds like that can get ruder and ruder, but, yeah, it's not Chad's job to moderate that. It's the moderator's job to moderate that. You're not a moderator, unnatural. So. Also, not everyone's comfortable with the color pink. Not everyone wants to rock the color pink. That's, that's fine. For those of you who do enjoy it, I'm excited. Not say right now. I'm excited for red. Law chat's positive. Oh, absolutely, Ricky Guitars. Streams an artifact. I don't think they're gonna stream Barbie and Oppenheimer in artifact. Oh, it bombed twice, and I love that car stuff. It's hilarious. Exactly. Uh, I was going to go to college and go to trend, I love pink. Yeah, that happened a lot in my final shark, actually. Well, I mean, not that specific scenario. More the, um, what's the word? 
I, I come in because I don't want to make it seem like, oh, yeah, it happens every other two things. It's more of the, um, yeah, a lot of people have a uh, complicated relationship with colors. One more fan. Thank you very much for the, uh, what's the word? Sub going to JGO. It's much appreciated. One more fan. I'll be doing good. I mean, it is a thing, child. A lot of people embrace different colors and, like, you know, they feel, they feel weird about colors. These days, I don't know. I'm pretty confident with what I want to wear. For the most part. I think I wear what I think might be cool. And for Bob, for Barbie, I'm probably, I'm not gonna wear pink. I'll probably just wear red, because I have a Hawaiian shirt I want to wear. What, chat, what do I wear for Oppenheimer? I just dress normal. That's my question, I don't know. Student tie? I don't have an Amelia on me. Trench coat? I don't have one. 30 S suit? I have a suit, but I don't want to wear it. I guess suit jacket and Hawaiian suit would make sense, because then I can open it up. You're not interesting enough to dress up for a movie? Well, you just have fun with it. That's amazing, Sator. I'm a guy on the internet. The amount of people who care what I will wear going to the watch Barbenheimer is very minimal. Ah, oh, no, that'll be fun to rock like a suit to Barbenheimer and that. Oh, but to uh, Oppenheimer and then, uh. Oh, hold on. Dude, what the fuck was that? It was a fall, by the way. Going to refrain from offering. What, what, would you, what would you recommend, Iris? Why are you refraining? I don't have a brimmed hat chat, I have a beanie. Either formal suit or something gothic and dark. I normally dress very grungy if that counts, so tell me normally be available for that. Is there a vest? I don't want to wear a vest. Outside path to time skip? This is time skip. Time skip new game. It's the most common category I've done in this game, chat. Like, as much as I love all bosses, you know this had, this couldn't be anything else. This had to be time skip new game. The amount of work put in this category is immense. So. There wasn't any other option that could have been done here. Yep. Goth, uh, bar in the movie, you have no pink. I have Hawaiian shirts. They're not really pink. They're more just tropical. But I can channel my inner Kennergy yet. That's the plan. Ah, dude. Ah, my nose is like weird. It's like hollow. You have two pieces of pink clothing. In fairness, chat, we are a part of a horror community and a horror stream. The amount of people here who have dedicated pink clothing, my, I, I don't imagine it would be a large amount. Like, statistically, a lot of you probably dress like goth kids. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not saying it's exclusive to that, but statistically, it's probably accurate. Don't call you out. I'm calling out a lot of you. Me included. I'm just very grungy. I'm the follow, by the way. You get a rough estimate? No. Because uh, I have over 160 games, and I don't know how long it's going to be. I haven't gone goth. Nothing wrong with that. But I acknowledge that I do exclusively horror games, and, uh, or, you know, primarily horror games, and, uh... That would probably mean the demographic of people watching the stream are probably into a lot of horror media, which would mean they're probably, um, into goth aesthetics to a good degree. I spin on the Barbie games? No, because I don't want to.
Or one day tree on the side. That sounds like fun. That's true horror? No, it's not. Barbie's the exact opposite of horror. It's actually pretty, I don't know. Nice. In the most black you seem to wear. I'm wearing a blue flannel. Damascus? That's very much a blind fire. But it's always fun watching someone be able to go through them. It's nice. You're following the stream? Oh, my OBS crashed. I've been streaming for eight hours, Special K. Uh, it says right over there, eight hours. My stream crashed, so. It's actually pretty sad. Uh, my viewership ended up dropping by uh, 1,000 viewers. Meaning, yes, I was actually... Uh, we were like uh, 1,800 earlier and it dropped, which was... Uh, yeah. I've been reminded pretty much every time someone's brought it up. Oh no? Yeah. So. As in reviewers, I mean, in all honesty, I'm gonna go with the classic saying, Chat, I don't deserve jack shit. My entire life has been a series of perseverance and overcoming. You gotta make your way there, I suppose. There we go. One of the bleak things, but it's accurate. Yes, I'm aware of the stream. I'm aware of the stream crash. I don't need to be reminded every five minutes. I appreciate the sentiment, Special Cab. But I'm very harsh to myself. I want to do better, and you know, I want to, I want to strive for greatness. I don't want to just. I don't want to feel entitled. I never want to feel entitled on anything. Thank you. I'm glad you I'm glad you enjoy the stream. I enjoy my own salmon hatchery. A salmon hatchery does sound nice. Isabella, you're fucking up. Well, it's more the fact that I've quite literally had to, uh, like I said, persevere, um... A while. I kind of mentioned it, but when I went full time streaming, I thought things would get easier, and if anything, it just got harder. Isabella, you are awful, and I want you to know that. God damn, I hate Isabella. You are terrible. Did I play White Day? No, White Day doesn't come until later. I'm doing the games in chronological. Isabella, what the fuck are you doing? Oh my god, dude, what the fuck? What the fuck is that? So, what? what? I don't... What, what? Did I... What? A little bit. She is. Alrighty. This is probably rough. Good lord, this game I was saving out. No, you have to make manual saves. I have one man. God damn it! Uh, shit, I had a feeling I should have saved it. That's a lock. My run just went to total shit. I do not know that, no. It happens with the best of us. Well, back to case two. Wow, I'm doing the whole game again. Literally all of it. That's fun. Uh, that's fun. I mean, Chad, realistically, the amount of things that have gone wrong today have been pretty high.
cool. Okay, yeah, Isabella really... Uh, that happens. Our problems out day one? I don't know if that's the case. If anything, it feels like a horrible trend of the way things are going to be going. I'm not going to lie, I don't think it's getting all the problems out day one. It seems like it's just a ramping scale of problems. Like, my stream crashed, uh, some of the arcade crashed. This game's fucking up. So, I mean... Yeah. So. Cool. Well. I hate Isabel so much, man. It's been about six years. And, um... Isabella has never gotten better in those six years. So, I watched the RE Death Island movie today? Probably not. I'm probably gonna study more and, uh, I don't know, get ready for tomorrow's games because tomorrow's gonna have course party. And I don't study course party, tomorrow's gonna be absolute hell, so I gotta do that. I'm not gonna lie, Chad, I'm kind of a workaholic, and, um... I put in a lot of work to make this show go. That's my bad. But yeah, I mean, realistically, Chad, I can't remember the last time I had anything I have done gone without a hitch. I feel like everything I've done has had a hitch in some degree. Also, our other streamers would have, like, sympathies and, like, oh, I'm sorry, I tend to get laughed at for my mistakes or my misgivings. Literally, anything I get went wrong, there's always someone just laughing at me, which is always kind of just... Yeah. And for most people, I didn't say that much. Like, I feel like lately I'm kind of getting slews of bad luck this whole year that have not really gone away, like, since the year started. Our work shows. Our work only do so much for you. There's a lot that kind of just goes wrong. I'm not sure like Chad's patronizing me. That's arguably more annoying than getting made fun of. I'd rather you just insult me at that point. Talking down to me is not going to do any better, Special K. Okay? Eh, there's never seen the internet and people who watch the stream routinely. Like... First time viewer makes fun of me, that's one thing, but like, I don't know, having dedicated regulars who then laugh when my stream crashes isn't very nice. Right, but I think the thing is, though, it's missing the point. The point I'm making is, it's I don't care about randoms insulting me. That happens all the time. It happens literally daily. Now, does it take a while? Yes. So. Oh, thank you, Mabino. Oh, that'll be awesome. Admittedly, a lot's been going wrong, uh... Today, and yesterday, and the day before that, and the week before that, and really the whole year. There's not a lot that really goes right. 
Feels like it goes right. When it does go right, it's quickly removed. So. Nope. You just do it and hope you get, uh, hope you get by. Crack blind fire. Oh, so man, things don't really change the fact of the matter that I've had to quite literally redo like five games today. Also, my board's already broken to shit. Thank you, Monster. I hope you enjoy it. I still can't believe I got bonked by the skateboard. I was right next to health, too, is the sad part. I could have saved it. There was a few. I had a few options I could have done. I could have played it better, but I don't know. This is off to an awful start. The list of all games I'm doing, exclamation mark speed run. And then probably remove like six of them. Yeah, not gonna lie though, Chad. Um, this has been an awful start. The more I think about it, like today's been like, I've had some of the worst like RNG I've ever had in some of these games. Some of the worst mistakes I've ever eaten before. There I go. And the zombies will do that. Besides the marathon being an uphill battle, realistically, Mecha Mecha Shark, everything's kind of been an uphill battle this whole year. And telling totally last year, technically. It's been an uphill battle for a while. My whole life could be defined that way. It's kind of a, a brief history of having to work. Alright, cool. And Isabella is so terrible. Oh god, the real question though is what? I've had I'm gonna have about eight games done after about nine hours. That's fucking an awful ratio, goddamn. Uh, it's not a meltdown, so there's a printer Wi Fi when we connect, and use old computers and everything. I want you to paper. That's a pain in the ass, sorry. Plan on learning anything new? I. I. Like, what do you mean? Like. Like, during the marathon? No. I'm doing every game I've already learned. Like, this is a revisit. And the most recent game I learned was My Friendly Neighborhood, which I learned Thursday. So, um. No. That was a game. I liked it. It was fun. Anything uh, new coming up? No? Mainly because I'm going to be doing this the whole time. Yeah... I just get really tired, Ricky, though. It's a lot of, um... What's the word? Pretty much, I've been told several times today they admire- people admire my perseverance, meaning that people can see that shit's going to hell. Like... Call it what you want it to a degree. I imagine some of you on chat are definitely, um... Oh, he's just bitching. But, uh... Yeah, a lot of people have told me they admire my perseverance for them. 
Which, good chunk of them being either involved in speedrunning or um, streaming in general. I've gotten the shit end of almost every stick today somehow. Not every stick, I suppose, but like... Yeah. Oh, Cinewai, don't you know? I don't have human emotions. I'm, uh, I'm a robot, apparently. Uh, I want to? Uh, it depends. It's weird what you're allowed to complain about what you're not allowed to complain about. A nice sex bot? No. Alright, let's not make it back here. Oh, hey, by the way, chat, I have to play that now, because I timed it to where I wouldn't die. So, um, I guess I'll play an ad during Bomb Collector. If you want to avoid the ad, uh, ad block, sub to the channel, or Twitch Turbo. I forgot all about it, but, uh, actually, let's do it after Bomb Collector. Yeah, after Bomb Collector, I need to play an ad because I thought that maybe I wouldn't kill the run and have to do it all again. So, after Bomb Collector, ad. Got it. Thanks, you have Dead Rising? I don't know. We'll see how I feel. I'm kind of tempted to not do that, but, I mean, it probably wouldn't be a bad idea, but we'll see. Fine enough, chat. I don't wear my heart on my sleeve. I am i don't tell chat almost anything. It just obviously, you know, things happen. I'm gonna mention what is actively happening, but no, chat, I don't tell you half what's going on with me. I don't tell anyone half what's going on with me. I don't need a break. I mean, uh, this run's already shit, so it's already ending on a bad run. It's fun. That's a fun game, Piss, right? Can okay, you watch it? I have no idea. But it's a new Resident Evil movie. Okay, better bomb collector at least. Yeah, I, I'm not burning out. I don't need a break either. I'd rather not be a. Uh... I'm not gonna lie, chat. A lot of uh, a lot of self care advice tends to sound more patronizing than it is. I know chat does not mean to do it, but it really comes off that way. Anyway, now I need to play an ad because, um, well, I thought the run wouldn't be total shit, but, uh, yeah, I kind of got unlucky, didn't I? So, ad's about to play. Uh, it's Isabella's section. You're missing quite literally nothing because Isabella is terrible. So, uh, Avalox out of the channel or Twitch Turbo. Those are, those are your options. I'll probably play in a moment here. I keep the board alive. You should give me that. Oh, yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Fuck it. God damn, let me throw. This is getting worse. I say, I mean, a break advice might be helpful. It's like, okay, back in the house or something, all that stuff doesn't help. Well, also, Chad, that's kind of the idea as well. This is my full-time job, and that taking a break means the death of literally everything I do. It is cool. Also, we need to get a class father. Uh, 
Uh, it's about hearing me so slaying it here. It's Ashley plans very astonishing. Again, I like Ashley because I know what a... Well, hold on. I know what a good escort mission is like. Ashley is really good. I don't know why he'll bitch about Ashley. She is more than fine. I wish half the eyes in video games were like Ashley. She is literally a queen. I say that very sincerely. Ashley is the best of them. And with the fall, by the way. No, it's not even ironic. There's a reason why I'm saying it. Like, it's very accurate what I'm saying. Yeah. Awesome. God damn. It doesn't. Uh, it can do possibly two shot them. It's kind of RNG. Oh, I see. My favorite part about Resident Evil, by the way, is that you barely spend half the game with Ashley. Isabella, please don't be fucking awful this time. I like how they get health or stock this time, also making it worse. Also, Isabella is being the worst absolute version of herself she can be right now. Holy fuck. Like I said, Chad, it has been six years and Isabella has learned nothing. There you go. Hey, I think you're back from the ad. Welcome back from the ad. Anyway, chat, like I was saying, though, I don't really get to take a break. I've never had the ability to take a break. In the past, maybe, um... currently 28 oh yeah 28 in the last 15 years or so I have not had the ability to take a break Uh, during the marathon, everything has been going to absolute hell, and I've had some of the worst RNG in a variety of games I've been playing. It's a, it's a miracle that I haven't just ended the stream yet and quit uh, streaming for the day. I wasn't wrong with that, so I'll be doing good. My stream crashed, uh, sound of the arcade ended up uh, having an issue where I accidentally alt-tabbed, and if you alt-tab, the entire run dies. Uh, and it did it because I clicked uh, off the screen entirely on accident. Um... This game, I had uh, one of the rarest deaths I've ever eaten because Isabella decided to be uh, terrible. And yeah. I take time off. Yeah. Well, the problem with streaming pips, right, is as a streamer, like if you take a break, y you die. Any momentum you start building is gone. Like, you have to take very particular breaks, very scheduled breaks. You can't really fuck off for a week or anything like that. Like, my old job, I can, I don't know, go on vacation. Travel. Now, anything I do is very just... Go, 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 go. So, yeah, that was the downside. 
Uh, it's retired so the list and goes to you when you're doing more. Admittedly, I don't do bad self-employed, but like, yeah, I'm definitely gonna complain. Like, I literally don't know how to find it outside of I got unlucky. Yep. Oh, then there's a bunch of things as well, Chad. There's never any promise of what I do. It's weird what games work and what games don't. As well, I kind of miss the joys of things like lunch. Lunch was a good time, Chad. You have a time of the day, about an hour, go get food. Talk off for an hour. Oh, an hour? Well, I will get an hour for lunch. I'll try about got an hour for lunch, yeah. They actually didn't want me taking short lunches because they don't want to pay me overtime, I don't think. So, I had to take an hour lunch. Oh god, I can't believe I essentially did two runs of Dead Rising. Now let's see, by the end of day one chat, I am currently uh, down by two games. The more I'm thinking about it. You take your 215s? Oh, the 15 minute break's different than lunch. Your runs, your crash at the end. Uh, well, let's see. Yeah, I'm down by two runs. What ended up happening was Sound of the Arcade crashed right at the end. And Dead Rising uh, ended up uh, killing me right at the end. Because Isabella is terrible. And I got really unlucky. My dumbass didn't think I needed a save. So essentially, I did two more runs in games I didn't have to do two more runs of. As well, tomorrow's looking bleak for some of the games. Tomorrow might be one of the hardest days we do. Big, yeah. Yeah. Also, my stream crashed Ashiaka, so I had to take care of that. I kinda got hit with every single bad thing that could happen, I guess. Alright, come on. Which games do tomorrow? Well, depending on how we feel about right now, I might start at Sonal 2 or I might start at Fatal Frame. One of the two. Did I hear that? Well, the funny part is it actually started pretty nice. We're like, you know, like we had some fun moments in the stream. We got a couple of raids. Uh, it just, uh, a lot of joy kind of goes away when you, uh, like, I, I guess this is a very specific problem. And, uh, how do I put this? Obviously, I understand the fact that, you know, plenty of people would be happy on Twitch to stream to 900 people. I am fully grateful of that fact, and thank you, chat. But it's more the idea that, in the same vein, I don't think most people on Twitch are going to see a 1,000 viewer drop in the span of a minute. I was wrong about that. I hope you're doing good. Honestly, I didn't hate Frambo as much as I thought I would. Frambo is actually kind of fun. So, um, yeah. Things happened an hour earlier. Let's see the option. I don't get that option. Oh, I, don't, I don't get any option, chat. I, I'm here the whole time. My controller is also perma vibrating. It's all good. Or to get to nine viewers and maintain nine hundred. Well, the funny part about guitarists is that uh, essentially we're playing at a disadvantage that we normally would be. Because before this, we we're at one thousand eight hundred. So realistically, uh, we should be higher today. 
And the sole fact, the reason why I went down was uh, entirely out of my control, which is quite sad. Now that's also the reason why I'm kind of bummed. Like... That's a gut punch, man. At least Dead Rising's almost done. That's a bummer. I mean... At the very least, I didn't end stream on day one. I definitely, if ending early, I'd have felt absolutely depressed. I'll manage. I'll manage. But yeah, if I had to kill day one early, that would have been so fucking depressing. I would have, uh, like... The whole thing may have been a wash if I decided to end early there. Better days to come. You see, I've been saying that for the whole year, and, um... I'm waiting on those better days. Anyway, GG. Also, let's pause the timer for a moment, maybe. Do we want to do Sonal 2 today? Sonal 2 tomorrow could be a good opener. How many days do you plan on this marathon being? Uh, I don't know. Until it's done. Alright, there's time skip chat. Hold on, hold on. Let's see. Also, just for fun chats, just for funsies. Before Dead Rising's actually done, how about we do this? Because one thing important about Dead Rising is how much I love doing this. Uh, it's Tuesday? Explain to Terra. Oh, uh, I get what you mean. It, uh, server's down, right? It's definitely a fun one. Let's go. Chat, you know damn what we're doing. This is a special save I have. My favorite part about Dead Rising absolutely had to be this. Being able to do this on the GDQ stage and show people this in general has been kind of amazing. I mean, it was fun, chat. This is one of the reasons I wanted to run Dead Rising so badly, too. I thought it was fucking hilarious. I keep a save file on hand to always show this to people. I think Clock Tower H ending is a little treat. We'll do this as a little treat. It'll be fun. Anyway, chat, as well, like I was saying, reviewing each game. We'll talk about each game at the end of the stream. But, uh, talk about this game, 5 out of 5. Easy. S-tier speedrun right here, baby. Out of the opinions I have about my games, I think this game is S-tier. Really? Oh, you'll see. Exactly, Crucible. You don't have aim too much? Nah. I'm very lenient. Dude, what a good fight so far. Hold on. Ow. Dead. He's dead. Got him. Yeah, you just spit on him and then he dies. 
I did so much damage. Uh, I actually made a video about this. Uh, type exclamation mark spit. But long story short, it is a drink uh, you use in the game called Spitfire that does a base amount of damage, and it uh, it's really good on new game because, you know, doing a good chunk of damage is better than not having the really strong level 50 melee. Yep. I made a video as well, spitting on every boss. It is the best YouTube video I've ever made, apparently. Anyway, if you're really wondering why I wanted to do this, it, I wanted to play out an ending for Dead Rising because I didn't play out an ending. So I want an actual ending. The De Dead Rising drinks video is really good. I like the drinks. Uh, DR drinks. Drinks. I really hope the, dr uh, the drinks video could be better, but... Yeah, I guess I'll have to download the VODs now, chat, and hopefully I can highlight them or, you know, edit them. But I kind of want this to be on YouTube so I can begin the saga. No Huamo fan. They actually nerfed Spitfire later in the franchise, which is sad. Uh, I will say... I actually have worked a little bit on a video of part two for that, for Dead Rising 2. Uh, but the problem is I never got around to finishing it, and it's actually a pain in the ass to do. So, um, yeah. <sighs> Alrighty. Chat, I think this is a good call for day one. But before we go, oh, well, first of all, let me fix Dead Rising. Alright, chat. So, day one, let's talk about our games really quick. Alrighty here. Is there a way I could bring a live split? Uh, hold on. Uh, let me pause the timer. Here we go. What we have is... I'm gonna do it like that. Let's, let's do it like that right there. We have completed... Clock Tower, Rambo, Sound of the Homecoming, Soul of the Arcade, Mad Father, all Nightmares, Mighty Mastered, and Dead Rising. In total, that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight games in a little under nine hours. Now, this would have been faster if I wasn't dumb, because Dead Rising, I essentially did two runs of, uh, and as well, Sound of the Arcade, I did two runs of. I got kind of unlucky. Uh, also, we had a stream crash, but that's not the end of the world. I think this is a fun way of doing it, right? We do a little bit of analyzing, we take a look at things. Uh, starting tomorrow, we're probably going to be hopping into Silent Hill immediately. Uh, and then, uh, what do we got tomorrow? I'll show you what we got tomorrow before we leave. This will be fun, by the way. So, tomorrow we have Silent Hill 2, Outlast, Fatal Frame, RE1 Remake, uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. Oh, God. Oh, ew. Ew. Wait, what the fuck is this? Hold on. One hour, about ten minutes, about, let's say half an hour. About an hour and a half. That's about three hours. Uh, about an hour... About four hours, maybe four and a half. Uh, oh, God, oh, God, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, God, ew, what is tomorrow? What the fuck is this shit? Day two is gross. Ew. Yeah, you know what? Silent 2 begins tomorrow, absolutely. Holy shit. Tomorrow sucks. In the graveyard, I have. All right, chat. So tomorrow we're gonna be going. To, we have a, we have some we have some choices tomorrow, I should say. I'll be adding more games this as well for Wednesday's stream. But um, Five Nights at Freddy's is like that two minute run. It's a me. I, this is the meme game again. Some are games are long, some are not. Uh, chat. Let's review our games before we end for the day, though. Clock Tower, four to five, bang! A great opener, a great way to start the stream. Frambo, 2 out of 5. I like the game more than I thought I would, though, and I'll probably run Frambo Fran again more later. Homecoming, 5 out of 5. Game's a banger, you know it, I know it. Sound of the Arcade, 2 out of 5. This game sucks, and it's a pain in the ass to run. Mad Father, 3 out of 5. It is painfully average. It's all movement-based and a lot of dialogue skipping. It is okay. Little Nightmares, 5 out of 5. I think Little Nightmares is actually pretty great. I generally think it's a great speedrun entirely. Mighty Master, 4 out of 5. Great speedrun, but the speed tech kind of makes the casual game hell, which is not a fun thing for the game. So, while it is good, there's some problems. Dead Rising, 5 out of 5, you know it. Isabella sucks, but come on. Dead Rising, 5 out of 5, easily. S tier. So, that's your rankings of day 1, chat, so. Making it over to day 2. I'm wondering, can I save these splits? 845.56. Let's go with that, okay? 845.56. Uh, let's save these. 